Hello. Hello, hello. Welcome in, everyone. Happy Friday. <laughs> Thank you, Leasu. Is that is that how would I say your say your username? Uh, thank you for the follow. Welcome in. <laughs> you make my cavities hurt. <laughs> how is everyone doing? I'm doing all right today. I've had a pretty tired week. I didn't really do much, but just felt pretty exhausted. I had, you know, I had my debut on Sunday, which kind of ended up rolling into Monday. A very long, a very long stream back. It was it totaled to like eight hours, which is in insane, but lots of fun. Oh gosh, and it's like I just starting stream today. I was kind of nervous because I was like, it's been forever since I streamed, even though I, I technically just streamed like four or five days ago. <laughs> Uh, it, it's, it's gonna take some getting used to again. Hello! Hi, Mama! Welcome in! How you doing? How you doing? <laughs> I was just talking, I was just talking about how I've had a long, tiresome week, but, you know, getting, getting back into the groove of streaming. Wow, sick overlay. Thanks! <laughs> I've always, I've always had this overlay, but I just kind of spruced it up a bit. For, uh, I found the overlay on Etsy, and then uh, I added my custom-made background to kind of fit into it. But yeah, it's very, it's very nice. Thank you. Um, I did before debut. I was like, oh, maybe I should change my overlay, and I found a similar one, just in a maybe different color palette. But I ended up not liking it, and I, I ended up just keeping this one. Yeah, it reminds me, uh, me. It reminds me Edie? Edie? <laughs> Ooh, big typo. <laughs> I imagine I was like, what what's the typo? Ne needy girl overdose. What? There's a game? Needy girl overdose. Oh my god. I mean I am needy. <laughs> we we have that we have that in common. But I'll I'll look that up. I know there's there is that other one game. I seen around. I don't know if that's the actual name, but yeah. And how is your day going, Mama? How's everyone's day? I also had a, a very average, <laughs> average morning. I worked on um, some more things for future streams. Had Katsu, Katsu, uh, not Katsu. What am I thinking? I had, I had a Japanese curry and rice for brunch. And then uh, I wanted to keep on working on things, fiddling around, and then I, I realized it was almost stream time. And then <laughs> it's really hard to kind of force myself to stop working and then get back into it. But I, I gotta, I made, I made my schedule. I gotta, I gotta stick to it. But I could always go, go back to continue working on stuff after stream. I was working and then rewatched Marry My Husband with Rian and ate food. Now I'm back to work. Yay, that's wonderful, wonderful. Make sure to save. <laughs> uh oh, I'm frozen. <laughs> oh there we go. But you what is it? Are you are you like caught up, caught up? Like are you on episode ten now with us? I'm sorry, I'm sorry for last night for spoiling. <laughs> For spoiling, so I didn't mean to. Usually I'm really good with spoilers, but my brain, I was tired. I was tired last night. <laughs> uh, Shadow Whelm. Hello, Shadow. Welcome in. I don't know why I read your name out loud. I just saw it. <laughs> uh, yeah, we're on, we're on 10. You're on 8? Yay. That means two more episodes. Two more episodes to go, and then we'll be all cut up, and we can watch together. Shadow Whelm, who's this guy? No, no, it's just been, it's just been a bit, Shadow. I can never forget you. You're the first shadow in my stream. Uh, okay, okay, soon, soon we can catch up. Yes, yes, we have until next Monday and Tuesday. How's your day, Shadow? Me and Mama are talking about uh, K-drama that we're watching. 
I was here when you debuted, though it was super late for me. I know, I saw you pop in. Thank you for joining for my debut. I didn't mean to make it super late, but I, I I wanted it a bit late just so if I had any last minute tweaks, I could do it beforehand. E and even then, this, you know, there was still scuff. <laughs> still scuffy wuffies, but it's okay. Uh, I'm going to pester you about your Discord server later to see if you need any help. Shadow, are you in the Discord? I'm still working on it, but I can send you an invite. Uh, aside from that, I've been horrible. You've been horrible? I'm sorry to hear that. I'm so sorry to hear that. But yeah, mom, when you, when you catch up, I think hopefully Mary catches up as well, because Mary is also on episode 8. And then I told her too that probably, hopefully she could catch up by Monday and we can watch it together. Sadly, Lyra, Lyra got sucked into Persona, so I, I think it'll be a while before she watches uh, Marry My Husband again. I can send you a link, Shadow. I don't remember if you're in my Discord. Hmm. I'm gonna, I'm gonna send a message. Let me know if it works or not. Oh, I just, I just posted the link. Does that work? See if that works. And let me know if you're in. And then I'll delete the secret code. Also, hello anyone that happens to be watching on YouTube. I am trying to, uh, you know, take advantage of simulcasting. I realize it's a lot of on OBS and my computer, but I want to try it out. Nah, it doesn't work. Oh, it's probably an old link, an old link. Here, let me see if I could get you a more up-to-date one. But thank you for, for wanting to help and, you know, I really appreciate it, Shadow. Uh, let's see, invite. Let me get a link, let me get a link. Okay. You could try that one. You could try that one, Shadow. I'm gonna, yeah. Yeah, and that that still that still means a lot, you know. It's you're you're taking your time, your effort to put aside to help me. Yeah. I I kind of I, I had one day where I was just on Discord the whole time, and I was just looking on YouTube, searching how to do things. So the Discord I would say is like 90, 98 percent done. No, maybe maybe not ninety eight. Maybe seventy five. There's just a lot of other rules and texts and stuff I want to add just to. To spruce it up, make it nice, make it beautiful. I'm I'm also just um, you know, I, I not a perfectionist, but I would like it to at least be uh close to complete. <laughs> so then I don't have to worry about missing rooms or things or you know ha running into speed bumps of people not being able to join rooms or threads or anything like that. You made it. Welcome in. Uh, yeah, we can talk about what you want to add uh, at a later time to see if I can add any additional thingies. Yes, yes, yes. Uh, my current situation is, um, so StreamCord works with, uh, you know, alerting everyone that I'm live, but because I want to also stream on YouTube more, uh, I need to find a good bot that alerts for YouTube. So if anyone knows that, Carlbot, Carlbot's weird. Like... It posted, it posted one of my, like when I put the schedule for my live, but it didn't post when I was live. <laughs> so I'm, I'm just trying to run around with different bot alternatives. Different alternatives, that is all. And uh, yeah, and even, even like just bots that help me notify people that I've uploaded on TikTok, on, on YouTubes, everything like that. Thank you for lurking, Scorpion. <laughs> yes, yes. But today we will be playing the murder of Sonic the Hedgehog. Who murdered him? Who done did it? <laughs> I thought it would be a nice uh, chill game to get back into. Typically on Fridays, I like to stream Fortnite, uh, Dead by Daylight, or Texas Chainsaw Massacre. Uh, just to start off the weekend with some fun, but I found out from debut that V Bridger is not a fan of <laughs> V Bridge is not a fan of uh, Fortnite, so I need to figure that out. So until then, um, also because I'm a bit tired this week, we'll ju we're just gonna do some chill chill games 
and we're saving uh, Fortnite DVD Texas Chainsaw for Saturday, and then we'll be back to a more chill game on Sunday. It was the rings all along. Maybe. Part of me thinks it's like, you know, maybe it's just Eggman, but then I also wouldn't mind if there's like a twist and it's like something else. <laughs> Honestly, he got what he deserved. He speed ran life for real. <laughs> Shadow, Shadow really just wants Sonic dead. Dead. No. <laughs> Does anyone have any favorite Sonic characters? Growing up, I was an Amy girl. I know a lot of people like don't like her or something or they find her annoying and you know, they kind of compare her to like Sakura from Naruto, but I love I love Sakura from Naruto and I love Amy. They're both they're both beautiful pink powerful women. So, and and there's nothing wrong with being in love. There's nothing wrong with feeling love. So, I I like I like Amy and uh, I also like Shadow. Shadow is my favorite character as well. I also thought it was funny and kind of a uh, cuz I didn't plan it at all. Like I was just like, "Oh, this is a game I downloaded it and I never got to it." <laughs> and then there's all that news about the new Sonic X Shadow game. <laughs> I see all over Twitter and I, I I jumped on I jumped on that tag for real for real. Uh, I love how Shadow the Hedgehog uh, cocks an assault rifle like a shotgun. Oh, is it that game where he has a gun and a motorcycle? I always wanted to try that game. <laughs> He, he runs fast. Why does he need a motor vehicle? It makes no sense. <laughs> also, I hope no one minds today that uh, I brought me a little, a tiny little bowl of candy to, to munch on when I get a little tired, a little snacky, just uh, so that the sugar helps me stay up a bit, you know? Uh, I have, uh, I'm assuming there'll be a lot of reading for this game, and I brought water as well. So I'll be I'll be taking sips <laughs> from all all the talking. <laughs> yes, I need energy. I need my my life force, which is candy, sugar. My cute sis is on, and my cute sis is here. Hello, cutie. Happy Friday! <laughs> Thank you for stopping in. I know it's uh getting late for you. Happy uh not happy. <laughs> Congratulations again on getting partner. Everyone say congrats to my older sister Cupy. Clap, clap, clap. I don't have a clap. Uh, I don't have a clap toggle, but I'm clapping with my real hands. <laughs> clap, 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 clap. Uh. Yay, yay! Congrats to Cupy. It's it's amazing. I, I you know Cupy Cupy has worked really hard, and uh, I'm happy that all her hard work has paid off into being partner. Yay! Yippee! <laughs> Yippee! <laughs> exactly, Shadow. Yippee for my sister. Yippee! <laughs> Those were all for you, Cupy. <laughs> Did you get anything uh, up to anything today, Cupy? Me and Mama were talking about a uh, K drama that we're watching with Rian and uh, Mia. Lyra was also on that train, and so was Mary. And then uh, me and Shadow were talking about um, Discords and Sonic the Hedgehog. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah. Thank you for claiming first, Shadow. Thank you for asserting your dominance over everyone. Food and work. I saw you guys were watching. I need to hop on the train. Yes, hop on the train. You need to binge it. We're, uh, what is it? There's eight, there's 10 episodes out now. And then I'm all, I'm all down for rewatching. That series is, is so cute, so wonderful. So I wouldn't mind if you ever uh, end up sitting in the room. I, and I probably know for sure Rian will be more than happy to, to also rewatch it again. <laughs> Hello, Chitcher. Hello. Thank you for redeeming applause. Yay, cheers. Do, 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 clap, 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 clap. <laughs> Join us. Join us. We are a cult. I mean, we're not a cult. We, you know, join us for the K-drama, please, please. <laughs> Oops, uh-oh, I didn't mean to move myself. I'm hidden, oh no. 
you know what, maybe, maybe this would be a good time to, uh, switch over to the game. I didn't mean to do that. Chotoba de Kudasai! Oh, there we go. <laughs> uh, I love K-drama, K-anything, really. Do you like the K-pop? Do you like the K-pop? We need to discuss favorite K-dramas, favorite Korean groups, because I also like almost K-anything. <laughs> we are a cult. Welcome to the Sweet Sexuary. Making a great escape. <laughs> I just had to. I just had to hide after revealing that uh, we're a cult. <laughs> yeah. All right, everyone. Time to. Ugh, I gotta adjust my seat. And I gotta. Oh, now I have to move. Okay. Time to play the murder of Sonic the Hedgehog. Is this con is this controller compatible? I hope it is. Let me tab into the game. Oh no, I don't know if I can use my controller. Can I? Let me try one more time. I don't want to use my mouse. Nothing's wrong with my mouse, but I don't want to use my mouse. All right, I guys, I don't think it's controller compatible. <laughs> Let me know if the audio is good for the game. No, I can't use controller. This is awful. All right, guess I'll put my controller away. Oh god, <laughs> I just realized I'm going to be doing a lot of reading. Oh hey, maybe I have to move myself so I don't friggin' block all the text. Um, where... How can I appropriately move myself? Um, uh, maybe I'll shrink down a little bit? Make me a, a tiny little... A tiny little mango? I don't want to be too tiny. But I want everyone to be able to see as well. Close enough. Y'all are here for me, not Sonic. Sonic the Hedgehog, he's dead. <laughs> oh god, I didn't even read the <laughs> I didn't read what the person said. I clicked by accident. This is why I don't use mouse. <laughs> he said, he, or the person said, phew, something, something, and then I missed it. I missed it. <laughs> so far, so good for my first day on the job. Oh, I totally forgot my name tag isn't ready yet. I should make one. I'll just sign my name here. Oh, it's me. Am I this person? Mango. Can I fit my full name? Mangosteen? Yeah. Hello, my name is Mangosteen. That's a me. I'm a mango. That's a boy. Mangosteen. Did I spell that right? Totally. Why is my name on a sticky note? Hope passengers can read my scribble. Oh, I am this person. Look at me. I'm kind of kind of purpley colored. I kind of match a bit. We're on a train! We're on a train! This is like a whodunit! Uh-oh, am I nervous? Is this first day on the job jitters? <laughs> jitters. Working the train's dining car can't be so bad. Come on, Mangosteen, shake it off! I just stopped myself! Why did I stop myself? <laughs> the conductor you just saw. Mangosteed, uh, did I, uh, just see you hitting yourself? m m, -m mister Conductor, sir, how are you doing this morning? Ho ho ho, quite alright myself, though feeling a little bittersweet. 
Is everything all right? Is that because you're a sweetie? Oh my god! <laughs> this person is me! I would have said, is it because you're a sweetie? Oh my god, I, I would have picked the first option, but I'm picking, I'm picking the second one. Trying to butter me up first day, are we? Alas, today is my last day as conductor. I'm retiring after 32 wonderful years. Time for me and the Mirage... Mirage Express to say goodbye to one another. Oh, congratulations on retirement, sir. I will also say, I with this game, since I know there's a lot of reading and a lot of characters, I contemplated asking my friends to come in if they could uh, voice act different characters. But I, I thought after a while, maybe it would have got a bit chaotic. <laughs> yeah, he's adorbs. He's a little wolf. He woof woof. Thank you. My wife is very excited about it. She's already got our plane ticket to Spagnols, Spagonia, Spagonia, locked. Remember, guys, I can't read. <laughs> our shower has been on the fritz, so I'm excited to use the hotels. <laughs> I can see why his wife's excited. Enough of my quibbles. Today's your first day working the dining car. Here's the menu for today. <gasps> I got a menu. Menu added to your inventory. I can open the inventory anytime to view items I've received. I should look over the menu carefully. The Mirage Express dining menu features chili dog, instant ramen, and chicken cordon bleu. Guys, <laughs> this actually sounds yummy. Like, uh, of course, the chili dogs is like Sonic's thing, and then I was like, "Oh, instant ramen, but chicken cordon bleu." I haven't, I haven't made that in forever. Oh, but I will, uh, I will be going to France this year for my cousin's uh, second wedding, and then, um, I, maybe I can get some chicken cordon bleu over there. Also, when I started this game, I thought I would be playing, like, Tails or Amy or something. I didn't know I'd be my own person. Why do you look so nervous? All we have on the train is a microwave. How do you microwave the chicken cordon bleu? <laughs> Though I'm sure a little quiz is in order. Which of these do we serve in the dining car? I'm being quizzed. Oh no. My memory's bad. Crab Rangoon Spicy Grilled Picky. What's a spicy grilled picky? I do like Crab Rangoons though. Ding ding ding. Glad you can read the menu, okay? <laughs> I like that he, he laughs. <laughs> like fa la 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 la. A little about the vessel. This is a state-of-the-art, high-speed smart train with the, all the latest gadgets. This train can really handle anything you throw at it. We've had a lot of adventures together, me and this train. It's not easy to leave. After 32 years, I don't blame him for being wistful. Whoa, I can't imagine being at a job for so, so long. It's crazy. I've, I've worked at a job where, like, my employees have been there for, like, 10 plus years or even, like, 6 years just seems insane. Whew. I mean, I guess if you, if you get into the rhythm of something and you enjoy it or, you know, it pays the bills, why not? But 32? That's, that's like, <laughs> that's a whole adult! <laughs> This train is exclusively, exclusively used for events. It's not a passenger train. I remember that from the interview. What's the event today? A murder mystery party. Nothing better than some thrills to end my tenure as a conductor. Oh, so it's a party. Okay. Sonic the Hedgehog isn't actually dead. <laughs> Guests will be funneled here for, to the dining car as a home basis, so to speak. I'll be with you to gather tickets, but after that, you'll be on your own. So I'll need you to do everything in your power to make sure our paying guests are well taken care of. Understood? 
I'll make you proud, sir. I can't afford to lose this job. <laughs> we don't, we don't say that out loud. We don't say that out loud. I'll make you proud, sir. I'll do my best. Because that's all we can do in this world. Ah, ha, ha. Glad this old man, uh, old man, old man can rest easy. Doors to the Mirage Express are opening all aboard! I will say, the art for this is so pretty, so cute. Oh my god! Oh my god! Amy's so pretty and beautiful! Look at her little cake on her head! She's adorable! What a precious, beautiful woman. Baby, baby girl. And tails! So cute. Wow, this train is incredible. What fascinating tech. You're right, Tails. And Vector's here! <laughs> You're right, Tails. I could get used to staying on the train like this. What did you all expect? You know I always go all out for my birthday party. Oh, it's her birthday! And then Sonic's gonna be dead! <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, Rouge's outfit is also fire. Oh my god, everyone is friends and they're hanging out. This is so cute. Oh, wait one moment, please. Sorry, I just need to check something on my phone real quick. Okay. This train's as elegant as you are, Amy. Can't promise I won't take anything, though. <laughs> and Knuckles! Wonderful Knuckles. Calm down there, Rouge. Did I not just catch you stealing from the train station gift shop? Uh, she's like, silly me. It was a pen, uh, Knucklehead. <laughs> Who's gonna miss a teeny tiny pen? Hello! Oh, you played this before? I hope you enjoyed it. This is my first time. So no spoilers, please, but I hope you enjoy. Welcome in. Azul? Azul? Mingustin. Oh, that's me when I read my name. <laughs> what cast of characters am I stuck with? Get a hold of yourself, Mingustin. You're sweated through your uniform. Oh my god, it's Sonic the Hedgehog! He's here! I have. It was a really good... Uh, I have. It was really good as an April Fool's from Sega. I, wa I did download the game when it came out, so I thought it was very funny and interesting. Best April Fool's, yeah. <laughs> hey pal, can I get one of those chili dogs? Uh, of course, sir. Rightio, friend. Well, aren't you friendly? <laughs> Why can't I be normal for one second? Sonic, wait until I announce everyone's roles to get food. Haha, <laughs> sorry about that, birthday girl. I'll be coming around to collect everyone's tickets. Please have them out and ready. You'll join me, Mangosteen, won't you? Just click on whoever you'd like to talk with and we'll collect their tickets. Oh, okay, got it. Oh my god, there's so many people here! Oh my god, this is a lot of people. I want to talk to the birthday girl first. Could I please get the birthday girl's ticket? Hey, <laughs> why certainly. Thank you, miss, and thank you for choosing our fine train for your birthday festivities. Well, the birthday discount certainly helped. <laughs> Who doesn't love a good bargain? And the murder mystery train just sounds so exciting. It's right up my alley. Who doesn't love a good thrill? I feel like I, I would like to join something like this, but I I can't be the one hosting it. Like, <laughs> someone, someone needs to be in charge of all that. You see, I'm a girl who loves a true crime podcast. Maybe we should leave her to have fun. Before we move along for you, miss. Oh, fun. Thank you. Where do I use this? That unlocks any door in the train. Happy birthday. She has she has a key that unlocks every door. But without spoilers, it is a great game. Oh, thank 
thank you. Thank you for letting me know. Yeah, I'm excited. I'm super excited. I love, I love mystery games. The birthday girl gets the birthday key. It's practically traditional. Very useful. We'll use this wisely. Thank you. Oh my god. And then we'll go to Shadow, my second favorite character. Shadow. He does not look pleased. He, he was just like, yo, <laughs> Here's my ticket. Thank you. Everything is in order. He seems concerned about something. Shadow did. We didn't even. We didn't even say hi to him. He just passed us the ticket. Uh, is there anything we can help you with? Do you sell gift bags here? Oh no! Did he forget to get Amy a gift? Uh no, sadly. But I have a plastic grocery bag in the back I could get for you. Oh no! That stare, brr, so cold. Mangosteen, you're shivering. Do you need me to fetch you a jacket? Ah, no, no, I'm good. I love mystery games too. Mystery shows as well. What are your favorite games and shows, Azul? If you have any, if you'd have any, like, top three to recommend. Alright. Who, who else should we talk to next, guys? If not, I'm just gonna go in order of my favorite characters. <laughs> <laughs> anyone anyone have any recommendations of who we could talk to next? I'm currently having a toss-up between uh Knuckles and Rouge. Maybe I'll do Rouge. Well hello you two, what can I do for you? Good morning, ma'am. Can we get your ticket? My my, how for it? Let me fetch it for you. Come back if you need anything else, you hear? Wow, she's so polite. Very easy to talk to as well. Ma'am, I saw you sneak that $20 bill out of my pocket. <laughs> Gonna have to kindly ask for that back. Oh my god. Oh, this was yours. Must have slipped. Here you go. <laughs> I might not actually be the best at judging character. Oh, Rouge. You silly. We'll go to Knuckles. Oh my god, his outfit. Howdy, could I please get your ticket? His ticket's all crumbly! Is... I think that's a ticket? Hey, <laughs> he crushed it. He crushed it in his strong arm. His strong... Why to say arms? Strong hands. But I really don't want to argue with this guy. Everything looks good, thank you. Seems the conductor doesn't want to argue either. Hmm. Uh, we could go to Sonic. Ticket, please. Thank you kindly. Happy to have someone as renowned as yourself aboard. Don't worry about it. I just like helping. When Eggman took over, I... Truly feared the worst, but my kids swore you would swoop in eventually, and you did. I can't offer much other than my sincere gratitude. He... He's just a little guy. Are we... Are we talking about Knuckles? <laughs> are we calling Knuckles a little guy? Don't sweat a thing. I'm glad you and your family are safe. Wait a second. Is he... Is he Sonic the Hedgehog? I promise you an excellent stay on your train, Sonic. Have fun now. Yeah, yes, have fun now. We'll do thanks. I don't remember this cat girl's name. I've seen her around, but she's very cute, very pretty. I, I haven't I haven't played a game that she's in. The only the only ever Sonic games I ever played was like the OG ones, like the side scroller for like a short while or like like maybe just like a level and then it would stop. And then uh, I played Sonic Adventure 2 Battle and that was, that was it. <laughs> I didn't I didn't really play much uh, Sonic games. Oh no no. And then I played um I played Sonic Heroes. Sonic Heroes with a uh, with my brother. Was she in Sonic Heroes? I don't think so. No, no, I don't think she was. 
me currently playing Shadow the Hedgehog. Have fun, Azul! I always wanted to try that game. Wasn't it on the, like, the Wii or something? Oh, I'm not- I'm not leaving. Oh, no, it's okay. I just meant, like, you know, just have fun in general. <laughs> but thank you for staying and playing at the same time. We're, we're just going down, like, a Sonic a rabbit hole of games. Shadow the Hedgehog was on PS2 and GameCube. Oh! Are you playing- are you- an Xbox? Are you playing on, like, the actual old consoles, or do you have, like, an emulator? May I have your ticket, please? Thank you very much. On top of it, I see. Blaze! That's her name. That's her name. A princess such as myself should always be punctual. She's a princess! Guys, she's a princess. She's a princess just like me! And she's a cat! I love her! I love her! Emulator. Uh, but I'm not modding or using any save states. Ah, okay, okay. Yeah, I feel like if I were to play a game on a on an emulator and stuff. I, there, I feel like there's no reason to mod unless I just want to be silly. <laughs> She's a princess. A princess. A princess? Did she just say princess? If you don't mind me asking, are you visiting from somewhere? A separate dimension, actually. A separate what? She's from a separate dimension? Just here for Amy's birthday, then I'll hop back into my own dimension. I quite prefer the birthday cake from this world more than my own, so I admit I'm a bit excited. Ho oh, ho, you don't say. Well, I hope you enjoy your stay, princess. Sh should I bow? Do I bow before a princess? What are you doing? Please get up. <laughs> Please. Wait, how can, 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 I, can I bow? Will, will, will uh, VTube Studio V Bridger catch me bowing? Princess, please. <laughs> Thank you for staying. <laughs> Thank you for staying at a com staying at this this train. Thank you for crossing dimensions for Amy's birthday party. Uh, as for Blaze, she was introduced in Sonic Rush on the DS. Sorry, I know a lot about games. No, that's totally fine, Azul. Thank you. Thank you for letting me know. You know, if, if someone didn't tell me, I would have just been Googling stuff or still be in the dark. So I appreciate it. Yeah, because I know I know she's not like new or anything and I've seen her about, but I, I like I said, I've only played like three Sonic games. <laughs> so I don't I, like before that, after that, I don't I don't know any of any other characters or what like their lore is. <laughs> Mm, murder on a birthday sounds like a great way to party, to be honest, Ginger. It sounds a scary, like a scary way to party. <laughs> but yeah, thank you for letting me know, Azul. If I, um, you know, if I have any questions about Sonic, uh, the Sonic universe, feel free to let me know. I only watch Sonic cartoons, so I'm hella lost. I, yeah, I watched the one that was like on Four Kids. Was it Four Kids? Or Jetix or whatever, the the Sonic the Hedgehog show. I watched that, and then uh, I also watched one of the movies where it was like his old style, and then like Amy also had her old outfit. I watched that movie. Me and my brother had it on a DVD. What is it? Sonic, he's on the run. Sonic, he's number one. Sonic, something coming at you. Da 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 da. Go go. <laughs> something. <laughs> Uh, da -da. I know a lot of Kingdom Hearts and Yakuza like a dragon. Oh, I also I also like Kingdom Hearts too. I feel like Kingdom Hearts lore I'm more well versed in versus Sonic. Four kids, yeah. <laughs> Let's talk to Tails. Can I get your ticket, youngin? Right here, sir. Thank you. May I offer you any snacks we have on board? No, thank you. When I travel, I always pack my own sparkle sparkle gelatin. It's a sparkly jelly that can melt any jaded heart. Why is Tails carrying around jelly? <laughs> no way. I brought my own sparkle gelatin with me too. It's uh, it's what? Is, it's my first day, and I was a little nervous. What is sparkle? Why are they having gelatin on them? <laughs> Don't be nervous. You're doing great so far. We're sparkle gelatin buddies. Cute, cute. 
Haha, <laughs> absolutely. If you need anything, just let me know. Thank goodness someone on this train is normal. I feel like everyone was pretty, pretty normal for the least. Oh, silly me. And I also played Sonic Riders. Sonic Riders was so fun. Oh my god. I want to like... I want to dig up me and my brother's old GameCube just to play those games. And then maybe if I'm able to like stream them with like a... What is it? Capture card or something? Versus using an emulator. But... Oh my god. I miss GameCube games. GameCube games are awesome. GameCube, one of the best consoles. For real, for real. <laughs> my money don't jiggle jiggle. is sparkle. <laughs> I think it's like a... My money don't... Or my money don't jiggle jiggle. I have sparkle gelatin. Whatever that is. <laughs> Could you please see your ticket? FBO. Is Espio from Sonic Heroes, right? And then there's like the B. I think they have like a B partner, right? Excellent, thank you. I hope you enjoy your stay with us. Absolutely, I appreciate it. There's a calmness about him. Something about his presence put me at ease. Espio, Charmy, and Vector. Yes, yes, there's Charmy. And then Vector's behind Espio on this train. But I don't see Charmy on the, on the train. You consider me calming? He's looking right at me. I study ninjutsu. I believe one can communicate through subconscious. He's reading my mind. He's reading my mind. <laughs> wow, ninjutsu, that sounds like a lot of difficult training. Can you cling onto walls? Cling onto walls? What kind of question is that? <laughs> I most certainly can. The conductor looks a bit smug at that answer. Yeah, where's, where's Charmy? Charmy did it, guys. Charmy killed Sonic the Hedgehog. Hello, my friend. Can I have your ticket? Yeah, you sure? Uh, yeah, sure. Of course. As a gentleman of upstanding morals, I'd love to show you my ticket. He seems to be avoiding eye contact. Is something amiss, sir? I seem to have misplaced my ticket. Could you speak up a bit? I couldn't hear quite hear you. I misplaced my ticket. I don't see where it is. He's not hiding his embarrassment well. Don't you worry. We'll take a look around for you to see if it turns up. Oh, that would be amazing. Thanks a million. Seems as though he would keep our eyes peeled for his ticket. Where's his ticket at? Oh my god. Am I looking in these things? Why are there things? What? Ticket. What's sticking out of the napkin holder? A crumpled ticket! Say, wasn't someone looking for their ticket earlier? Let's be sure to return it to the rightful owner. And let's make sure no one uses their ticket as a napkin. Lost ticket is added to your inventory. Nice, nice, nice. I still want to know what's up here. Welcome aboard the Mirage Express. Why do we have a robot? Mmm, yummy. Don't mind if I do. Mangosteen, those are for a guess, you know. Train, be sure Mangosteen only gets one of those if they ask. But I want cake. But guys, I want cake. Did the arm just kind of nod? Actually, uh, Train, the conductor wants me to have the whole plate. I agree. Give me the whole cake. Give me the whole cake or else. Ha ha ha! Good try, young buck. The train and I have worked together as long for a, together a long time. You'll have to work harder than that to get what you want. Drat! Those snacks look really tasty too. Vector, find anything yet? Well, we just might have what you need. Mangosteen, why don't you show our friend here what we picked up? Here's your ticket. But <laughs> why are we giving it to him if we're just gonna take it back from him? Ah, there it is. That's my ticket. Thanks so much to you both. Was really worried you'd kick me out and I'd miss the murder mystery. Yeah, we would kick you off the drain. <laughs> ho ho ho! Oh ho ho! Old Mangosteen here would have ha have their hands full kicking you out. I definitely would. You're right. I wouldn't leave without a fight. Please don't fight me, sir. Ha 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 ha! Ha ha ha! Why are they laughing at me? 
Wait, who made me both a uh, microwave expert and security guard? You're both all right in my book. Thanks again for the assist. Of course. Just let us know if you need anything else. Okay, everyone. Time for me to read out everyone's roles for the murder, for the murder mystery. And that's my cue to leave. I must prepare the driver's compartment for departure. Ah, oh, the conductor's car. You remember our promise, yeah? You'll do everything in your power to make sure our guests have a safe and enjoyable time on the Mirage Express. Including murder. <laughs> Absolutely, you can count on me. To be honest, this group seems plenty capable on, the, capable on their own. He just leaves and then they just break out into chaos. Everyone's running out everywhere. The train, assist Magnusine if they need any help, won't you? Ha ha ha, that's all I need to hear. You have my trust. Nothing more heartwarming than a conductor in a train. Excellent, I'll be off. I must take my leave, everyone. Please have a phenomenal time. And don't worry about mucking up the place either. This train is state-of-the-art and has systems for dealing with all of that. For everything else, please talk to Magusty here if you need anything. Sounds good. Absolutely. Will do. Goodbye now. I like that guy. Thank you all for following the outfit guidelines I sent you. You all look amazing. I trust you all read your lore cards as well. Lore cards? That must be the detail of their motivations. I suppose it makes sense. Lore cards are read out loud, otherwise people would know the murderer's intentions. Now, on the nitty gritty for the murder mystery game, one of you will be murdered and the rest suspects. Everyone has assigned roles for characters they will be playing. Participants, or participation is required for my birthday. Of course! Birthday girl makes the rules. Sonic, you are ship captain and you are stationed in the conductor car. Naturally, that's where the captain will go. Tails, you are the detective. You'll be here in the dining car. Indubitably. Indubitably. Knuckles, you're the sheriff around these parts. <laughs> but we'll find you in the saloon. Got it. Rouge, you're a business tycoon, and Blaze, you're a titan of industry, both in the casino. What a perfect place for them to be. What's the difference? There is none. <laughs> hmm, sounds fun. Vector, you're the butcher, and Espio the poet, both found in the library. Hear that, Espio? We can hang out together. And, what, and do what? Read? Maybe we can make a tower of books or something. Shadow is the locksmith hanging out in the lounge. Look at his little he's, he's so he just does he seems so like he doesn't want to be here, but he's being so supportive. I'll tell y'all I'll tell y'all a little a little secret. I'll tell y'all a little secret. Okay? And you can't tell anyone. Okay? But I ship I ship Shadow and Amy. <laughs> I'm a Shad Amy -er. uh, So, so any any interactions with them both, I'll be a little giddy. And that's why. So I'm already I'm already super happy that he's come to her birthday party, and it seems that he got her a gift and forgot to get like a little bag for her. Came back to your face right here. I was telling I was telling chat I was telling all the chat and sweeties a secret. But if you missed it, you missed it. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Shadow is the locksmith hanging out in the lounge. Hmm. Oh, all good. I was tapped out. No worries. No worries. <laughs> and last but not least, me, the journalist reporter. My outfit is interesting for a journalist reporter. It seems like she's like a journalist reporter that's like going to an event. I mean, I know it's her birthday, but if they're if they're talking about the roles that they are, I'll be moseying around with everyone. Did you get all that? I, uh, yes. Ah, I was listening. Hope that's okay. Oh God, do I have to remember their roles? More than anything, you can help ensure everyone's following their roles. Oh, that reminds me. Oh god, I have to remember shit. I have to remember shit. 
So when I came back, you were right there. Nothing bad at all. My heart may have jumped a bit. <laughs> Mango Steve jump scare. <laughs> it's like, oh, Jesus, she's on the screen. <laughs> a happy, a happy surprise. I have a map for each of you. Everyone's station is marked on this map as well as how... Uh, as map as well. How convenient. Map added to your inventory. The rules of the game are as follows. There is a murder murderer amongst you all. The murderer can kill a single participant however they choose, but you must physically be present with the victim for it to count. Everyone must collect evidence throughout the train and use it to interrogate fellow passengers to figure out who done it. The murderer will lie to get out of being accused, so inspect everything you can, find clues, and interrogate. I'll set a timer for one hour so everyone can mingle and the murderer can do their thing. Is everyone ready? This this sounds fun. Like, I would love to do something like this. Sounds like everyone's excited. Everyone, to your stations! I hope I'm not timed. I don't like being timed. Ah, this is so exciting! A mystery is unfolding right under our no our very noses. Uh, I know it's kind of scary. How thrilling! I have goosebumps. I'll say how thrilling! I have goosebumps. Same. Ah, isn't it awesome? Shouldn't you two be out there mingling with everyone? Well, actually, the detective and the journalist can't be the murderer. Okay, so it's not Tails and it's not Amy. So we're stuck here for an hour before going out and scoping the place. This way, there's always a neutral party. Makes sense to me. Seems as though Amy's more excited about deciphering the mystery anyways. What do you, th what do you think everyone's doing? Oh, probably inspecting their stations and talking amongst one another and murdering. <laughs> everyone, everyone has roles to play, so they must be exploring their characters. Do you know what their character motivations are, Amy? No, the lore cards are confidential. No one knows but the person who received them. A little bird! There's a tiny little bird! My backstory is that I was best friends with a flicky that decided to join the evil Dr. Eggman, kickstarting my desire for justice in the world. My lore is that I'm a nosy person to journalist. <laughs> that is that is very that is very fitting. Very fitting. Not gonna lie, this kinda sounds fun. Wish I wasn't stuck on microwave, Dewey. <gasps> oh no! What's happening? What's happening? The train's starting to move. It's so fast! Grab onto something! Oh no, what's going on? Ah. I'm slipping! Hold on! Hold on, chat! Hold on, the train! I can't! Ah. <laughs> Holy fuck, we're dead. Average life story. They're not used to going fast, obviously. Only, yeah, only Sonic and Shadow are used to going fast. Gotta go fast. Gotta go faster, faster. You're both awake. How the hell we end up in, like, the... I guess the... Utility closet? You're both awake. Yeah. It seems the train has slowed down... Considerably. Just had a thought. I'm gonna keep it to myself. <laughs> Is everyone alright? Wow, how exhilarating. Is everyone alright? Yeah, my head's spinning a bit, but I'm okay. It seems we've been knocked into the dining car's closet. This train can reach such incredible speed. We're getting our money's worth with this experience, that's for sure. Is this actually intended? It's my first day, so I'm not really sure. I don't recall them warning me about this in their interview. We should go check on the others, Mango Swing. Could you get the door? Of course. Hmm, huh, seems the door is blocked and I don't think it's budging. Yo, off work and lurking. Yay! Thank you for lurking, LJ. I hope work was okay. Make sure to rest well. Eee. Amy, give that fallen shelf a whack with your pico pico hammer. 
Let's find another way out. Uh, I'll, I'll uh, start looking for clues. I'll search over there, over here. I know Amy, she's hiding something. Huh? I suppose she did wake up before us. Something could have happened. Listen, I know I'm a detective here, but all the best detectives have sidekicks. I'm gonna need your help. Let's gather clues on why Amy's acting this way and interrogating her, interrogate her about it. Well, I think she's just, she's just having fun with all this murder mystery stuff. Check out everything you can around this closet, then we'll show it to Amy to uncover the full situation. Gather evidence and interrogate. Got it. I'll need you to do everything in your power to make sure our paying customers are well taken care of. Understood? Understood. Okay, time to bounce and get some work done. I need to earn my monies. Have a good day, Azul. Thank you for stopping by. Have a good day at work. Or whatever you gotta do to make the monies. <laughs> Hope to see you again soon. You can count on me, Tails. I won't turn evil like your ex-flicky companion did. Happy to hear it. Now let's get searching. Hmm. Can I move stuff? Or move the screen? Something's always hidden in the trash. Let's check there. I'll be back again. Yay! I'm excited. I'm excited. <laughs> Sadly, it's empty. Let me know how your game of Shadow the Hedgehog goes and work. But on the bright side, this is very clean trash bin. How do I become an optimist? How do I become as optimistic as this kid? Alright, there's nothing in the trash can. Uh, I guess we could check these boxes. What do you think Tails wants me to cook any of this for you? When we get out of here, sure. I normally never make microwave meals. I prefer to cook. My cast iron skillet has gotten a lot of use out of it lately. I could cook a mean cast iron pizza. Haha. <laughs> I want to try cast iron pizza. Cast irons? Oh, they're so heavy. And I know you got to take care of them and like oil them up and stuff. And But gosh. Those things, they can... Oh, you could break your toes if, they, if you accidentally drop it. You could murder someone with it. <laughs> I've only had microwave lunches this week. What's this? A rod? The tip is broken. It looks like it might have been originally attached to something. Maybe Amy broke her hammer trying to escape? I'm not sure if it's related to her mystery, but I think... Uh, but I like spinning it around, so we'll keep it. Stick is added to your inventory. Uh... Ah, the wet floor sign, keeping people alert and safe. Once I slipped on some spilled juice at the grocery store. No wet floor sign at all. So luckily Sonic was there to catch me. Oh, what a good friend. Wow, Sonic really is as fast as they say. Well, he was going so fast he almost slipped on the juice. We slid into an older gentleman's shopping cart. Well, it's the thought that counts, I suppose. The shelf blocking our exit is currently not budging. Hey, Mangosteen, look closely at this. There's a knock. I wonder how this side of the shelf got smashed. There's nothing the shelf could have fallen into, and I'm sure this damage wasn't here before. The train has too much upkeep. I feel like this is important. We should log it. Crack on shelf is added to your inventory. I think we found enough clues. Let's go interrogate Amy and find out what really happened. Uh, I guess there's nothing else. Amy, my girl! Tell us what you did! What's the latest? Find any clues yet? I found a spoon. If we find two more, we can dig ourselves out. Dig ourselves out? On a train? I'll keep looking. Uh... I guess we can start the interrogation. Amy, we believe you're hiding something from us. What? You accused me on my own birthday? How dare you? Oh my god. I like the- I like how like in games when you're interrogating and the music changes. It- this kind of reminds me of like Professor Layton or like if anyone has ever played like the- that one mobile game, um, 
what is it? It was like Professor Layton's Son or something like that. That that game had a good soundtrack, a very good soundtrack. How oh, dare you! This isn't going to be easy, is it? I've been stuck in here just... What is it? Just like the two of you. What in the world do you think I'm hiding? Amy was awake before Tails and I were. What could she have done in that time? Microwave and chili dog attempt to escape. Murdered a suspect. Uh, I feel like attempt to escape. I don't think you were sitting idly while Magnusdine and I were knocked out. You attempted to escape the closet. Prove it. Show me evidence that I attempted to escape or help me search for a way out. Maybe I don't think she would have tried to murder anyone yet. Do we have evidence to prove that? Magnusdine, let me step you through this. First, find the correct piece of evidence from your inventory. Once that has been deduced, you must form our argument to fight back. Alright, let's do it. What proves Amy attempted to escape the dining car? Uh, up in, oh, I feel like this one. What, some damage on the shelf is supposed to prove something? It fell over. Damage makes sense. You have no argument here. You're grasping. Oh, okay, Tails, what now? Well, now we follow this train of thought. Who does the crack on the shelf relate to Amy? So now I have to explain myself. Well, uh, sure, well, hmm. Well, I get stumped. I like to think. What would what would Sonic do? What would Sonic do? Sonic uh, Sonic's a force to be reckoned with. He's always running forward, collecting rings, crushing batniks. He never loses. Like an endless running game. I play a lot of those on my phone. <laughs> Not the endless running game uh, on the phone. Oh uh, sure, whatever works. Just close your eyes and think. What would Sonic do and find your argument? All right, let's prove we're not grasping. Let's follow the train of thought and fire a comeback. Like Sonic would do. Think! Uh-oh. Oh, oh god. Uh, okay. Uh, this is moving. Do I still have to move up and down? I feel like right now it's just left and right. What the heck? How would I get all of these? I feel like I, there's really no reason to move forward. Oh shit! Oh god. Oh shit, oh shit! How do I collect all of them though? Sure, the shelf fell, but there's something around for the shelf to fall into. You're telling me on the train this well kept that the damage was here before, before we arrived? Well, I uh... I believe someone is responsible for hitting the shelf. You said nothing was around for the shelf to fall into. What was the shelf hit with then? Your broken, your broken pico pico hammer, my love. What is that? A stick? You truly believe a stick would do this kind of damage? Think. Oh God, I gotta, I gotta move. <laughs> I gotta move again. Oh shit. Oh shit, oh shit. Oh god, how does anyone get the the other ones? Oh shit. I don't know how to go fast. <laughs> You're right, a stick can't do this kind of damage to the shelf on its own. But if it's attached to something, it could let like <laughs> Alright, let me read that sentence again. But if it's attached to something, it could like let's say a hammer. This isn't a stick at all, is it? This is actually the handle to your pico pico hammer. You attempted to hit the shelf out of the way, but you failed. The handle of your hammer snapped right off. Uh, ah! It says, uh, it's as you both said, I tried to get us all out with my hammer, but I failed. Oh, Amy, Amy, Amy. Thank you for trying. I gave the shelf one big whack and the handle ripped right off. I figured it was no big deal and tried to hide it, but I suppose my embarrassment got the better of me. She does look genuinely sorry about the situation. I never expected your hammer to snap like that, Amy. 
It was one of my, uh, it was one of my backups. It's still, it's a little lighter to carry around. I didn't think I'd need it. Well, luckily for you, I'm a detective and I dabble as a mechanic. Let's see both pieces of the hammer. Just tighten things here, a little elbow grease there, and fixed. Tails, thank you! According to my calculations, if you hit the shelf right here, it should do the trick. Right, stand back. Oh, the shelf completely shattered incredibly. Incredible. We did it, we're free. Great, Amy, let's get out of here. Let's get out of here. We've escaped. This game's really cute so far. Oh my god, it's messed up. <laughs> There's a wreck. Everything's been destroyed. Wait, is that? Sonic's fucking dead. He's fucking dead. Oh god. Oh wait, whoa, wait, whoa, whoa, guys. I need to get, I need to get chapstick. And I need to drink some water. Too much chalkin. Too much chalkin is making my lips dry. I'm getting thirsty. It can't be. He's fucking dead. <laughs> Sonic! Someone murdered my darling Sonic. Looks like the game's begun. I'm finding out who did this at once. Amy, wait. I want to figure out who did this too. Wait for me. What a whirlwind. I'm exhausted already. That was really convincing, Sonic. Sonic? Eh? Body numb. Can't move. What are you saying? I don't understand. I just need to rest. So Sonic? Is he actually hurt? He's not moving. Are there wounds on him genuine? My hand, my hand's on his wrist, but I don't sense a pulse. Am I doing this right? What in the world is going on? Is this part of the murder mystery or is this serious? Sonic? Sonic! Hello, Hoovy. Welcome in. We're trying to figure out who murdered Sonic the Hedgehog. <laughs> oh no. Oh no, I feel myself panicking. Calm down, Magnestine. What do I do? How you been? I need you to do everything in your power to make sure our paying guests are well taken care of. Understood? These guests are incredibly renowned, which makes uh, means they must be remarkably rich. I don't remember the conductor saying that at all. So I leave their care to you, Biggesty, my favorite employee. Surely you won't let me down on this last ride. <laughs> he didn't say that. <laughs> I have a bad memory, but he didn't say that. Are you having a good Friday, Hoovy? I need to catch up to Amy and Tails and get to the bottom of this. Even if it's part of the game, I just can't risk it. I'll keep everyone safe, Conductor. You'll see. Doing okay? How are you? I'm doing good. I've had a I've had a pretty normal uh, start of the day. Worked on some stream stuff. I had a uh, curry, Japanese curry for brunch, and now we're playing, you know, the murder of Sonic the Hedgehog. <laughs> Thought I'd play a, a pretty chill game since I, I had a bit, um, a bit tired and long debut stream on Sunday. <laughs> thank you, thank you. You are also very adorable. Well, look at this place. Amy, Amy, are you here? Hey, Tails, where are you? Uh, is it asking for one of them? I feel like Amy's running faster, so we gotta find her first. Amy, where are you? I've looked around. I don't see her. I think Amy's already gone ahead. It seems she's really excited. Did you need something from me? Uh, yeah. Just a question, really. How do I put this? What if Sonic is actually hurt? <laughs> He's laughing? Sonic doesn't go down so easily. He's on a train full of his friends. Nothing would actually happen to him. Uh, Sonic is like past the fuck out. 
Sonic's it's past the fuck out right now. We're just all really committed to the mystery for Amy. You have nothing to worry about, promise. Plus, Sonic likes to nap in a lot of strange places. He's fine. I, I think we should really check up on him. And now that I realize, why did I leave Sonic? Like, why didn't I put him in like a safe room or something? <laughs> He's making a lot of sense, but I can't shake what Sonic said to me. Is this really part of the murder mystery game, or is there something deeper happening? It makes me wonder if Charmy's up to something, just because we don't- we didn't see Charmy. I need more evidence to figure out what's going on. Can I tag along with you? It's my job to keep an eye on you. Uh... I'll say we'll tag along. There's no reason to really keep an eye on him like that. Charmy is the bee, right? Yes, Charmy- Charmy is the bee. Because Vector the crocodile or alligator's here. And then es Espio, uh, the, I think he's a chameleon. He's here too, but Charmy's not here, which seems a bit odd. If you don't mind, is it cool if I tag along with you? Oh, of course, sure. Now if I ever need a snack, you've got me. Haha, <laughs> fair. Yay, Tails has snacks. As I said, the best detectives have sidekicks, so I'm happy to have you. If you ever catch me looking glum, though, just know it's because, uh... Where's my lower card? The last guy to work a case with me ditched our practice to join evil Dr. Eggman. Why is everyone just... <laughs> Tails' lore is that everyone just ditches him. <laughs> like, for Dr. Eggman. What's a... This is a very tragic, uh... What is it? Detective story. Yeah, not a proper detective without baggage, uh, baggage, exactly. This is true. Yo, varmints. Hey, it's Knuckles! What are y'all doing in my saloon? He's trying so hard to stay in character. This is so cute. He's doing this for Amy. This is wonderful. What a good friend. Knuckles, we're trying to figure out who murdered Sonic. I can see that. Amy moseyed through and told me all about it. Cough. Enough of that. Wonder how long he kept that voice up for Amy. Oh, he kept he kept the voice up for Amy. Oh, my, oh, everyone is so adorable and treating Amy so wonderfully. We were wondering if you could tell us what you were up to before the murder. Anything to help us establish your alibi. And nope, I have nothing to tell either of you. Leave me alone. He's obviously agitated about something, but why take it out on us? I know better than to argue with Knuckles, so it seems we're on our own. Mangostu, we need to figure out what Knuckles was up to while we were all apart. Let's investigate for clues and then interrogate. Right, let's do it! There's the door. Howdy, partner. <laughs> uh... Ah, the bowl of assorted nuts, the classic saloon snack. Crunch, crunch, crunch. Kind of bland. Uh, seems like someone licked all the salt off of them. What black patooey? Ew, someone ate that. Or maybe they're just insulted. <laughs> okay, good. I thought, I thought someone was like sucking on, <laughs> sucking on the salt and then spitting it out. <laughs> you think it was Knuckles? I have a theory. And I don't want to spoil the game if I actually am correct, so I, I'm just going to keep it to myself for now. <laughs> Breathtaking view. This train passes by some incredible sights. I'm just happy to be traveling at a normal speed. I get nauseous pretty easily. I have to avoid things like roller coasters. Don't mind roller coasters, though. I find myself running on the track more than I do riding in the carts. I'll never understand this friend group. Ooh, there's some there's some sussy thing on the cup. Mangosteen, this is interesting. What is it? It's just a few used cups. Sure, but why are why are there three? Oh, Knuckles was really thirsty. And one has lipstick, it's probably Rouge! Knuckles and Rouge hanging out. <laughs> Megastee, this one has lipstick on the rim. That's not Knuckles' color at all. Someone else must have been here. We should log this. Used cups are added to inventory. 
Something's always hiding in the trash. Let's check. Sadly, this one's empty as well. I'm starting to think your theory on something always being hidden in the trash is flawed. <laughs> Knuckles, you dog, you. Yeah, he he was probably he was probably with um, Rouge and uh, what's her name? It's only a matter of time. Tails, have faith. I'm gonna look at every trash can. <laughs> I think Tails is ignoring me. Okay, I don't want to like miss something. The robotic arms here are really helpful. What's the arm doing to my hair? He fixed it up a bit. That's incredible. What interesting tech. Uh oh, I should. Should I fear for my job a little bit? How well can it microwave? Knuckles and Rouge can bond over having the worst levels ever in Sonic Adventure 2. <laughs> they can. Knuckles? Knuckles' level was so hard. The one with the, the ghost or whatever? Yeah. This this game does... This game and us talking about Sonic Adventure 2 battle makes me want to play again LJ. And I definitely, I definitely will stream it. I definitely will. Hopefully, hopefully the game is on sale and then I can get it. If I click the door, I don't want to exit. Oh, and it's busted. Clearly, we won't be able to give the game Super Monkey Ball a try. It's busted. I wonder what happened. Do we think it's broken when the train sped up? The damage looks more to be caused from punches. Who could have done that? <laughs> huh, I wonder who would have broken this arcade machine. What are you two looking at me for? Smash Arcade is added to inventory. I think we found enough clues. Let's go interrogate Knuckles and find out what really happened. Decent cash reward for finding this robot. Maybe I'll keep an eye out. Poor Ammo Chow. Hate to see them like this. What did what'd they do? Medical malpractice. Interesting. Did they have medical malpractice? I can't... We have two clues, but I can't suspect what is happening. Like, did did Rouge and Blaze, like, tease him about a game and then he got angry and crashed it or something? Like, I can't... I can't decipher that. I mean, they'll probably explain some of it, but... Okay, it looks like there's nothing really else to go about, so... I thought I told you to leave me alone. <laughs> Please, I like your hat. Please don't beat me up. <laughs> I like your hat, sir. <laughs> oh, you can do. He's a bit plush and he's embarrassed. He's soon, soon. Look at little Knuckles. Oh my god. Everyone is so cute. Knuckles, are you blushing? I said, leave me alone. It doesn't look like he used to be complimented. Knuckles is also uh, like my third favorite character. Did you just adjust your hat a bit so we could see it better? I said leave! <laughs> oh, we can take people's order! What? what if I just talk to them? Now that I realize it, I kind of skipped talking to Amy, but... Hmm. Who's your favorite? I missed it. Oh, um, in the beginning. Oh, yeah, because you, you just came back from work. Uh, I was saying that my favorite characters in order so far, like, or just ever since I've played a Sonic game, is uh, I like Amy, I like Shadow, and then I like Knuckles, and then I like Rouge. So far, that's like the order that I like the characters. I think Sonic is thrown in there too somewhere. Maybe he might be... He might be above Rouge, but the, there are characters that I like. Do you have Do you have a favorite order, LJ? <laughs> thank you, thank you. Huh, not hungry. Well, if you ever are, just let me know, won't you? Sure, like a butler of sorts, right? Come on, Mangus, you're not a butler. Tell him that. Oh yeah, like a butler. <laughs> Excellent, thank you, butler. Dang it. I want to talk to him. I want to know what he's saying. I thought I told you to leave me alone. No, we're gonna keep talking. What now? Oh, never mind. Uh, I'll just tell him I like his hat again. 
Yeah, I guess it's just the same dialogue in case you, you don't talk to them. Oh, Shadow is my favorite. Big, Big the Cat is the lowest on the list. <laughs> Why don't you like Big the Cat? I think he, he was kind of a bit bland in uh, Sonic Heroes. Oh my god! What is it? Cream... Cream the Rabbit's not here. She's also one of my favorite characters. She goes... Okay, Cream Cream might be above Knuckles. <laughs> so I think, I think it would be Amy, Shadow, Cream, Knuckles, uh, maybe Sonic and then Rouge. <laughs> <laughs> Knuckles! Mangostine and I need to determine what you're doing during the hour murder uh the hour the murder took place. I already told you, buzz off. You're not getting anything out of me. Thankfully, we won't need you to say much. What happened here is pretty obvious. It, it is? We have evidence too. We do? I don't know what happened. <laughs> Just take a look, good look at your inventory. What was distracting Knuckles during the time Sonic was murdered? I feel like... Use cup sitting on the saloon, one cup... So... If Rouge and Blaze are with Knuckles... Then maybe they didn't murder Sonic? But he could also be distracted playing Super Monkey Ball. I'll do this one first. Heh. <laughs> Wrong choice, Mingus. See, let's try again. What could have been distracting Knuckles? Oh, okay. Okay, okay. He was distracted by the game. Have you ever seen the exploding baby scene from Sonic Underground? I have not. What is that, LJ? <laughs> Can you send it to me on Discord or post it in my Discord, please? <laughs> I don't know what that is, and it sounds really weird. The arcade machine? Ha! What makes you think I touched it? Think! Oh my god, I hope I am able co to collect enough rings! Oh shit! Ah! Oh my god, this is bad. Oh shit. Ah! Oh my god. Ah! Ah! Oh well, um, you see, well... You have no argument here. You are weak. Ouch. Mangosteen, let's follow the train of thought again, shall we? Oh no. I mean, why would they put it in this this direction? This is hard. Oh my god. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh god. Oh shit. Oh shit, jump. Oh my god. Oh my god. Yeah. Okay, I, I followed my train of thought. Uh, I post it in your Discord. Thank you, LJ. I'll check it out uh, either when I go on my little short break or after a stream. This isn't a tough one, Knuckles. Knuckles, you clearly touched the arcade machine because Super Monkey Ball is your favorite game. The arcade cabinet is covered in punches. Your hair was found at the scene. It's covered in punches. What evidence do you have the damage that the damage uh, damages are punches? What are y'all staring at my hands for? <laughs> Knuckles, you clearly destroyed the arcade machine, but why? I needed a punching bag and no, none were available to me. Just a sudden urge to punch, huh? I believe repairing the arcade machine will give us our answer. How will you? I'm on it, Mangosteen. Distract Knuckles while I fix Super Monkey Ball. Bring it on! Oh no. Oh god, I have to, I have to distract Knuckles. Oh shit. Oh god. Oh god! Oh, oh. oh shit. Oh my god. I thought this was supposed to be a calm. Ah! Ah! Now Tails, get away from the arcade cabinet. Megusty, try again. I have to get Super Monkey Ball fixed. I'm gaming! I'm gaming! I thought this was. Guys, I said I wanted a calm game for my busy weekend, or my very tiresome week, and, you know, I... Who knew that Sonic the Hedgehog, the bird of Sonic the Hedgehog, was gonna stress me out? No, I don't have enough coins again! No, I have to do it again! I have to try again! Oh, crap. Okay. 
Oh shit. Oh no, he thought I jumped! What? Oh my god, come on. Oh my god. I don't like- Oh, This- The orientation is like hard. Do I have enough? Okay, I have enough. Cracked at Sonic visual novel in a game. <laughs> Thank you, LJ. I'm trying, I'm trying my best. Arcade machine is fixed! No, don't look at the scores! He's probably he probably got mad that he like lost or something. Quick, look at the scores! Oh, did Rouge and, and Blaze beat him? Okay, what does this tell us? Oh! It says Vector... So Vector beat... Who? What? Candy, bagel, ultimate bread, apple toast, knuckles... He can't... Oh! He couldn't beat Vector by one point. Nothing, obviously. It tells us something massive. Look at the name at the top of the list. It's Vector. He's supposed to be in the library. Hmm. Why is Vector not in the library? Interesting. The picture is beginning to be painted here. You competed with Vector to see who would get the highest score. And Vector beat you. And in frustration, you destroyed the arcade cabinet. I mean, psh, he ra- he- I would rage too. He was off by one point. <laughs> He's punching the air in frustration. You're guessing. Where's your proof? Where's your evidence? Vector's a common name. Prove to me he was here now. But I don't think... I don't think Vector's wearing lipstick, though. I know Rouge is. Oh, shit. I jumped too early. <sighs> you have nothing, Zilp. Nada. Now leave you too quick, Macy. Let's try again. Oh god, I appreciate that they let me try again. This is bad. This is- Oh! Are you kidding me? <laughs> this mini game is so simple. You know why? I, I'm blaming the orientation and I'm blaming that I'm not on the controller. <laughs> oh shit. Okay, I have enough, I have enough. Yeah, the perspective makes it a little hard. Yeah, most deaf. Thank you for agreeing with me. <laughs> I feel like someone someone else who's like a pro gamer is like, Oh, that's just excuses. <laughs> now, Mingusy, what proves Vector was here with Knuckles? The glasses, the glasses. No. I thought it was strange there was more than one cup sitting next to you. While you were supposed to be participating in the murder mystery game for Amy's birthday, you and Vector enjoyed some drinks playing arcade. It's, I'm, it's not like, it's not, I wasn't, and I, don't tell Amy. I think we're on the right track here. It's as if you say Vector popped in at the top of the hour wanting to play the arcade machine with me. We went back and forth trying to figure out the game out, but then... When we did, we competed for the highest score. When he bested me, I destroyed the machine. No proof of his win. I was trying to fix the arcade cabinet before you two came in, honest. I don't want to be caught. And that's my story and alibi. I've already told an abridged version of this to Amy. <laughs> Boy, his, this friend group has a lot of pride issues. Well, that explains one of the used cups. But what about the cup with the lipstick mark? Rouge was in here too. But Rouge was supposed to be at the at the casino lounge. It's incons it's inconsequential, not worth mentioning. She searched around for something but failed, made fun of our game and left. Obnoxious that one. But you offered her a drink, apparently. Listen, I don't know why she showed up and I told you everything that happened before the train sped up. Are you not satisfied? Will you two relent? Hmm. And I'm understanding the scenario. Vector visited to play games. Rouge couldn't find something and left when Knuckles destroyed the machine. That all makes sense. Thank you for answering so many of our questions. Actually, that's not everything, is it, Knuckles? I was... I want to step back to something I noticed. One or more names on the high score list doesn't make sense. Magnusine, can you take a look at one more time? An odd name on the high score list. What is he talking... What is Tails talking about? I guess it was- I was looking at the Ultim? Ultim? But... But who's Ultim? 
Yeah, because there's like foods. Alton? All the other names have food theme, but this one. Who here goes by Alton? You may not know, Megacy, but there's someone here that goes by the title. The ultimate life form. Oh! Oh my god! Shadow is here! Shadow's the ultimate life form! That's my boy! There's really someone here that goes by that? Nothing sneaks by you, does it, bud? Vector and I were struggling so much with the game, but then Shadow dropped by. So Shadow was here too. He taught us the game and was the first to get his name on the scoreboard. Vector and I fought to beat Shadow's score. They're both very annoying. <laughs> You're all immediately had to compete, huh? Oh my god. <laughs> Reduced to a barista? No, he's not a barista. He's uh he's a locksmith. He gave me this before he left. Shadow told me to lock the door and to not open it for any uh, anyone. Then he left. When Vector was leaving, I locked the door behind him. Saw no one else after locking the door. <laughs> it's okay. I, from the trailer, I thought Shadow was also a barista. <laughs> That's the honest truth. So when Amy came through here not too long did you open the door for her no i think she she has oh yeah amy has amy has the key to every door that's right the conductor gave her the special birthday key well i had a lot of questions what happened in the library to cause vector to come here um i do want to look at the map because sonic is dead here and we're going through but that means Vector went back? And, but if she, It just makes me wonder... Cause then someone would have to go back to... You know, <laughs> I'm trying to, I'm trying to my best to explain this. So, Sonic was originally in the conductor area. Something made him come all the way back and then he died in the dining area. And if, if Knuckles locks the door who can get by if me amy and tails were kind of locked in the closet during everything and knocked out for an hour hmm interesting interesting what happened in the library to cause vector to come here why is shadow locking doors and why was ruse and what was ruse searching for i don't know they didn't tell me even though i asked what the heck <laughs> out my access you're gonna have to find them and ask them yourself. More information than I expected to get there, but it seems we can move on. As of right now, I believe your story, Knuckles. We'll only know for sure when uh, we confirm things with Vector. Fair enough. The library is in. Uh, the library is the next car. I'll open the lock for you. Give whoever KO'd Sonic an earful for me, Detective Tails and Butler. I liked it better when he was talk he wasn't talking to us. <laughs> <laughs> well do, Sheriff. Come on, Bangusty, let's head to the library. On it. This is way more exciting than microwaving chili dogs. Bangustine! Coming! Alright, I guess I don't really need to click anything else. Ready to mosey down the next car? Uh no way, Dagna, but you got it, partner. Onwards! Time for the next car! Yahoo! Let's -a go! <laughs> All this stuff's getting heavy. I'll dump what I don't need. Everyone's favorite journalist reporter, Amy Rose, is hot on the scoop. I'm heading out. You've been fabulously, fabulously helpful. Why am I stinky? <laughs> Why am I stinky? I'm just trying to, I'm trying to solve a murder here, Shadow. Already before you go. Espio and I wanted to give you your presents. My presents? You both too sweet. Thank you. Oh, Vector, it seems we have more guests. Amy, there you are. Um, let's see. Have you found any leads yet? 
Oh, the detective pair needs help for the from the birthday girl. Uh, she knows everyone's allowed to be. Uh, uh, she knows everyone's allowed to be sassy on their birthday. I don't think she's being sassy. <laughs> this uh tip is just too juicy to ignore. I'll see you all around. Don't worry, Sonic. I'll be the one to avenge you in quick. But how are you gonna leave? The door is uh to the next car is locked. Oh, you doubt the birthday girl? The birthday girl has a mystery key. But then if, if Shadow is a locksmith, he can unlock every door, even if Amy has a key. So it's like, he's just as capable with a, a key. Right, right, the birthday girl gets the birthday key. Of course, it's a birthday privilege. I'll solve this case before anyone else. Bye! Amy may be hasty, but she's thorough. Now what are you two doing? Looking mighty suspicious, I say. I'm the detective, so I can't be the murderer. And I'm, uh, just making sure things go well here to ask if anyone's hungry. <laughs> I do want to ask that, but I also want to just make sure things are going well. Things aren't going great. Not sure if you're forgetting, but there was a murder. Well, I mean, besides that. Besides murder? Ah, uh, my social skills non-existent. A mood. That's me. <laughs> I'm Vector the Butcher. I'm licensed to handle raw meat. Why is a butcher in the library? I understand SB, SBO, SBO being the poet, but why is the butcher in the library? And I am SBO the poet. Ah, poetry, a resident message from poet to reader meant to challenge our delicate perspective with the mo most rhythmic of prose. Can I hear some? Sure, uh, tears drop in the spring. Can you hear me sing? La, 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 d d d d. <laughs> Was that it? Add more if you like. Cherry blossoms in the spring. I am satisfied for now, thanks. <laughs> la la d d d. At least he's rhyming, I suppose. Manglestein and I are here to establish both your alibis. Can you walk us through what happened after Amy had everyone leave the dining car? Oh, uh, sure, it's simple. We just explained this to Amy, actually. When we were all sent off, Rouge, Blaze, Shadow, and Sonic all passed through this library car. Yeah, because they're supposed to. Where Amy told me and Espio to stay. I probably picked a book off the shelf and made myself comfortable. Vector got bored, and so he left to what Knuckles was up to to see what up Knuckles was up to in the saloon car. Yep. Where was Rouge? We happened to see her lipstick stain on a cup at the saloon car. Rouge came over to the library, seemingly looking for something. Then she went to search the saloon car. She came back shortly after we heard her shout, No way, at the brochure stand over there. Does that mean... So then, kind of both? Is it, is it at this point Sonic is still in the car? In the conductor car? So he hasn't passed by yet? She came back shortly after we heard her shout no way at the brochure stand over there, but she left back at the casino before Shadow came through and locked the door. So then Shadow Shadow is going back to each car and locking each door at the end. Hmm, interesting. Wonder what she found. She obviously been on the hunt for something. After Rouge left, Shadow walked through the casino car. Then he entered the library car and locked the door behind him. Yeah, because he has to lock the door. More importantly, why has Shadow been locking doors? Shadow walked through the library car to the saloon car. But then how? If he's locking doors behind him, Shadow, I mean, uh, Sonic has to go through at some point. So, are they both, like, coming back? This is sus. This is sus. 
Shadow walked through the library car to the saloon car where Knuckles and I were playing games. He insisted on showing us up at Super Monkey Ball. I got so engrossed by the rolling monkey action, I hardly noticed when Shadow left the saloon. I guess he walked through the library car to the casino car again, locking the door behind him. And then returned to the lounge car where he was meant to be stationed. When Vector came back, we realized Knuckle Knuckles locked the door to the saloon. We were stuck in the library. That's when the train sped up. We were worried about the bookshelves falling on us, but we got through it all right. We sat trapped here until Amy arrived asking questions. She's the one that told us someone murdered Sonic. Yeah, because Espio, for the most part, hasn't been moving based on this story. I feel like it's sus if someone's leaving their station. But then again, he could be lying. <laughs> hmm, with all these locked cars, it seems Vector or Espio couldn't have left the library car or the saloon car. Well, I mean, Vector can, based on the order of which he has been moving. Thank you, both of you, for cooperating. We're going to peek around and we'll return with any questions. If you return with any meat, I'll chop it up for you. And if, you li if you'd like to be serenaded with a poem, I've got you covered too. Thanks, guys. Their alibi seems solid enough, but we should still search for clues. What we're looking for is any evidence that proves what they're saying is true. We need to confirm Vector's reason for leaving his post and determine if Espio was actually in the library reading. True, we need- we don't know if he actually stayed here this whole time. A tall task, but we can do it. Let's get to the bottom of this, Tails. Absolutely. Uh, I feel like this is just a normal bookshelf. Well, I wish I could stop and look at all these books. But Sonic needs me. No time to rest. Alright, let's move on. Well, I mean, a little peek wouldn't hurt. <laughs> He's scavenging through all the book titles excitedly. He's like a kid at a candy shop, or in this case, a genius in a train, uh, in a train, in a train library? In a train library. That's odd. I know someone, some books have fallen out on the floor and everything, but every book on these shelves is in alphabetical order, but this one. It's the user guide to the Mirage Express, the train we're currently on. Do you think someone found it on the ground and put it back? Maybe, but it's interesting. Let's make a note on this. Mirage Express manual added to inventory. Interesting. Interesting, interesting. <laughs> and checking the trash can again. There's gotta be something. Something's always hidden in the trash can. Let's check. I hate to say it, but there's nothing there. Ah, I really thought there'd be something there. Big seed. are you sad there's nothing in the trash bin? No, no, I'm alright. I'm sure, I'm sure there's gonna be something hidden in the next trash bin we find. You really think so? Uh, yeah, we gotta stay optimistic. Yeah, yeah, of course, these trash bins hide, uh, hide a secret. I'm sure of it. Mango seed, you're pretty unconventional, but I like it. Was that supposed to be a compliment? A globe of our marvelous planet. I haven't traveled around much. The islands are fun and all, but I'd love to visit some of the countries. They're a lot of fun, honestly. Plenty of wonderful people and shops. The food can't be beat either. Ah, sounds perfect for vacation. The conductor was talking about Spagonia, if you've ever been there. I have, actually, if you ever visit, uh, ever visit, be sure to stop at the university and say hi to Professor Pickle. Professor Pickle? What the heck? Are these real Sonic characters? They'll tell you everything about the area and make some scrumptious sandwich. Oh, now I'm getting hungry. <laughs> uh, I'll keep that in mind, thanks. This group knows everyone has been everywhere, haven't they? Chaos Cola. A chow hanging carelessly from a tree branch. The larger tech below reads, Hang in there! Hang in there, chow! Rather, I, I really need to see this. This little chow is hanging there, refusing to use his wings to fly to safety because choosing the hard way is often the most rewarding. 
That's beautiful. If this child can stick to his principles and find shake, then I can too. There's no way there was that much thought put into this poster. <laughs> right? There's some books on the ground. So many books on the ground. I wish we had time to pick them all up. I sadly have no interest in picking up these books. A lot of those were knocked out by the train speeding up, but Rouge pulled a lot of these out to search for something. What is Rouge searching for? What reckless behavior. I feel sorry for those poor books. The spines are creasing. They're opening too far. This kid really uh, feels empathy for everything. Oh, poor thing. That arm is really struggling to clean up this car. To be fair, I wouldn't want to clean up all this mess either. Let's just leave it alone to do its thing. Yeah, probably for the best. Yeah, I think after that we could still just... Oh, there's a single book. What's this bright red book? Oh, yuck. This reeks of evil scientist Dr. Eggman. Yep, this is Dr. Eggman's autobiography and recipe book. What kind of recipes? Who cares? I wouldn't trust any book he's read. It's weird. This is even here. Maybe people just appreciate an omelet? You may not be wrong. Okay. Uh, okay, and then we'll check the brochure stand. I wonder what Rouge is looking for. Oh, brochures! There are travel destination ideas here like amusement parks, caverns, hotels, restaurants. Oh! Mavisty, look at this! There's a couple maps here! This seems to be a map of the library car. The books are categorized by genre, which are listed here. I love a good overhead map. Let's take it. Library map is added to your inventory. Should we take this brochure about a cave too? Look, there's... Stalactites? 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 <laughs> no, I'll leave it. Oh, uh, yeah, that's fair. Nobody shares my fondness of caves. Uh, oh, did I read it? Did I read it correctly? <laughs> uh, LJ? Those are the pointy rocks in the caves. Oh, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's see what SBO has been up to. Fancy a poem. Can I get a poem about space? How about a poem about trains? Um... I'll say space. I've made it up to space with my beloved antique vase, but a mistake in my haste dropped a vase from my embrace, so my antique I must now replace. Why was that one better than the other one? <laughs> what caused you to drop the vase? Don't read too deep into it, it's just a poem. He hasn't thought it through, has he? What'll be? Ah, uh, I'll say trains. Locomotive in motion. I think I lost my lotion. The window shows the ocean. Oh wait, there's my lotion. What is these? What are these? Oh, thanks. I actually like that one. Huh? Who knew they would rhyme motion and lotion? Uh. My star stomach babbled, though I ignore the grumbling tumbling. For the eggs I received are scrambled when I asked for my egg sunny. A mood. Oh man, I had eggs this morning and now I want some more. Oh, oh, we don't serve any eggs on the train though. My talent here is wasted on you lot. Oh, I, I don't, I don't really have clues yet though. So we're not gonna, we're not gonna interrogate yet. I don't really have anything. I have a single map and an Eggman book and that's about it. But library map, an overhead map of the library map of the library shelves and tables included. Because huh. then why, what, what would she be needing a book for or something? This is interesting. Did you bring me any meat to chop? I may be a butcher, but they confiscated my meat cleaver before getting on the train. You actually tried to bring a knife on the train? I'm a man of authenticity, Tails. Without a knife, I'm just a, che a chef in a 
ketchup stained apron, not a butcher. <laughs> it has ketchup. I think you have a knife on you, and we definitely think you were the murderer. Huh, but what if I hid the knife? You know, I'm not the biggest fan of this line of thought. Uh, let's take, let's talk. Oh, okay, no, no, it's just the same conversation, so we're just gonna zip through. I do want to take his order, though. Someone's bound to order something, right? Oh, yeah, please, I'm starved. Actually, I'm off duty at the moment. The murder mystery is more important. Then why would you show the menu to me? Come on, Mango see why'd you tease him like that? And here I thought I could trust you. You made a fool of me. Oh, now I feel bad. Look, Macy, you made him a fool. Come on, Macy, smooth this over. No, I'm the fool. Yeah, yeah. I smooth things over, but at what cost? <laughs> oh my god, these silly goobers. <gasps> silly, silly goobs. Uh... I guess we could interrogate him because we kind of know for the most part that he's left the cart versus Espio. Oh, okay, I have to still look around more? Am I missing anything? Huh? Am I? Check out our book club. Book of the Month Gone Gal. <laughs> it's supposed to be Gone Girl, but it's Gone Gal. That's so funny. Yeah, what else would I- can I move? Shadow supposedly walked through the library cart before going to the saloon. When Shadow left the library cart, he locked the door on his way out. There's gotta be a reason he's doing this. Should we make a note of it? Yeah, I do believe we should. Shadow's lock is added to your inventory. I think we've ha found enough clues. Let's go interrogate Vector and SPO find out what really happened. So, the two of you don't believe us, eh? <laughs> it's not that I don't, don't trust either of you, but I would be... It wouldn't be proper detective without examining the validity of your alibis. Mangosteen and I are here to confirm two things. Why Vector left to go play games with Knuckles, and if Espio was really reading in the library. Vector, we'll start with you. Why did you leave the library card to visit Knuckles? We're prepared to present evidence if need. Oh, that's easy. I got bored. What? I wasn't entertaining him enough, it seems. Vector enjoys being social. Plus, we were instructed to mingle. I remember the arcade machine in the saloon car, so I figured I'd go check it out. This seems to be lined up with the information we gathered from Knuckles. And that brings our attention to you, Espio. Rouge entered the library car, found something, then left. You said you immediately started reading, but you were actually reading the entire time you were in the- uh, but were you actually reading the entire time you were in the library car? Of course he was. Once Espio starts reading, he doesn't stop till it's done. I've seen it happen. It must have been a good read. What book? What was the book? Espio doesn't owe you that, detective. Let the man live. What if it was embarrassing? Then he should tell us. <laughs> what kind of thing do you think I read? If you won't talk, I have a hunch on what the book might be. Mangosteen, could you help me out? All right, Mangosteen, what book do you think Espio might have been reading? He was reading the manual. <laughs> he was reading he was reading uh BL stuff. <laughs> or or other things. Why were you reading the manual, sir? The manual? You think SBO was reading instructions? What argument could you possibly have to support this? Think! Now I gotta think, I gotta think. Taking all of my Oh no, I didn't mean to jump! Oh, why did it run? Oh! Oh, shit! Did a friggin' ninja stop? Oh! oh! No, this is bad! Oh, shit! No! I'm not grasping! God, I'm just trying to figure this out. Oh, shit. Oh, fuck it! Oh my god, no! Oh, god. Alright, let's try it again. Hmm? 
Oh, fuck. I didn't mean to jump. Oh, Lord. Oh, Lord. Oh, shit. Oh, crap! Ugh. I meant to try to hit that. Oh, my God. Oh, at least I have 50. Okay, that's good. That's good. That's good. That's good. Gosh, are all Sonic games hard like this? I, I, I feel like maybe they're, they're like in a similar sense. They're just hard like that. There are books scattered around the floor, sure, but the remaining book on the shelf were all in alphabetical order, all except this manual, meaning someone had a very, at very least, picked the manual up and put it back in the incorrect place. This lack of attention to detail isn't normal like you, SBO. Hey now, I won't have you insulting my pal like this. Calm down, Vector. I know you mean well, but I can handle myself. Apologies, SBO. A butcher and a poet. Friendship can form anywhere. That is indeed the book I was reading. The Mirage Express Manual trains are cool. In that case, we'd like to ask you a few questions about the manual, Mangustine, if you don't mind. Could you ask Espio some questions about the manual? Just flip to the page and ask away. Oh, I see. Quiz Espio about the manual proof he's read it. Which page should I quiz him on? Uh, I, I don't know. Maybe... Oh... Okay, um, what efficient and extremely accurate technology was installed to assist in keeping the train spotless? Robotic arms during the events, they can perform a variety of tasks and are responsible for cleaning up trash and messes afterwards. I remember the conductor saying that the train can clean itself, though I have a feeling the train company just didn't want to hire any janitors. The robotic arms can also detect weapons or explosives being brought onto the train, ensuring passenger safety. Wow, very convenient, very futuristic. Seems like Espio aced the question, Magnusy. Hit him with another one. Okay, which page do I choose? Uh, 89? What is the Mars Express cancellation policy? No refunds and you'll be charged on show fees. This does not apply if you're over the age of 65. <laughs> Gee, the person who made this rule must have been over 65. Last one, Magnusy. Let's see if Espio can go three for three. Gotcha, which page should I pick? I don't know. This is hard. What was implemented to support the conductor duties and ease general train obligations? An intelligent data processing system, processing system. It works in tandem with the conductor to ensure smooth travel for her guests. I remember this. The train had an autopilot, but it can't access it. Full suite of capabilities without the conductor present. Now, did I pass your little test? I feel like yes. Am I missing something? Well, it's wild you were able to refrain all that information so quickly. A poet's brain is often surprising. I don't know if I'd be bragging about that. You've clearly read the manual. Those answers feel far too specific to be guessed. You both never have the nerve to question my buddy like that. Don't we want to be supporting folks who read? <laughs> you have to admit though, reading the entire time a murder occurred sounds a bit suspicious even if true. But he answered all the questions so calmly. That's very impressive. No, no, I understand everyone's cautious attitudes. Vector was the only one to see me reading after all my alibi is hard to sustain. Sus Stayed, substantiate. <laughs> I said sustain. <laughs> substantiate, despite being the truth. Well, you definitely read through the manual, so I suppose we can. Espio, is that true? Vector was the only one to see you reading. What about Rouge? Yeah, that's correct. Problem. Frankly, I don't believe that can be true. And here's the evidence to back it up. Mango Steen. He's always putting me on the spot. Okay, Mango Steen, think we should have a piece of evidence linked to someone who saw SBO reading. I guess... The lock? I want to say the lock, because then it's either Shadow or Rouge. Shadow's lock? Please pray tell what that this has to do with anything. We're up, Mango Steen. Let's do our argument together. Oh, I gotta think, I gotta think. 
Oh shit! Oh crap. Okay, back to lurking for me. No worries, LJ. Thank you for lurking. Mm -hmm. Holy fuck. Oh no! No, 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 no. Ah! No! Oh shit! This is danger? No! Oh, my fucking rings! Okay. <laughs> I gotta eat. I gotta eat. <laughs> I gotta eat more. Shadow walked through the library car to get to the saloon where he set the original high score on the arcade machine. Yeah, but I ended up beating him. It wasn't the uh, it wasn't the high score for long. Crocs are natural gamers. Espio said he saw Shadow enter the library, but he's mentioned nothing about Shadow's return. Hmm. Interesting. He's only mentioned that Vector came back. A shadow left Knuckles and Vector in the saloon car. Espio was fully seated reading his book for a good while at this point. We know Shadow had to walk back through the library when he left the saloon. So there's absolutely no way Shadow and Espio didn't notice one another on Shadow's return trip. I mean, it was simply a slip up. I was just fully immersed in my book that I didn't notice Shadow. You're telling me the sounds of door locking and opening locking should have caused you to look up? Well, I, you see... I can sense Espio's desperation here, defending the argument that he was reading the entire time isn't easy. So if you didn't see Shadow returning the saloon to lock up all the doors, then at that moment you were really in the library at all. But how would Espio leave? Shadow locked all the doors and no one saw Espio in the saloon. It's a mystery, my dear Mango Steen, one that I would love for Espio to solve. You gotta believe me. That cold demeanor is vanishing. I was so involved in my book, I didn't know Shadow passed through the library car. Honest. When Vector returned, he even had to tap me on the shoulder to get my attention. Yeah, I think I remember doing that. I must avenge my friend's death, so I'll ask you again, Espio. If you weren't there for Shadow to see you reading, then how did you leave the library car? I wasn't. I didn't. Why doesn't it seem right to me? Tails definitely seems like he's onto something, but I don't see it. I don't either. Was Espio simply sitting, reading, or did he somehow vanish to notice Shadow's return to the library car? What should I do? Join Tails, defend Espio. Uh... Because if... Hmm... Because if Espio is sitting here, he's not really facing anyone. If he's sitting here, he kind of can see. Like a lot of the chairs are facing the wall, except for these two. Hmm. I don't know, but then if Tails is onto something. Hmm. So I'm assuming these little points are like the chair facing forward. And we don't know where he was reading though, but most of the seats aren't facing anyone. But if he's reading the manual, then he'd probably be at this seat. Maybe I'm thinking too much into the Sonic game. <laughs> but he, he should have if it was this close, unless he was in this little corner over here. Um, Part of me wants to defend Espio, because where else could he have gone until then? Because he could have went to the casino, right? The Shadow, Shadow Vector Knuckles were in and then Shadow didn't lock until he left. So at some point Espio could have went to the casino? Because he didn't hear Shadow lock the door. Maybe I'll join Tails for now. I'll let him continue. Mango, see, my favorite beloved employee, please protect the passengers aboard this train. They must be taken care of. If you fail, the lawsuit will be tyrannous. Don't allow <laughs> such an old people soul to get sued. Oh no! I have to make sure our guests are taken care of. I have to speak up. Tails. 
We have a piece of evidence that can answer all of our problems. All right, my fellow associate, lay it on me. What piece of evidence showed Shadow and Espio couldn't have seen one another? The map! All right, now let's get my thoughts, let's get my thoughts in order. Yeah, because he was probably sitting so he couldn't have seen Shadow. Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh god. Oh god, oh god. Please, please, oh gosh. Oh god, oh god. Ah! Oh, alright. That one was a little... That one was a little easier. <laughs> the library map. Oh, I see. See the exits? They're right across from one another. A straight path. If Shadow walked down the straight path, there's a way Espio and Shadow couldn't have seen one another. Looks like you have a point out... Uh, have to point out where exactly on the map you mean. Where could Espio have been for Shadow not to see him? Maybe here. Interesting, that's where I was sitting reading my book. I could second- the Oh, I should- No, oh, guys! I was right! I should have defended Espio! <laughs> I was being a jerk! I was just like, everyone's a murderer! Everyone! Everyone's a murderer! I can second this. When I returned from the saloon, Espio was in the same spot. Observe confirms it then. You see, Shadow and Espio couldn't have seen one another from this spot because a bookcase is in the way. There's no way Shadow could have seen Espio or vice versa. It makes a lot of sense why you never mentioned Shadow's return, Espio. There's just no way you could have seen him. I apologize for losing my cool back there. I felt like I was grasping desperately, telling the truth. Oh man, I know the feeling. But I'm glad you all believe me now. Your alibi isn't the most airtight, but I have no further points. Thank you both for answering all of our questions. We did it! Another pair of alibi validated. Alibis validated. Too many locked doors to worry about, but I'm glad everything straightened itself out in the end. Well, I'm exhausted. I'm gonna crash here for a bit. These chairs are so comfy. Likewise, I could use a breather. Sadly, our work isn't done. I have plenty of questions for Rouge and especially Shadow. Oh, and it seems the doors to the next car is open. Amy must have kept it open when she passed through earlier. Then that's our cue to leave. See you later, Vector and SBL. Give them heck, and if you need any meat chop, say the word. <laughs> He's so dedicated. So dedicated. I'll keep my poetry sharp for you both. A murder is on the loose, while doors keep getting locked. Tick, tick, tock goes the clock while our heroes are in the caboose. That didn't rhyme at the end. At this point, I feel like pretty confident in our detective abilities. We're already doing this. Come on, Mangusti, let's see what's next. Coming. Yeah, let's uh, let's uh, get out of here. You sure you don't want to stay and look at all the great books a little longer? Just one more look. <laughs> you can never spend too much time in the library. Just one more look for you. One more look for you. Yeah, because I don't really think I need anything else. We're done here, Tails. The mystery calls. <sighs> okay, the investigation continues. Oh my god, look at the chat with the mustache! All right, guys. We will we will take a short little break. I'm gonna stretchy my legs, uh, run to the bathroom, you know, drink some more water, add some more chapstick to my mouth <laughs> from all the reading. So, make sure to also stretch if you haven't. Thank you to those who are lurking and hanging out with me. <laughs> I hope you're you're enjoying it on the side. <laughs> this is this this mystery is getting intense. All right, be right back. And also make sure to also drink water as well and stretch.
Hello. And we're back. <laughs> I hope everyone stretched and got your water in. We will continue the game -age. I'm I'm also contemplating because it is getting a little late. That's <laughs> I'm getting also a little hungry. Though stream was gonna be maybe like three-ish hours, but we'll see how longer this game goes for. If I have to do this in two parts, I will. It wasn't my ideal idea, but it's okay. As long as, uh, you know, I am having a good time, I am having fun. I'm just getting a little tired, a little hungry. <laughs> but we shall proceed. I am, I am interested. I guess we'll actually... Let's see. How many other characters we got to interrogate? Because right now we did... Because technically, does Amy count as an interrogation when she's technically the tutorial? Because we did one, two, three. And then there's like four more characters left. We'll see how I feel after I interrogate Blaze and uh, Rouge. See how that goes. All this stuff's getting heavy. I'll dump what I don't need. Rouge, there you are. We have a lot to say to you. We've visited every train car so far and everyone say they've seen you wandering about. It's high time you told us why. My, my, talk about a warm welcome. Quick to the point, aren't you, darling? And I see you've brought the microwave the master with you. <laughs> Why am I the microwave master? Oh, please don't let that be my legacy. Tails is right. Folks have brought you up a lot. Care to explain? Tell them, Rouge, we're gonna need the help. Blaze? Alright, I've been hunting for some treasure rumored to be stored here on the train. For treasure? They certainly didn't tell me about the treasure in the interview. Since I'm part business tycoon, part purveyor of fine collectibles, I knew I had to find it. Tell them what it is, Rouge. Alright, well, it's a uh, Fabergé... <laughs> Why do people say va Fabergé? What does it even mean? Fabergé Chow Egg. Wait, what does it even mean? Hold up. Define va Fabergé. I'm sorry, I didn't quite catch that. Could you please say that again? Define... Define Fabergé. Here's what I found. Alright, let's see what my phone tells me. Faber Fabergé. Fine gold and enamel wear made in... What? What the heck? Oh, this is the actual dictionary.com? Huh. Hello, ah. Uh, uh, so hello, I only say ah. Uh, welcome in. I love your username and that you just type ah. Uh. I hope you're doing well. I'm trying to find the definition of Fabergé. I hear it a lot, but I never... I don't really know what it means. Uh, eight, it says, as a noun, 1846 to 1920, Russian goldsmith and jeweler. So I guess it's a person? Fine gold and enamel were made in St. Petersburg, Russia in the late 19th century and early 20th century, much of it for the Russian court. Interesting. I'll probably look up more on that. But yeah, that's the definition from dictionary.com What does Mary the Mary Web thing say about it? Fabergé Oh, so it's just it's just a play on the actual Fabergé egg. Fabergé is a guy who made ornate things, right? Yeah, I think so. I thought the word itself was something else, but it's saying a Fabergé egg, well, this is from Wikipedia. A Fabergé egg is a jeweled egg created by the jeweler firm House of Fabergé in St. Petersburg, Russia. Yeah, yeah, that guy. Oh, I never knew that. Peter Carl, yeah, the Russian guy. I didn't, I never knew that. We learn something new every day. <laughs> uh. But yeah, 
yeah, thanks for thanks for helping me find the definition. Is there is there anything you would like me to call you, or should I also just call you A? <laughs> Wow, that does sound extravagant. A is good. Okay, welcome in A. A as my as my VTuber uh mama says. A <laughs> Thank you for the follow, A. Welcome to the sweet sanctuary. I hope you enjoy your stay here in this sweet kingdom. But please don't tell me you accepted Amy's birthday invite only to find that egg. A woman can have multiple goals. I gave Amy her birthday present already, so everything's well taken care of. Do you like, um, the Sonic franchise, A? Eh? Also, Mama, do you like Sonic the Hedgehog? I know me and uh, LJ were discussing our favorite characters earlier. I don't know if you're also into the franchise or anything. She wrote me in on the hunt immediately. I stayed here while she searched the train cars for clues. I don't really pay attention to that. It's okay. It's okay, Mama. I still appreciate you hanging out and lurking and stream today. I hope you're enjoying the mystery as well. When you talk to A, you sound very Canadian. Do I? I mean, I am from... I am from Canada. Wink, wink. I'm from Canada, wink, wink. But I never knew I had a Canadian accent. <laughs> I wonder. I wonder what uh, in my vernacular, what my my Canadian sounds like. Laugh my ass off because Canadians say a. Hey. <laughs> oh my god, that's so true. Mama, you're so funny. Uh, that joke went right over my head. Hey, <laughs> so silly, so silly. I deduce that Fabergé chaos, oh chaos, I almost said chaos emerald egg. Chow egg is here in the train, locked in a safe. Wait, so the treasure is real? It's actually here? And what did you manage to find, Rouge? Oh well, why don't you both take a look? I found the train's blueprint in the library car with the safe code written right on it. The score of a lifetime. 23401. The train's blueprint. Please, Rouge, let us see that. Uh, uh, uh. Finder's keeper, sweetheart. There's a problem. We need your assistance. What kind of problem? The elevator behind the security guard leads us right to the room hol holding the Fabergé chow egg. But we're not getting anywhere without the guard's access key. We need a plan to get that car to use the elevator and our chance to access to, to I said to access to success grows with everyone's help. Um guys? We're on a train. Why is there an elevator? So you want us to help you steal the Fabergé chowing? Please, you don't have a problem with this? I see no issue here. Sounds like a fine business venture. <laughs> They're so cute. Uh, her lore card must be influencing her decision here. Either that or breaking the rules must be refreshing for a princess. Mangosteen, do you have an opinion on this? Stealing it- stealing is for squares. It's time for a five-finger discount. <laughs> My thought is, I just got this job. I can't lose it. <laughs> but then at the same time, I know the conductor was like, you gotta make the guests happy. And I have to do everything in my power to make them happy. But I cannot be stealing. I cannot lose this job. Even if I obtain this this so-called Fabergé egg. And then, uh, you know, maybe I have money or maybe it's fake. But my job is at risk here. <laughs> I need to remain the microwave master. I think the only square here is you, microwave <laughs> I must admit, that wasn't the coolest thing I ever heard someone say. No, no, my cool mysterious reputation is crumbling! My cool reputation! Alright, alright, I'm in. I'll help. Well, I suppose it's both Blaze and Mangosteen are in. Okay, let's get that Fabergé chow egg. 
<laughs> That's the ticket. Happy to have you both on the team. Now we must plan. Oh! Oh, okay. Uh, there's a presentation? Oh boy, what have we got ourselves into? Oh god. Oh, this is fun. Hello, nickname. Hello. We are, yeah, we're trying to find out who murdered Sonic. <laughs> hello, hello. You having a good Friday? Access to the Fabergé Chow Egg Room is behind a locked elevator door. The security guard has the access card. Do we attack the guard, bribe the guard, distract the guard? I think we'll have to distract him. We're, we're very, we're four very small, you know, creatures. And I'm assuming this guard's huge. Uh, was it you? <laughs> no, <laughs> it wasn't me. It wasn't me. I was, uh, my alibi is I was with, I was knocked out. I was with Tails and I was with Amy. So they saw me knocked out. I did not kill <laughs> Sonic. <laughs> but that's good. I'm glad to hear you're having a good Friday. Uh, I mean, um, it looks like a chow from the picture. It does? I thought it was just a regular egg. But, alas. I still, I'm still wondering why there's an elevator on a train. This makes no sense. Have you ever played this game before, Nickname? Distract them. Perfect. We're all... Oh! <laughs> The guard's a chow! I didn't know the guard was a chow! Oh my god, that explains- that explains so much of... When I came into the room, and the chow with the mustache was by the door! Oh my god. Oh my god, we could attack this chow! Oh my god, silly me. Distract them, perfect. We're all charming enough for that to work. It looks like the child just has like a credit card sticking out his belt. That was actually a really nice thing to say. Mangosteen, is everything okay? I've never seen you smile like that. Seems like they don't know how to take a compliment. If I'm gonna be in a casino, my pocket, uh, my pocket, my poker face needs work. Okay, who's distracting the security guard? I have not, I mean, I've seen some folks play, so I was letting you pick. It's more fun that way. Oh, gotcha, gotcha. Yeah, I, I was just curious or, you know, just wanted to know if you ever played this game or if, um, you know, if you're like a fan of the Sonic franchise in general. Uh, who should do the distraction? Who should do the distraction? Um, hmm, I feel like Rouge is very a good talker and so is Blaze and I feel like me and Tails maybe not. Yeah, they all sound fun. Hmm. I think I think Blaze. Blaze is good at talking. She's a good talker. Think you could distract the guard, Blaze? In my life, I've never let a single person down. I won't falter. Great. Her voice was so stoic. I have chills. Well, I trust her. Moving on. What's the distraction? Pretend the claw machine is stuck. Push a bunch of poker chips. To the floor ask the chow about their partner and kids like to just why are we talking to this chow that aren't chows like little babies <laughs> you don't have partners and kids here uh, i feel like just knocking something over is a little too seamless pretend the claw machine is stuck they could fix it yeah i guess getting to know them but it's like how far how far does the conversation go Chows are just small. They're just small. I'm so sorry, Chow. I misunderstood. Hmm, I'm deciding between pretend the claw machine is stuck because then it it makes the Chow walk away and I feel like that gives us more time. I don't know how intricate this game is. <laughs> and then there's uh, to ask the Chow about their partner. is like talking to them, but you'd have to like sneak around. So I'm going to pick the first one. Who puts a claw machine in a casino? This will work great as a distraction. Let's continue the plan. With the guard distracted, Rouge, how will you get the access card? Uh, grab them and fly up to the rafters. Ask for the card. Pick their pocket. 
Rouge is really good at pickpocketing, and she does have wings, so she could always fly, but there's really no reason for her to be flying. So we'll just let, let her be a pickpocket. Pick, a pick a uh, <laughs> Ask for it full of lols? No! I don't want to fail this game. I don't- I'm gonna pick pickpocket. <laughs> Just, just, hey sir, can I have the card that gives me access that I'm not allowed to be in? <laughs> no, no! <laughs> I want to try to succeed in my first playthrough. I'll snatch the access card, no problem. That child in uniform won't notice a thing. Excellent, we can count on you, Rouge. Try not to take anything else from them if you can help it. No promises. <laughs> she, she just steals like 50 bucks off them. <laughs> With the card obtained, we need to get Blaze out of there. Mangustine, what's your plan? Hmm. Pretend you're Blaze's spouse. Push the security guard over. Say there's a drink without a coaster? What? Um. Why would I need to be pretend to be Blaze's spouse? Like, to be like, honey, we need to go here. Push the security guard over. That's messed up. And then say a there's a drink without a but the child's not gonna care about me having a coaster not a coaster the monsters i know i can't believe it <laughs> i'm just kidding i i barely use a coaster in my life i only use coasters when i'm at like visiting friends house or being polite or if i'm invited to like my family's house other than that i don't use a coaster at all it's a comedy game, of course you will. <laughs> I'll pretend to be Blaze's spouse. Then you'd be marrying into royal family. What is your heritage? Any war crimes I should know about? What? Well, I am... Um, you just far too plain. You would need a complete uh, refashioning immediately. You know what? Maybe we should try something else. Interesting, you give up far too easily as well. We, we'd have to work on your fortitude. Uh, hello, Amya? Amya, welcome in. Uh, I hope I'm pronouncing your name correctly. Uh-oh, I froze. <laughs> I froze for a second. Uh, hello, hello. I said that uh, we'll try something else. With the card obtained, we'll need to get Blaze out of there. Mangustine, what's your plan? Oh, I would hate to- I would hate to push this little chow- this chow person with their spouse and kids, like... Imagine that- that would be different if they stole it. Oh gosh. And there's just so many options. Uh, Amya, are you having a good Friday? I hope you- I hope you are enjoying, uh, an enjoyer of the Sonic franchise games. Um... Uh, I would hate to push him over. I'll say there's a <laughs> I'll say there's a drink without a coaster. I can't. I don't want to push him. Absolutely vile. I can think of nothing worse. Despicable. I would never allow such a thing in my kingdom. The guard will go running immediately. I'm sure of it. I'm <laughs> Imagine that the chow doesn't give a fuck. <laughs> Great, and with the guard distracted, we'll head to the elevator. And just like that, we all make it to in the elevator. Inside, we... Celebratory dance, pop some apple cider, sing victory acapella. Okay, this is getting a bit silly. I think we'll dance. If we sing and pop some apple cider, there, he's gonna hear something. Now that's a proper victory. Oh no, one last security measure we didn't account for. What do we do about the mechanical arms attacking from the ceiling? Oh my god, why are they attacking us from the ceiling? High five each each <laughs> Have Tails disable them. Tie them into one big knot. I think Tails can just disable them. But can Tails disable the entire train or just the arms? I should be able to disengage them. I'll just need some time. Well, that leads us nicely to our next question. Now, oh no, Tails is taking a while and the arms are tightening their grip. Yeah, Tails is a genius. Tails is a mega genius. Tails is big brain. Big, big, scronkly, rigid brain. 
<laughs> Cry and hope they sympathize. Imagine you're not in pain. Pretend there's nothing wrong. If I pretend there's nothing wrong, I feel like they'll just squeeze tighter. Oh, pardon me. Wait one moment, please. Sorry about that. I heard my brother yelling. I was worried he needed something. <laughs> just just high five like pop 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 pop. <laughs> yeah, they're all gold. Um hmm. I feel like they're they may not have sympathy for us. I'll I'll imagine we're not in pain. <laughs> Tails managed to do it. Darlings, I'm happy to say this plan is perfect. I hope it's perfect. <laughs> if everyone's ready, it's time to execute. I'm ready. Let's begin. All right, let's see what's up that elevator. We're on a train. Why is there an elevator? What the heck? There's a safe? I knew the plan would go without a hitch. Go off without a hitch. We couldn't have made it this far without you both. You may have you you have my gratitude. Is there, like, wrong answers? Like, would we have not been here if I picked something else? Our planning beforehand was very thorough, I must admit, and it was executed to perfection. Enough chatter. As, nope, as far as I know, at least. Yeah, I, I imagine just because certain options I picked, they're like, oh, you should pick something else. Enough chatter. Now we claim our real prize. I have the safe code right here on these blueprints. Let's claim our Fabergé chow egg. Hee hee hee. I do want to see what other stuff is around here, but there's only two things that I can click. Uh, I guess so. Uh, let's go for the big one. Hello, Mingo, looking good. Hello, Baldor. Hello, welcome in. Yeah, thank you. I'm. I, I got. It's me. My model reveal. Whoa. I'm I'm a big model now. <laughs> I'm a big I'm a big mango steen. I grew from a tiny chibi to a big one. You are looking good as well. Wink. <laughs> uh, are you having a good Friday, Baldorf? Or is it a Saturday for you? No question. This has to, got to be a safe with our treasure. Enter in the code on the blueprint and find out, Rouge. Uh. Uh, on it, sweetheart. Let's see. 23041. Oh, wow. It's here. I have it. <gasps> the Fabergé egg. All right. Before anyone sees us, let's get out of here. Hold on, kiddo. We can't be so hasty. You truly think that's all there is in this egg? No further secrets whatsoever? Rouge, spit it out. What are you hiding? Only three of these eggs were ever made, each hiding their own individual secret. No one knows the secret because anyone who's opened one has the never lived to tell the tale. So is it like a bomb? They open it and they're fucking dead? Already Saturday and working? Oh no, are you working right now? I hope you have a good day at work. I hope, or at least I hope it goes by fast so that you can go hurry home. <laughs> you can open the egg? You sure can. All you will bear witness to its secrets. Rouge, I don't know if you should. All you need to do is twist. Tick, tick. Oh my god. Rouge, has no one left to tell its se egg secrets because each egg is a bomb? I think you're onto something, kid. I'm sure it sounds like a bomb. We need to dispose of the egg now. Dispose of it? All of our hard work. Rouge! Fine, fine. What do we do? Where can I put this thing? There's an extra question. What do we do with a bomb? Oh my god! Uh, the... What? The... What? Oh my god. Cal... Oh my god. The... Oh, look! Oh my god, what? The? Oh. Uh. Toss the egg in the elevator? <laughs> oh, there's so many options. Alright, down it goes. Yeah, boy, two more. 
points up to this one, then a long weekend starts to read. That is that's good. That's good, Beldor. I'm happy I'm happy you could also be wonderful because you're here and I hope I'm making it just as amazing for uh, you know, free your long weekend. Alright, down it goes. No, there's just so many. I, I hesitated because I was worried if I took too long it would explode. Yeah, this game is wild. We're clearly not going to blow up the uh, elevator. Let's rethink this. Oh my god! Uh, I think one for the team! Am I gonna pull a Captain America? <laughs> I'm gonna pull. Oh my god! Uh, oh my god! Um. Let Tails cool it down? Cool the bomb down with your tail like a fan? Worth a try. I still hear Chicky Hover refreshing the breeze, maybe. I'm okay now. <laughs> oh my god. Um. Chaos Control the Eggway? Where'd you hear about Chaos Control? Doesn't matter. We need a Chaos Emerald to be able to do that. We all dang it. Uh, kiss it? Where, where's the kiss option? Let Rue's kiss it? That's as they say, love always prevails. I still hear the ticking. Oh, what a prude. Oh. Let's... <laughs> Let's finish the ticking and see what happens. Are you insane? Do you want us to just blow up? We need to dispose of the bomb, Mega. See, that is our goal. Listen, listen. I get that, but... What if the egg isn't a bomb? Wait, that's right. Mangusi, I think you're onto something. Huh? What's that? Spit it out, kiddo. We don't have any time. Sorry, it's just Espio did say something interesting when we quizzed him about the train manual. Sorry, it's just es Oh! Uh, what if street accurate technology was thought to exist in keeping the train spotless? Robotic arms. During events, they can perform a variety of tasks and are responsible for cleaning up trash and messes afterwards. The robotic arms can also detect weapons or explosive beings brought onto the train, ensuring passenger safety. That's true! That's true! Oh, I see. I was hoping to, uh, to see the other others as well. <laughs> I guess because I was like, I could Captain America it, but no, I ain't, I ain't trying to die on this train. Those robot arms that attacked us in the elevator seem to have a lot of functions here on the train. If a bomb was brought onto the train disguised as this Fabergé chow egg, the arm would have detected it and would have al wouldn't have allowed it on. The only person who knows the uh, coming and going of the train is the conductor, and he surely wouldn't allow such a thing either. So if we're out of options, I think we should wait and see what happens. Okay, we wait. I would have just thrown it back into the vault and like close the door and hope that helps. The enemy get opened. It's hollow, not a bomb at all. I did. I do hope I can open the other vault door. The egg get opened. You both really were onto something. Phew! My, my. Well, that's one way to get the heart racing. I'm completely relieved. My hunch was right, thankfully. Uh, I'll... E... Oh, I said eh. E and... Look what's inside! Oh, look at the little chow! My necklace. Dang, that thing's rocked out. Well, look at that sparkle. And it's so heavy, too. The final secret to the Fabergé chow egg is a chow covered in gems. It's perfect. It's exquisite. It's revolutionary. Is she drooling over a sparkly ornament? I mean, hey, she loves she loves the jewels and the money. Though I must admit, she's a uh, Rouge's material girl. Material girl. Though I must admit, it is stunning. You said no one lived to tell the Fabergé chow egg secrets. I wonder why if the egg wasn't a mom. Because they weren't as tough as you. I don't know. Who cares? What a precious treasure. A beauty to behold. Maybe they naturally died of old ages and just kept the secret with them? <laughs> Maybe. Oh, as much as fun as has been, we should get out of here before we're spotted. Good call. Let's go. Look at him, his little mustache. Look at the child's mustache. No one seems to suspect anything, and the security guard is back at their post. Hope they subdued the drink coaster fiend, okay? 
Thank you both for your assistance. The hunch was exactly the thrill I was seeking. Stealing was strangely fun, but I'd prefer to never do it again. Now Rouge. Rouge. She's completely absorbed in that bedazzled chow. Wait, what? Well, uh, what, what? What is it, darling? About those blueprints now. You're done with them. Maybe we could take a look. While I appreciate your assistance, it's as I said, finders keepers. I'll need them a little longer in case I miss any other treasures, but I promise to let you take a peek later. I don't want to sound ungrateful, but I'm sure you get it, sweetheart. You can't just add sweetheart to the end of a sentence to make things better. <laughs> but I don't think there's any reason with her. She's more powerful than me. Well, well, get out of your way for now then. We have a murder mystery to attend to. Before you go, Shadow gave me and Rouge one of these. He passed through earlier. Let me unlock the door so you can continue forward. You know, we've had a lot of people mention you, Rouge, but we also just have as much suspicion about Shadow. He's unpredictable, that one. Good luck to you. The door's unlocked. Both of you stay safe. Thanks again. Will do. Come on, Magnusine. Let's not... Wait, but... But we didn't interrogate them. Are, like, are we just gonna let them pass just because we... <laughs> Just because we stole an egg together? But what if they're- what if they murdered- What if they murdered Sonic? Why- why are we letting them go? What? It makes no sense! Gotcha, the mystery continue- Okay, okay, cool. <laughs> no cheating. We'll put no- no cheating. Or maybe, uh... Dang, that's such a big jackpot. Tails, we must search the trash bins. Ah, it's empty. Oh? Oh, did I hear it? Oh? I've always believed in a thorough investigation, even peeking in the trash. See, it's about persistence, Tails. My dad told me that when he met my mother, he would drive to her work two hours away every Tuesday with a flower from his garden. She quickly agreed to a date, and when she arrived at the restaurant, she found two dozen roses waiting for her. With a, within a year, the two were married. It's about caring, dedication, and persistence. That sounds very sweet, but all that's in the bin is a lollipop stick. A lollipop stick? Yeah, it's like leftover stick from a lollipop. That's all that's there. Mangosteen. Mangosteen, is everything okay? Did you need me to bring you a flower? <laughs> Just leave me be. Oh, that's such a cute story. The capabilities of these robot arms are quite spectacular. I'm impressed every time we see them. I can't help but wonder how they're controlled. I don't know, the conductor was ordering it around a bit earlier. At the very least, things operated much smoother with them here. I wouldn't worry about it. Yeah, that is true. They are very versatile. Dr. Eggman built a lot of casinos to run around in, but I've never actually sat down to play any for any for fun. Ready for Soholda will want to play Blackjack? I don't know how to play any of these games, y'all. Blackjack? I don't know how to play that. Uh, it's easy. Let me show you. I don't know how to play anything. We can see we simply don't have time for this. We must have been Sonic. Probably a good point. Uh, there's some chips I can click. Is there anything else? Hmm. That's Dr. Eggman's logo. I suppose he does deal a lot with casinos. He's an evil scientist that's always caused trouble for us in Sonic. Hmm, he, every poker chip is personally seen has Eggman's mug on it. This mug on it. So I'm not too surprised to see this here. That's fair. I suppose I shouldn't be so surprised then. Hmm, interesting. There's Rouge. I don't think there's anything else I gotta click, right? Am I missing anything? Hmm, should I give the slot machine a try? Yes, play the slots. No, move on. I, I do want to... I do want to try. <laughs> Alright, let's see. Big money, big money. Well, I lost. Do I try again? No, we don't. <laughs> I respect your restraint. Haha, <laughs> thanks. Yeah, let's not, let's not go down that rabbit hole. 
Is there really nothing else to look at? I'm worried I'm gonna miss something. I guess we could talk to Blaze first. Playing off that ice was much more enjoyable than the rest of these casino games. Uh, can I take your order? Can I interest you in anything on the menu? I'm content for now, thank you. The whole maybe the egg is a bomb thing destroyed my appetite. <laughs> yeah, I was nervous myself. We could tell. You sweat out your uniform pretty often. <laughs> no, they're ch they they're my sweaty pits. <laughs> yeah, you're very um animated person. Wow. Let's find her alibi. Do you think you could go over your alibi again with us, Blaze? When Amy began the murder mystery, what did you do? Sure. We left the dining car and Rouge pulled me aside to talk about the Fabergé egg. We walked and talked to the casino car where we then went our separate ways. I scooped around and discovered the egg was here. Or scoped. After that, I played the slot machines. The train did a sudden jolt, which was odd, but I didn't leave the car. I gave Amy her present when she stopped by. Shadow passed through as well, but it was brief. He gave me the exit key and left. Wait. What? That's a weird order. Why? Why would Shadow leave after Amy? Or is it before when as Amy was coming to us in the dining car? Hmm, interesting. Do you have any sort of proof you were here playing the slots? I do actually. I kept waiting, so I saved the cash out voucher. You could take a look. Let's see here. F Forty thousand credits. That's an enormous payout. How did you? I'm just naturally lucky, I suppose. That smirk. She's so self-aware. I wish I was lucky, guys. I wish I had the big stacks. <laughs> She's so lucky. Oh, God. If only I had such luck. Well, thank you for your time, Blaze. Anytime, Tails. Do tell Cream I said hi, won't you? Oh, yeah, so cute. Thanks again for your help earlier. Now, what can I do for you, darlings? Are you hungry? What? What a plant. Peltry? Peltry? Menu. Not a lot of options, sweetie. I think I'll have to pass. Not a problem. Just let me know if you need something later. Sure, if I need a bag of chips, I'll holler. You think you could go over your alibi again for us, Rouge? Okay, if we're reaching the end at this point, the suspects are like Shadow and the Conductor. <laughs> or Sonic running so fast during the train that he kind of like bumped into something and hurt himself. <laughs> I feel like the outcome's gonna be something silly, but like in a good way. When Amy began the murder mystery, what did you do? Well, once Amy paired Blaze up and I, <clears throat> I immediately roped her in on my Fabergé egg, uh, Fabergé chow egg hunt. We split up the casino car and I went searching for the blueprint. I walked back through the library and saloon cars till I found it in the library car. Did you see Sonic at all during your search? Nope. I don't believe so. I remember him in the dining car at the beginning. He does zoom fast. He is, you know, he is a fast hedgehog. Do you have anything to support that claim? Listen, plenty of people saw me poking around here and I have the blueprints on me. I hardly had time to chase Sonic chase Sonic down, murder him, and find blueprints myself. We appreciate you answering our questions, Rouge. You take care now. Likewise, darling. Alright, I guess uh, that's about it. Ready to get going? Uh, Let's find Shadow. Let's do it. Yay! Time to see my second favorite character. Oh my god, the Chows are playing music! Time to see Shadow, oh my god. Now is as, as good as now is as good a time as any to clean out my pockets. I know you won't talk, but I know exactly what you've been locking why you've been locking those doors. It's hard to get a word in as you talk over me. I have my reasons, I No reason is convincing enough. It's inconceivable what you did. Hey, hey, what's going on? I think he... I think he either forgot to get her a gift or he forgot to, like, wrap it. Hmm, I see you made it here, Tails. But I didn't expect the Iron Chef as well. 
We'll see what you say when you microwave chi chili dogs. Delicious. Chili what? Why would you microwave a chili dog? I'd also like to know why you've been locking doors throughout the train, Shadow. Well, it seems Amy already knows, so ask her. I'm not saying a thing. You lot will have to tell me why. Now, if you could leave me be, I have an appointment coming up. An appointment? Who wants to meet with him? Well, Mangosteen, it seems like Shadow isn't going to talk. Let's do some investigating. Alright, ready to find some answers, Tails. Indubli- Indubitably, my dear Mangosteen. No, I miss clicking that save. I guess I'll just do a like quick replay myself like later. <laughs> just to like click through all the options. Presenting Big Chow Band. Take a beat. Music Planet Zone. There's a closet, there's Amy, there's the band. What if the arms killed him? Like what if the he tripped over the arms or something? Damn, that's a big ass diamond in the middle of the room. Dang. There's a lot of stuff. Let's check the trash can! Tails? No. Tails, I think we should check the trash can. <laughs> oh, every trash bin has been empty, Banksy, and you've been disappointed every time. Are you going to get sad if there's nothing in the trash bin, Mangos Dean? There's always something in the trash bin. <sighs> Alright, let's check the trash bin. What's this? Ha ha ha! Someone printed out the front page of a ticket website. It's for the band Hot Honey. Interesting. Hot Honey is one of Amy's favorite bands. Who cares what it is? Let's add it to our inventory. Are we sure this isn't just trash? I'll, t I'll let you have this. <laughs> There's always success if you check the trash bag. Uh, trash bin. Humble papers added to your inventory. They told us about this in my interview. The lounge has a computer complete with internet access for casual browsing. How lovely. Seems convenient. It is a shame to be on the computer and missing these gorgeous views, though. I feel like you're using the computer here. You must really need to use it. Seems a printer is hooked up to the computer. Can we print something? Sonic rowing a boat. Sonic singing a song. <laughs> Maybe Sonic singing a song would be really cute. Huh, this printer is surprisingly tricky to use. Tricky. Yeah, the user interface is very clear, but it won't let me- it- But I won't let it stump me. And here you go. Yep, this is exactly what I asked for. I, uh, quietly set this back on the printer. Hmm. A key ring must be sha must be Shadow's the locksmith. Interesting. There's only two keys. I figures a locksmith would have a bunch. Well, he gave he gave two keys to Rujan Rujan uh, Blaze, and then he gave one to Knuckles. How many rooms are in this here? One, two, three, four, five. Yeah, so it should add up to about that amount. Uh, interesting. There's only two keys. I figured a locksmith would have a bunch. Wanna take it? Yeah, let's take it. Key ring is added to your inventory. Uh, what else can we look at? Um... Wow, Tails, you have to check this out. Hey, look, it's Big the Cat. These windows are huge. What a view. I didn't realize this train would drive along the coast. Spectacular, isn't it? I just want to hop out and take a dip in the ocean. If this train wasn't so nice, I'd be on. I agree. Despite the murder lingering, murderer lingering in the air. Despite, <laughs> despite the murderer lingering in the air. I just thought the same thing. <sighs> There's another robot arm just doing its thing. As an employee, do you have any power over these arms? Can you tell it to do something? Oh no, but I'll give it a shot. Hey, robotic arm, can you, uh, give me a high five? It doesn't seem to be listening to you, but I can give you a high five. Oh, sweet. Yay, I got a high five. Mangosteen, could you open the wardrobe, please? Sure. Wait, is there a reason you want me to do it? What if something falls out or worse, someone leaves out? I just think you should do it. <laughs> Refuse tails must open it. Open the wardrobe for tails. <laughs> Anything for you. <laughs> All right, watch a pro. 
<laughs> oh, this dust just over the door too fast and blew everywhere. <laughs> hmm. Oh, Tails, do you see this? A pull string. Hey, Gustine. What's it? I gotta activate something. What? The, the back of the wardrobe opened. There's a full passageway back here. How big is this train? <laughs> uh, he's curious. This must mean something big. Oh, no. Oh. It goes into here. This is the library. There's a secret passage from the lab to the library. I don't believe it. Shh, quiet. Back through the passage before they spot us. Hmm. Interesting. Hmm. We need to add that to our inventory. I think we found enough clues. Let's interrogate Shadow and find out what really happened. Hey, it's a big chow band. Play us a ditty, give us a jam. That was spiritual. I feel reawakened. Can we play another thing? <laughs> so cute. They don't miss. Those chows understand music. Hmm. I do want to, I guess, talk to Amy before talking to Shadow. Glad you two finally caught up. I'm surprised it took you as long to get here. I thought you wanted to save Sonic. We've been th thorough. Do you have any clues for us? Just a hot tip, but all will be revealed in due time. I think I'll be shedding a big light on this whole case. Could you please tell us? I hear sharing is scary. <laughs> <laughs> no way, journalist reporter Amy Rose is always first to reveal a scoop. When you're ready to challenge Shadow, talk to him, then I'll be ready. I'm so curious what is it? She's so confident. We'll hold you to it. I'm not ordering a single thing till we get birthday cake. Cake first, dinner after. Otherwise, I'll get full on dinner and can't have any cake. That's a good motto to live by, Amy. A really, really good aim, a motto. You have priorities. I respect that. <laughs> it just makes sense. Hmm. What happens if I just leave? Like, what if I just didn't interrogate anyone and I just kept going? Why did you come over here? <laughs> There's nothing I can help either of you with. I ask that you leave me be. That stare so cold. You know. Thank you for posture check, Kay. I'm gonna fix my back. <laughs> I hope you're well. Welcome in. And I hope you have had a good Friday so far. You know, maybe we'll get out of here actually. Mangsty, you certainly will not. Can I take your order, sir? Can I take your order, sir? Can I take your order, sir? I'll take you up on that coffee. When I'm back in the dining car, I'll whip that right up. A coffee on the train, there's no better combination. Is Shadow the only one that's ordered food on this train? I feel like everyone's been opposed. Except for... Except for, uh... Vector? He wanted something, but now I forget. Some marshmallows would make it perfect. Sure. Coffee and marshmallows? Hi, hi, so glad it's Friday. I hope you had a good day. Yay, I'm glad it's the Friday too for the- it's the weekend. Yay! I had a- I did have a good day. I kind of, um, relaxed. I was working on some stream stuff before stream, and yeah, it's just been a very chill day. Having fun trying to figure out who murdered Sonic the Hedgehog. <laughs> Thank you for headbats. Thank you for headbats. I took every muscle in my body to agree with Tails. Huh? Wait, can I? Oh, I, I, I took his order, that's why. Investigation time! Shadow, we have questions for you. Will you three get out? I'm busy. As I, as I said, I have an appointment to attend to. Sorry, but this is important. Shadow, we've questioned everyone on this train and every single person has mentioned running into you. You've been locking every door in this train and... And I know why. Pray tell why I was locking all the doors. Hee <laughs> hee, time to reveal my hot tip. Hope everyone's ready for a scoop found by yours truly. We're ready. According to the map, the next car in the corridor car where Sonic was stationed 
this door right here in the lounge car is the only door that leads to the conductor car following. So Shadow is locking all the doors for one reason and one reason alone. To keep Sonic from escaping the conductor's car. That I, that I agreed with. I was thinking that too. So you think Shadow was trapping Sonic? I'm sh I sure do. He locked the conductor's car and then locked all the others so no one locked door wasn't suspicious. Pure conjecture. You all get out and leave me be. Well, my source can back up these claims. They will reveal anonymous, but I think the point stands. My sources claim they never saw Sonic again after he went to the conductor car. Why? Because he was trapped and couldn't leave the conductor car. But if he was trapped, how'd he get beat up and put in the dining car? I guess if they went through the secret passage, like he quote quote murdered him, went through the secret passage, didn't run into... Oh, but then that makes no sense because then... Uh, not Charmy. Uh, Espio didn't see him. But then he ran into... Vector and Knuckles at the bar or at the place. So that makes no sense. How how could he carry an unconscious unconscious Sonic to the dining car? Reckless speculation. Is the logic sound though? Was Sonic tra was Shadow trapping Sonic? I feel like he was also trying to stop everyone else from just trying to like <laughs> Give Amy a gift because he hasn't given Amy a gift yet. I'll play along and follow the train of logic, Amy. If Shadow did lock the door to the conductor car and purse, imprisoning Sonic, then how was Sonic found in the dining car? Exactly. I think Mangosteen and I can explain the car change, however. Mangosteen, what evidence do we have that sh shows Sonic could have gone to the dining car? Maybe he found the secret passage? Okay, just get let okay, just get my thoughts in order. Time to think. Time to use my big brain power. Oh, why did I eat that? What? Oh shit, I went the wrong way. Oh shit. Oh crap. No! Oh crap. I gotta do it again. Again. Oh crap. No! Do it again. Oh my god. Shadow, please. short are you kidding me oh god no i moved <sighs> i'm just concentrating This one's hard. No. Please, please. Oh my god! Oh, I'm happy they're giving me another try. I really 
Oh my god, I need to- I need to solve who murdered Sonic! Oh, fucking- Fucking balls. No! Oh my god, this is so hard. That was my fault. I I hesitated. Oh shit. I'm missing coins. Or rings. What? How? Oh my god. How would I get the ones that are so close? Thank you for the raid. Ah. I hope everyone is doing well. My name is Mangosteen, sweetie, and I am a Mangosteen VTuber. I stream uh, action adventure, shooter, puzzles, and uh, choices matter video games. Welcome in, guppies. Welcome in, fellow guppies. <laughs> I hope you're doing well, Bijou. If you need to, you know, relax, let, you know, I get you. Time to, you know, take your little breaky. Uh, BRB for the bathroom. Do what you gotta do, girl. Guppy say hello. Hello, guppies. Hello, fellow guppies. I'm also a guppy. <laughs> how was how was hanging out with Bijou and spending time with her? It's so good. It's go. It's so good to be back and for you know me and Bijou to hang out on a stream again. Oh, hello, honey. Welcome in. <laughs> it's good to see you too. We are trying to find out. Who murdered Sonic the Hedgehog today? <laughs> we're currently interrogating Shadow. I think we're definitely nearing the end of the game. Yeah, I, I kind of just went through a toughy uh, level for a moment, but I, I'm I good. I'm a gamer. I got through it. Hanging with Bijou is always a great time. Yeah, I'm I'm happy everyone can keep Bijou company. Bijou is so wonderful, so I'm glad. <laughs> it's, it's always a wonderful time hanging out in her streams. Did, did y'all get up to anything? I know G uh, Bijou's in the bathroom, so... Uh, was she... Did she play anything? Oh, I have this game, but I haven't played, so I'm gonna leave a lurk. Glad to ha uh, to make it to a stream. Yay, I'm happy, honey. Now, now that I'm back to streaming, hopefully, you know, we'll be able to raid each other someday or hang out in each other's streams. But thank you for lurking. I'll let you know how the game is in the future if you ever decide to play. Splatoon? Ooh. Was uh was Bijou being gamer? <laughs> Mangosteen, I found a hidden passage in the wardrobe that leads right to the library. What? Very gamer. That's good to hear. A secret passage. I I admire anyone that plays Splatoon. Like I've seen I've seen my brother and my one best friend play it, and that like they just move so so fast and they like you know they're like moving left and right and like sucking up <laughs> sucking up more ink and shooting it's insane 
I got there late, but I'm sure Bizu won every match. <laughs> Even, <laughs> secret, secret. Even if she didn't, we say that she won every match. <laughs> So everyone could have used the passage, snuck through the library car, walk past the distracted boys playing arcade, and safely arrive at the dining car. That's true, they were distracted. Knuckles and Vector were distracted playing games. Yes, we all, all guppies believe in Bijou. Uh oh, I froze for a moment. <laughs> Excellent work, Mangosteen. Hmm, this adjust my theory uh this adjusts my theory a bit so shadow murdered sonic in the conductor car but then thought the crime scene being so close to the station was suspicious oh yeah since i am nearing i think i am nearing the end just in case if anyone doesn't want any spoilers feel free to lurk but um you know if anyone has played before i hope you enjoy my reaction to the end but welcome back welcome back Everyone, everyone told me that you were you were cracked in um, Splatoon. Quacked. They said you won every game. <laughs> but yes, if if anyone happens to be um, a Sonic fan, let me know. Uh, we can we can go over our favorite characters. I need to duck out for dinner. Have a great stream. No worries, Cassidy. Thank you for joining Bijou in her raid. Enjoy your dinner. <laughs> Bijou, mega cracked. I'm reading this sentence again just because uh, I have tr when I, I have trouble comprehending when I read something. But so Shadow murdered Sonic in the conductor car, but then thought the crime scene being too close to his station was suspicious. Maybe, maybe that's true. I was actually doing community games with chat and getting absolutely rolled. What? No. <laughs> Oh, but community Splatoon with your guppies, that is adorable. I gotta practice again. They told me you were you were winning every game. I, someone's lying. Someone must be lying here. <laughs> but that's that's such a fun game. I was saying how I, I admire anyone that plays Splatoon. Cause it's like it's just so fast. And then you're moving, you're moving, you're dodging, you're sucking up that ink to, to shoot. <laughs> I mean, uh, yeah, cough. I was waiting so much. I believe you, Bijou. I believe you. <laughs> My head cannon still says Bijou must have won. Bijou must have won. <laughs> yes, platoon is hard. I have trouble with aiming since it's motion controls. Yeah, like it's like I feel like it's like being on a hoverboard or something. <laughs> Shadow picked up Sonic. Locked the door to the conductor car on the way out and dropped the body off at the dining car. Would would Shadow kill Sonic? That seems a little too uh easy. Are you officially accusing Shadow of murder? I am, but of course this is just a theory. I uh, don't have any evidence to back this up other than my hot scoop. Ah, seems Tails and I were more thorough than you. If Shadow's not going to talk, then I'll humor you once again. If Shadow traveled through the hidden passage and appeared in the library car, then how did Espio and Vector not see him? Well, Espio was reading and Vector was distracted gaming. Well, um, I suppose it would have been hard to sneak around two people. I love Sonic the Hedgehog and my favorite character is Metal. Oh, that's so cool! My my favorite character um, is Amy. <laughs> I love Amy. I'm an Amy girl. Uh, second favorite character is Shadow. I love Shadow. Those are my two faves. <laughs> food now. Enjoy your food, Cassidy. Mangosteen, do you have any guesses? Oh, well, Espion Vector didn't see Shadow because... Um... Yeah, Espio was reading. Vector was with Knuckles. Why am I clicking either or? Can't I just click both? I don't know, because they showed- He showed them the game. Espio was reading. I believe Espio was behind a bookshelf at the table reading. Espio reading in the library checks out. That's what he told me to. He's lying. What was that, Shadow? When I completely obliterated Knuckles and Vector at that whatever game, I left the saloon call. 
Yeah, Shadow, Shadow would never murder, never murder his boyfriend. <laughs> I completely agree with you, Gray. Hello, Asai, welcome in. Happy Friday. I hope you're having a good Friday. <laughs> Shadow would never do that, never. I spent some time looking for Espio, but he was not there. He was not in the library. That's true. Even though he said he was reading, he could not be there too. Like, I'd believe you. you cur you're currently my number one suspect. Why were you even searching for Espio, huh? If you must know, I needed to give him a key. As if, why would a locksmith be giving away his keys? I am a lovely model, by the way. Thank you, thank you. <laughs> I'm doing good. My Friday is going well. I worked on some stream stuff before stream. And uh, yeah, just been kind of chilling and enjoying the game since. Trying to, uh, as much as I'm enjoying this game, I am speeding it a bit just so I could, uh, I'm getting hungry. <laughs> but I feel like I'm near the end, which is why I'm, I'm pushing through. But thank you, thank you. I debuted, I debuted my model on uh, Sunday slash Monday when you came in uh, during the Fortnite section. <laughs> yeah. I'm Ungi too, getting food right now. No worries, Biju. Enjoy, enjoy your din din. Let me know what you ate. God, I, I, I'm trying to rush this so then I could eat too and meet you, be, be right there with you. <laughs> That's very true. Everyone's been able to unlock doors for us. I didn't know that. Shadow's been passing out keys? Perhaps Mangosteen and I can further validate Shadow's claims. We can do what? Mangosteen, what evidence supports claims that he was giving away keys? No worries, Asai. That feels good. Now, to get my thoughts in order. Oh god, not another one. Oh shit, 60? Don't mind me, guys. I'm trying to concentrate. Oh shit. Oh shit. Yes, I got 71. Why was, why was that one easier than the other one? That one was so much easier. Hello, honey. Hi, Cairo. Welcome in. Yeah, easy, easy. Easy peasy, lemon squeezy. <laughs> no, thank you, Gray. Uh, we're only saying I'm base because uh, before Bijou did the raid, I was having trouble <laughs> on the other level. <laughs> How are you doing, Cairo? Happy Friday. There's only one reason. There's exactly two keys on that ring. Those were the two keys Shadow meant to give to Espio and Vector. <gasps> Does that mean each person has a key? So glad I raided after that then. Yeah. <laughs> everyone, everyone would have saw me struggling. I was struggling. You're doing okay? Well, I hope your day gets better. I did. I did have a good Friday. <laughs> very chill. Very relaxing. Though, uh, some of these levels in this game were stressing. Were a bit stressy for me. No way. Well, well, what of, what of his own keys? Couldn't one of those be for him? I have my own key on me. Tch, interesting. So let's say Shadow's telling the truth then, what? If Shadow didn't murder Sonic and bring him to the dining car, then what possible reason could he have for locking all the doors? She's right, her theory is strong. Tails and I certainly haven't presented any possibilities. Is Shadow really innocent in Sonic's murder? I don't think he did it. I don't think he did it. I think Mangosteen, and I know exactly why Shadow is locking all the doors. Why does he keep including me too? First, Amy, I just have one question for you. Has everyone totally given you a birthday present? Oh no, oh no. Oh, most everyone, yeah, everyone's been so sweet. Shadow, Shadow, for, Shadow forgot to get Amy a gift. Or it's either Shadow forgot to give Amy a gift or he didn't gift wrap the gift. Just um, Shadow and Sonic haven't given me anything yet, but that's okay. Just them being here is enough. 
Understood. Thank you, Amy. Mangosteen? Uh, yes, Tails? I have a theory, but I need a piece of evidence to support it. We know Shadow walked through every train car locking the exits and he gave everyone stationed in the cars a key. Except for you, me, and Amy. Yeah, poor Amy. <laughs> That's right, the conductor gave Amy her birthday key, not Shadow. So why would he lock all the doors and not give us a key? Shadow wanted to keep us away because he needed time to get Amy a gift. Was Shadow locking on the doors to keep us away? Not us, Magnusine. I'm making a leap here. S stick with me. I think Shadow was trying to keep Amy away. I, guys, I said that. Like, like before this theory, I was like, yo, he's trying to keep Amy away because he didn't get her a gift yet. What? Excuse me? Shadow would never do that. It's my birthday. You know, it's my birthday, right? Don't you, Shadow? How dare Magnusine show me evidence? Oh, poor Shadow and Amy. If Shadow was trying to keep me away, prove it. You've been so thorough or whatever. What proof do you have? Uh, okay, okay. Tails thinks Shadow was trying to keep just Amy away, right? Why? What evidence shows what Shadow didn't want Amy to know? That feels right for you. Just organize my thoughts. Uh-oh. Another level. Another, <laughs> another level, guys. Oh, shit. I have to get 65? Oh, shit. Oh, this is bad. Oh, shit. Oh shit! Ah, I'm missing some. Oh shit! Ah. Ah. Oh my lord! Oh shit! Oh fuck! I missed it. Oh no! My coins! My motherfucking coins! Ah. Huh? No! I was too sh. I was too short. Oh god. If I didn't get hit, I would have got it. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh shit. No, no, no. My coins, my coins. No. Yes, 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 yes. Good, good, good. I didn't miss it. You went brooding through the trash? Huh? What is that? We found this in the trash bin next to the printer. Oh, he was trying to get her stage tickets to her favorite concert. Coins? What are those? <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> I meant to say rings. They're rings. <laughs> It's okay, abandoned tickets website. <laughs> Gray's like, Mango, a fake Sonic fan. <laughs> I, to, to my uh, defense, I've only ever played like four Sonic games or even three, so. <laughs> Tails, don't. Tails, oh, this is a hot honey website. No way, I love them. Uh, hot honey? It's the band I'm currently obsessed with. Jeremy B is uh, my current favorite. All the members have B after their name. Yeah, he isn't cute. I haven't gone to any of their shows yet to see them though. Their tickets are really hard to get. You have to be ready online at a specific time and they sell out in minutes. Oh, that's why, that's why. So the question becomes, why was the paper found in the train car Shadow was stationed in? Watch yourself, Fox. The situation is becoming much more clear. I don't know how Tails figured things out so soon, but I see where he's heading. The printer of the Hot Honey Band Ticket website exists because Shadows was buying tickets for Amy. What? Shadow? Is this true? Wait, if both Shadow and Sonic didn't get Amy a present, what is... Like, is Sonic gonna buy something for her? Because I know, obviously, like, it's like people ship, like, Sonic and Amy and stuff, and it's like, bro, did bro forget to get her a gift? I hope not. Are you trying to get me concert tickets for my birthday? I've done a poor job hiding the surprise, it seems. Yeah, he, he totally forgot, unfortunately. It's... 
Yeah, I'm trying to get you concert tickets for your Like, Shadow's putting in more effort. <laughs> Shadow. I used that printer earlier and I found it difficult to manage. Oh, sorry if you hear a motorcycle run by. I'll read that line again. I used that printer earlier and I found it difficult to manage. When logging on the website, did you print the homepage by accident? <laughs> you print the homepage. <laughs> Honestly, Shadow and Amy, kinda. I'd ship it. Bijou. <laughs> Bijou, my girl. So, earlier, when no one was around, I, I said a little secret. And I'll tell you all the secret again. I'll tell you the secret after the motorcycle passes the street. But, don't tell anyone, guys. But I ship them. <laughs> I am a Shadow Amy shipper. I ship Shad Amy. And the fact that he got, he like, I know he forgot her birthday, but he scrambled to get her concert tickets. Like, and it's, it's like, you know, not to compare, but it's like, what did, what did Sonic get her? You know what I'm saying? <laughs> and he, he tried like everything in his power. Like, yo. So. That secret stays with us. <laughs> stays with everyone in chat today. <laughs> How that, yes, that's exactly what happened. I'm not fantastic with computers, admittedly. I can't believe this. After I accused you of murder. Spill everything, Shadow. The cat's out the bag. I want to know everything. I ship it now, too. Thank you, Bijou. Thank you for being a fellow Shad Amy shipper as well. Oh my god, I just realized this whole time chat has been hiding Shadow's face, and so have I. I'm so sorry, King. Wait one moment. Let me move myself. How can I move? Uh... Let me check. Alright, can y'all still hear me? I moved myself for a little bit. But yeah, there's our king. There's our the, our awesome shadow king. <laughs> I didn't mean to. I didn't mean to. <laughs> I know, Shadow Amy versus Son Amy. God. All right, I'm back. <laughs> I'm so sorry, King. Actually, maybe I should move for like the, the rest of this uh, interrogation. I'll be over here. <laughs> Bijou, I'm not gonna say anything, but I you know, I feel the same. I feel the same. Ayo. <laughs> now I'm covering tails. It's okay. I was covering tails. This is, uh, what is it? I was... I wasn't covering tails this entire game, so we're just gonna cover tails for now. <laughs> Fine, the surprise is ruined anyway. Ooh, probably our fault there. Oh, sorry, that's all detective's job is, I suppose. <laughs> when I arrived on the train, I realized everyone else had a gift except me. Worried for my social status, I immediately began brainstorming ideas and solved the computer. I remember Amy had never seen Hunt Hot Honey live and it looked up. That's when I accidentally printed the homepage. The concert tickets weren't actually on sale, I realized, but would be available soon. Is that the appointment you kept speaking of? The time you're able to actually buy the concert tickets? Oh, that's the appointment he was talking about. All the chows in the background playing instruments. Yeah, they're in a little band. I mean, I can understand Bijou after all. He is the coolest. He is the mega coolest. We are Team Shadow here. No worries, Bijou. Take your time. Precisely. I haven't purchased the tickets yet. I knew I had to keep Amy away while I waited to buy the tickets, so I began locking all the doors. But for the safety of everyone, I handed out keys so they could get in and out, telling them not to let anyone through. It didn't work. Amy still managed to make it here somehow. It's because the conductor gave me this. The key, this key opens up all the doors on the train. I've gone through every locked door with ease. The plan fatal. The plan's fatal flaw. The birthday key. It should have guessed. It. It's a well-known privilege. Privilege. Shadow Eye, your gesture is so sweet. And after I accused you too, how about this? Let's buy the tickets later and make it up to you. You can come. <gasps> They're gonna go to the concert together. They're going to the concert together. This is so cute. Oh, I, I, 
Wrong button. I need to move again. Amy X Shadow is real. Shad Amy is confirmed. Confirmed. Guys, it's confirmed. They're going to a concert together. I uh, I don't know if too late. It's happening. I can't wait. The show of a lifetime. It's canon. They're going to this concert together. Oh, fine. And he said fine. I love it. I love I love this Sundari energy. Happy birthday. And he said happy birthday to her. Happy birthday, Amy. I expect lots of pictures from the concert, you two. <laughs> Seems the mystery of Shadow's locked doors has finally reached the end. I blame my source for all this. That wasn't a hot tip at all, leading me to believe Shadow was behind everything. My credibility as a, jur uh, a journalist reporter down the drain. Amy, I'm curious, who is the source of your uh, big scoop? All those demon art artists, they were right. Yes! Oh my god. So, not to date myself, but uh, has anyone been on DeviantArt before? Because I've been thinking about this the entire game. If you've been on DeviantArt, there was this like popular Shadow and Amy fan art of them like in fancy clothes. It was like gray, black and white. And they're kind of like in a checkered world, like a checkerboard world. And like they're both like bowing and stuff. And I remember like the art was so popular and so well drawn that it got like an award on DeviantArt. But that that piece was bomb. That was the that was like one of the best Shadow Shad Amy arts out there. <laughs> I know. Bijou, you missed it. They're going to the concert together. Shad Amy has been confirmed. I haven't seen it. I gotta look it up. I, I'll post it in my Discord later, Bijou, if you want to check it out. Or I could also share it in your Discord for everyone. I'm gonna share it and you're, and all the other guppies are gonna be like, what the hell is this girl posting? <laughs> Amy, I'm curious, who is the source of a big scoop? I would like to know as well. Sorry, strictly confidential. My credibility, credibility may be shot, but my principles must stay in. I have a strong feeling I know exactly who your source is. Hmm? Yeah, don't worry, Bijou. I'm gonna do it right after dinner. <laughs> but we need to investigate one last area. The conductor's car. I'll come with you. I'd love to know who's been dragging my name through the mud. And I'll join as well. Time to see this through the end. We're more than happy to have both. Have you both. Mangosteen, I hate to say it, but I believe our investigation is finally coming to a close. The pieces are coming together. The full picture is becoming clearer and clearer. Let's end this, Tails. We'll pin down Sonic's murderer for good. <laughs> I welcome the Sonic fan art. Bring it on. Okay, I'll do it. I'll do it. Before we continue, does anyone have any suspects? Like, who, do you like? Do you have any like guesses on who you think the murderer is? I know some people just stopped in uh, recently, but like even even so. You think Sonic killed himself? <laughs> I love how chipper they are about someone being literally dead. It's okay. I think Sonic is more hurt than dead because they're they're doing like um they're doing like a murder mystery party for Amy's birthday. So my theories my theories are uh, I do agree with Gray a bit. Part of me thinks that maybe Sonic hurt himself. Like, maybe he was, like, running around too fast. He tripped over, like, those robotic arms. And then he hurt himself, like, crashing into the dining car area. Because when we got there, the dining car was messed up. And he was, like, hurt. <laughs> no, it wasn't me. It wasn't me. I was knocked out the whole time. I have, I have, uh, alibis. I was with Amy and Tails in the beginning when I was knocked out. <laughs> and then, um... My other, my other suggestion or my other theory is that, um, it's Dr. Eggman. Like he, uh, I think he's imposing as, like he's, uh, pretending to be the conductor. Because like, the train runs on robotic arms. And Dr. Robotnik 
uses arms or uses robots and tech and stuff. So I think that's my other theory. And what is a Sonic game without uh, Eggman being the villain? <laughs> those, those are my suggestions before we go forward. Let's end this, Tails. We'll pin down Sonic's murderer for good. Right on, let's do it. Ready to go to the conductor car? Let's finish this. <laughs> Robotnik Baldy McNose hair? Yes, Baldy McNose hair. <laughs> it's now or never. The, it, the Dr. Eggman. The conductor car. Or if he was able to hijack the train. Shit. Should really sort out my evidence before I continue. In my short time working on this train, I haven't visited the conductor car yet. Feels empty. Wait, where's the conductor? That's odd. I haven't seen him through the train at all. The last we saw him was when he left the dining car. Something clearly happened here. Nothing we can't figure out. Come on, time to investigate. Let's crack on. Oh my god, look at Shadow, so cool! They're so cool! Wait, now I gotta move again. Oh my god! Wait, hold up. I'm gonna take a screenshot. I'm gonna take a screenshot. Wait. <laughs> I can't take a screenshot. Hello? Screenshot, please? No, I can't take a screenshot! I'm trying to screenshot. Maybe if I click here? Screenshot? There we go. Alright, I'm taking a screenshot. And then I gotta paste it. I gotta paste it into Affinity real quick. Wait, 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 guys. Hopefully, hopefully OBS doesn't accidentally crash with me opening all these programs. Uh, let's see. Paste from clipboard. New from clipboard. There we go. I might make this my new wallpaper. <laughs> uh, um, the uh, the art in this is good. Like, they did not have to go this hard. They didn't, but yeah, the art is so beautiful. And each character has so many different expressions. Have you come across Metal yet? Metal, sadly, is not in this game. Uh, oh, you took a screenshot? Thank you for taking a screenshot too, Bijou. Just in case I accidentally lose mine. Um, and it's all free for 99 cents. <laughs> this game is free? Yeah, the game is free 99. Yeah! I should play this someday on stream, maybe. Even though I'm spoiling it for myself, maybe I should look away. Yeah, Bijou, uh, oh, but then I gave you my theories and now I feel bad. If you feel like lurking now, it's okay. Uh, this this game is fun. It's a it's a quick game. It's like two, like online it said the game is about two two to three hours, but I kind of I think just because I read slow, it kind of took a while. But but yeah, if you if you want to lurk now, no worries. <laughs> oh yeah, you'll forget it by the time. But okay, we'll could we'll continue. Let's investigate. Event. Hmm, it's a large one. Seems like at least one person could fit through. Not a problem for me, but I'm sure how'd you get uh sure how'd you get up there? Okay, I will hop out now, but have fun. Have a good night, Bijou. Thank you again for the raid. Wait, why wouldn't it be a problem for you? Oh, uh, the tails, right. <laughs> Maybe see uh Oh I'll forget the theories, but not the actual ending, so yeah. Oh, okay, okay, yeah, yeah. <laughs> see you later, girl. Good night, good night. Yeah, yeah, I will. <laughs> I'll have I'll have a the the Shad Amy clipboard in my affinity, and I'll be like, what is this again? <laughs> a spilled coffee. Nine nine. Did this fall over when the train sped up? Not sure. Wait, what's it say on the mug? A cup of Joe in your hand, wife by your side, paradise. All right, all right, we get it. He loves his wife. Wow, the conductor looks so young in this uniform. He's been here a long time. After 32 years, he told me he's finally retiring. 
He said he headed to Spagonia with his wife. I hope they have a great trip. 32 is a long time. I wish them a lot of happiness. May any future sorrows be fleeting. Oh, that's such a nice sentiment, Shadow. Oh, yes. I wish that too. We gotta check the trash can one more time. You know, I'm alright. I don't need to check the trash bin. You're satisfied with finding a clue here before, huh? I know they always say, always check the trash bin, but I'm good. I'll go out on a high note. Uh, there's some speakers. There's some other things. I want to make sure I don't miss like any edge stuff. A microphone. We can talk to the whole train with this. Hmm, should I say something? Start beatboxing. If you can hear this, your armpits take. I'll start beatboxing. Mango Steve, why are you reaching for the mic? <laughs> Just uh, offering our guests some musical entertainment. That was impressive, Mango Steve. Thank you for sharing. This robot arm has been completely torn off. Yuck, how creepy. Yeah, Shadow's face like, what the fuck? <laughs> Are you winning, Mango? Hello, Bochi. I am winning. I'm winning. I'm near the end. I hope you're having a good Friday, Mochi. Uh, Mochi, if you don't want spoilers, it's okay to lurk. This is the end of the game. Yeah, we're reaching end game. Thank you for lurking, Cairo. No worries. Yeah, we're reaching end game. If no one wants uh spoilers for the end, feel free to lurk. That arm is powerful. It'd be tough to break out of its grip. A lot of people have strength to tear this off, but the question is why? I'm sure I'll be fine. Okay, Mochi, I just want to make sure. Hmm. Oh, thank you for popping in. A confirmation definitely occurred in this room. A confrontation definitely occurred in this room. We should log this. Aye, aye, sir. Broken robot arm is added to your inventory. Hmm, what's this? Was someone playing darts? Oh, they probably... Maybe, maybe, like, the conductor got, like, knocked out, uh, and that's when the train got, like, ru uh, messed up. Or, uh, went really fast. That's not a dart, that's a blow dart. Someone bought a, brought a weapon onto this train. Hmm, that shouldn't be possible. Tails is right, the train detects any weapons on a passenger before letting them aboard. So it has to be someone that has already been on the train. Let's make note of this. Blow dart is added to your inventory. I think we found enough clues. Let's talk to Amy and solve this once and for all. Oh, but I didn't click the other stuff. I've noticed these screens throughout the entire train. Yeah, they used to show information in advertisements. They're nice. The picture's really clear. I would watch a full movie on one. I saw a slide that said happy birthday, Amy. That was so cute. The next ad being for nasal medication was a little jarring, though. The high quality screens probably didn't do it the added in favors not at all perhaps too much detail i didn't realize these robot arms could also drive the train yeah but they can't access every function on a train like the conductor can did they teach you how to drive it oh no but how the work the microwave uh, thank you for posture check mochi i will fist my posture I will no shrimping on your watch. Thank you. Thank you for, for unshrimping me. I do love shrimps though. I'll sit up. Just for you, Mochi. Just for you. Just kidding. Just for anyone with other motifs. <laughs> I recognize some of these functions. Maybe I could drive the train. I would completely trust you to drive the train. Same actually. It's true. You could drive this train flawlessly. Ah, guys. Okay. Isn't it odd we haven't seen the conductor since the dining car? I figured he'd have had to drive the train the entire time. I guess the same, but the train's quick speed is odd and we currently don't know where he is. I hope he's alright. Amelia, I do miss his laugh. Ha 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 ha. Alright, I think that's enough clues. Well, you two, think you have enough evidence for me to call everyone here? It's high time we named a suspect. What do you think, Mangosteen? Ready to solve this case? We're ready to solve this case, y'all. Everyone, this is the birthday girl speaking. Please report to the conductor car at once. Does that mean Dead Sonic is also here? Oh, 
Wonderful to have you all here. Tails and I are ready to announce our prime suspect. With assistance from Anglestein. Why has Sonic... Why hasn't Sonic shown up? Sonic's fucking dead. Vector, real quick, can you come with me to get Sonic? He must still be pretending to be dead. Lazy bum. Ready, let's go get him. Let me tell you, darlings, this has been a delight. A delight? The air in here is so intense, I love it. Nothing like a thrill of mystery. The train has so many amenities, I feel so catered to. Admittedly, I've been having a lot of fun myself. The amusement of Chase. I see why you're a detective outside of this mystery espio. You and I love a good thrill, it seems. But on this train, I am but a humble poet. I'll be willing to do an event like this again. It says here the train goes, uh, does escape rooms as well. I love escape rooms. Count me in. I'm so glad everyone's having a good time. Yeah, Blaze is so pretty. I never knew she was a princess, but she's a princess from another dimension. Maybe we could ride a train just to relax sometime? Ha, ah, yeah, that'd be fun too. What in the world? That's Amy's voice. Quick, where's Amy? <gasps> Sonic is dead! He's not responding to us. Sonic! Sonic! What, is he hurt? Why isn't he moving? Sonic, Sonic, can you hear us? He's banged up. Is there a pulse? It's weak. Set him down, Vector. Make sure his head isn't popped up. I'll help you. I knew one of you could could would take this too far. Which one of you did this to Sonic? On my birthday, no less. Shadow, uh, Shadow, Shadow, quick, give him mouth to mouth. <laughs> quick, Shadow, give your, your uh, boyfriend mouth to mouth. I know, Sonic done bit the dust. Another one bites the dust. He's done deed. Oh shit, she got the hammer out. Yeah, she, she's out for vengeance. Oh my god, maybe I should be in the middle. But then I feel like I'm hiding the text out. I'll be back over here. <laughs> Could this really have been one of us? There's no one else here, Knuckles. So I'll ask again, which one of you did it? This is inexcusable. Sonic's hurt. I'm going to expose the monster who did this. Tails is not having it. I thought Sonic could handle anything, but somehow he met his match. I'm going to help you get to the bottom of this, Tails. Absolutely. Me too. Same. We're going to figure out exactly what happened in this room and punish the one responsible. Sonic. He really was hurt this whole time and I did nothing. I'm right. I'm writing my wrong. I must take down the murderer. Tails. Mangosteen. I have a big question to ask. Who in this room did this? Who killed Sonic the Hedgehog? Wait, do we really pick? Okay. This is... Okay, here is now my other theory presented. I think it was Amy. <laughs> Amy found out she didn't get a gift, and so she beat the shit out of him. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I I think I think she beat the shit out of him. That can't be right. Neither Tails or I can be the murderer. Oh, that's right. Let me pick again. Who in this room did this? Who killed Sonic the Hedgehog? Wait, but even so, it's like she could she was awake. She was awake before any of us. Oh, but she was in the locker stuck with us, so maybe not? <laughs> it was Mochi! It was Mochi! <clears throat> hmm. Can I pick someone else? Is- did actually one of them do it? What happens if I click Amy again? Okay, okay, alright. We're gonna have to think game-wise then, okay. So... Amy and Tails are next. They cannot be the murderers because they're the detective and the journalist. Um, Shadow was trying to buy tickets for Amy. 
this is hard. I don't know who did it. And then Knuckles was distracted with the game. But who would have a blow dart? Maybe it's like Rouge or it's... Maybe it's Blaze? Cause no one- cause even though Blaze won and has all the tickets, she's like from another dimension? Espio cause he's a ninja? Maybe. Hmm. Now I feel like all my theories since the beginning of the game are thrown out the window. <laughs> cause now I'm not really sure. But Espio... Vector saw him reading. I think maybe it's Blaze. Mm, I don't see it. Care to explain your reasoning? Oh, well, um, when I'm putting on a spot like this, it's hard to explain. Maybe I'll pick someone else. Who in this room did it? Who killed Sonic? Uh, I guess we could try SPO? I feel like SPO was also my second guess. <gasps> SPO murdered Sonic! Weren't you? I did no such thing, my young friend. But if it's a battle you of wits you wish, I would love to discuss things. Let's discuss. What the? You're accusing Espio? We already talked about this. The man was reading. You have nothing. Restarting Espio's alibi would be helpful for everyone, I think. Espio was locked in the library reading. He only had access to the salon card during the murder. However, new evidence has come to light that needs to be addressed. New evidence. Oh, that's right. Mangosia, could you fill everyone in? What did we find that brings into question Espio's alibi? We discovered the hidden passage. Espio could have left the library at any point because Tails and I found a hidden passage from the library. To the lounge. In the lounge, the hidden passage exists behind the wardrobe. I feel lucky we even found it. Okay, if Espio is the killer, it does make sense because he also had... He had a book of the manual for the car, so that also helps too. Not only would Espio avoid any locked doors, but that would put him in the car just before this one. You have no evidence. I used any secret passage. I answered all your questions without flaw. I was reading the entire time, remember? It's true, you didn't miss a question. But I think Mangostine and I can explain that too, Mangostine. How did Espio know everything in the train manual he was reading? <laughs> we could say he's a ninja uh, who speed reads, or he's a poet so quick to read. <laughs> Espio, he's a ninja. Oh my god, Gray, you're so right. Gray, Gray is big brain. Gray knew. Espio's a ninja. He's fluent in 17 different languages and remarkably disciplined. <laughs> Gray, ballin'. What are you getting at? You picked a random book from the shelf and memorized it. Just to guarantee yourself a clean alibi. What? <laughs> Fuck it, we ball. That's absurd. Memorizing a whole book? I know this is a talented bunch, but that seems like a lot. I don't know. It is plausible. Espio is practically, particularly skilled. I've known Espio a long time. He once speed ran a book I was reading just to spoil the ending for me. Dang, Espio. Dang, Espio and Knuckles go that way, that far back? Heh. If I'm right and Espio quickly memorized a book before entering the hidden passages, then Espio could have met Sonic the in the conductor car where he was murdered. Since we're only talking in what ifs, let me throw something at you. How was I to know about the hidden passage? It's hidden. That's right, how would Espio have even known it was there? You said it yourself, kid. You were lucky to even find the passage. Mangostine and I might not have evidence to answer your question, but we know someone who does. Who here has evidence to prove Espio knew about the hidden passage? I think Rouge. Uh. They were both in the game Chaotix. Oh, I don't know. I didn't know that. I think Rouge, because Rouge has the map. Rouge, we need to see those blueprints. Blueprints? You stole blueprints? 
Whatever, I already used it to scout for more treasure. Came out cold. You can have it. Blueprints are added to your inventory. This right here is a blueprint of the entire train. Espio could have easily used this to find the hidden passage. What makes you think I saw those blueprints? Rough uh, Rouge had them. Well, Mangosteen, do you have an answer for him? How could Espio have seen those blueprints? He found them before Rouge did. Rouge, where did you find the blueprints? Oh, a uh, library car. It was stuffed in with the brochures. I checked the saloon car first, then found the blueprints after leaving. So that means Espio had the time to find the blueprints and discover the hidden passage. In my theory, Espio looked at the blueprints and then used the hidden passage to get to Sonic. Within Amy's guidelines, the murder can kill a single participant who, however they choose. The logistics are still vague, but Mangosteen and I have evidence of how Sonic was murdered. I'm unsure how much harm Espio caused Sonic, but Mangosteen and I have evidence on how it was done. Oh, this is rich. Pray tell. If I murdered Sonic, how did I do it? <coughs> Come on, focus your close back and see what would Sonic do. Oh god, I have to do another thing! Oh shit. Oh my god. Oh shit! Oh crap, I missed the ones in the middle. No! No, I forgot to jump. Oh shit, oh shit. No! Oh, the fuck! No! Oh god. Try again. Ooh. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh. No, I was eight short. God. Oh shit, oh shit. Yay, I did it, I did it. I did it! <laughs> Yay, woo! This blow dart was found here in the courtroom. This blow dart- oh yeah. Yeah, I'm gaming, I'm gaming, guys! <laughs> I believe FCO used this to knock Sonic unconscious. Ah, so you mean Sonic might just be knocked out? I'm unsure, he's more banged up than what a blow dart would do. According to Amy's rules, a blow dart counts as a kill for the murder mystery. My theory, therefore, is plausible. Possible, you say? Then why are there so many holes in it? You deny the allegations? Of course I do. Let me present the first fatal flaw. If I knocked out Sonic in the conductor's car, then how is Sonic found in the dining car? Ah, oh, shoot, that's a good point, but Tails was onto something. I'm sure of it. I locked all the doors and Espio didn't have a key. He would have had to take the hidden passage back. If he took the hidden passage back, he'd end up back in the library. Mingstein and I know another way that could have been done. We do? What piece of evidence do we need to take a closer look? Hmm. Maybe this one? I th yeah, I think it's the map because he has, 
he has a blueprint, so there's probably like hidden passages everywhere. Oh, motherfucker. Oh, fuck it. No, I was jumping. Shit. Oh shit. Oh fuck! Oh shit! No! No! Hello! Hello, my cousin. Welcome in. Thank you, I'm trying. Krishna. Uh, if you don't want to be spoiled, I am at the end of this game, so if you'd like to look away or lurk, I understand. <laughs> God dang it. Uh, but thank you for popping in. I hope you're having a good Friday. Oh shit! No, I meant to jump! <sighs> oh shit! No! <sighs> I forgot to click that one. Thank you so much, Queen. I hope you had a good day too. <laughs> I did, I did have a good day. Uh, I just worked on uh, some stream stuff and then I uh, was streaming. Oh fuck. Oh fuck, okay, that one, that one was a bad one. Uh... Oh shit. I know, I am in Spain. Oh my god. I don't think I'm gonna make it to have enough rings. No, I don't have enough. I don't even- I uh, just, like, have half. Alright, we're trying again, y'all. Oh, fuck. Again? No! God oh, dang it. Shit. Yes! Just two over! Nice. In Spain with the out uh in Spain without the S or the A. Uh, I think I'm in uh Spain without the, uh, the S. <laughs> Thank you for lurking. Alright, let's look. If Espio did take the secret passage to get to the dining car, then what route did he take to get to Sonic there? That there, there's a path above the conductor car and it goes all the way to the dining car. Yeah, because there's like an elevator for some reason. Huh? I didn't even see that area. Is that some sort of long attic? According to these blueprints, there's a hidden path ceiling that leads straight to the dining car. Perhaps you can access it through the vent over there. Oh yeah, the vent! The vent, of course. That must be the uh, entrance to the place. Allow me to check it out. Knuckles is like, I got this. My word, there's a path back there and a track. A track? A track for the robot arms, I think. That must be the path the arms take to move through the train. So you're saying I somehow fit with Sonic in the vent and took him to the dining car. Tails, you're a smart kid, so I know you realize we both could fit. Uh, we couldn't fit up there. Espio's right. This feels feeling flimsy, Tails. I need an answer. My name's getting dragged around here. How on earth would I get Sonic through the vent? Dude, not a thing about my argument. You can do this, Mingusi. You got this. Alright, guys. Oh, shit! Alright, I messed, I messed that one up. Shit! Oh, shit! Oh my god! 
There's so much. Ah! Oh my god. No, that one is hard. Shit. Okay, let's go again. Oh shit! Oh no! No! This is so hard! I'm losing my rings! What the hell? Why did I ditch that? Oh, I failed that one. God dang it. <laughs> Thank you, Gray. Thank you so much, Gray. Yeah, it's it's nearing it's nearing end game, so it's getting hard. Oh shit! No, I meant to jump. Shit! Oh my god! No! Oh my god! Why are there no more coins? What the heck? No! God, no. Shit. Please, please, please. I need 70. I don't know how I'm gonna get 70. No. Come on. Oh, shit. No! Shit. I didn't mean to go too close. Oh my god, this is so hard. No! Oh my god. Shit. Oh no, no, no. No! Why am I moving so much? No! Take my energy, you got this. Thank you, Gray. <laughs> Thank you for sending your energy to me. Oh my god! No, come on! Ah! God, I think I just have to like friggin' jump more. Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! Uh -huh. Shit! Oh no. There's no way I'm making that. God, that's tough. That is so tough. How am I gonna get 70? Are you kidding me? Oh. No, shit. 
No. Ten, eleven more. Oh god. That was a mistake. Alright, I gotta kill this one because I fucked up bad. Oh my god. Please, we're near the end. I'm trying to eat dinner. <laughs> oh god, and then I fucked that one up. Alright, we're just... We're, we're gonna restart that one. Oh my god, are you kidding me? Yeah, it's it's getting late and I know that I'm near the end, so I, I'm kinda yeah. I'm letting it be my motivation. Hardcore. Oh my god, are you kidding me? Oh <laughs> Okay, I gotta- I gotta throw that one. I gotta throw that one. Oh, oh shit! Oh god. Oh my god, I'm always like 10 short. Like if I if I don't get hit, like I would win. Oh my god, are you kidding me? Please, 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 please. No, I don't have enough. <gasps> All right, we're trying again. <laughs> we're trying again, y'all. to jump the oh, shit Oh my god. I believe you can pierce the heavens. <laughs> oh, thank you, Gray. I, I'll, I'm trying my best. I'm, I'm really trying. Oh god. Oh my god. 
just, it's hard when I'm like trying to dodge and then I hit the edge too much. <sighs> no, like to get 70, I literally can't be hit. And I just keep, and if it's not like the shuriken, it's the spikes. Alright, I messed that one up. Come on. Okay, that was that was me being impatient. Oh my god. No. Oh, guys, I'm getting so discouraged. Like, this is so hard. There's, like, it's it's one thing if, like, okay, the things are hitting me, but, like, when you're near the end, there's not enough rings for me to even try to collect at all. $69 if you win, go. What do you mean? What do you mean $69? This is the run. Go, Vega, go. I know it's so close. I need to try. Uh. Uh. Oh, God. if you cook right now trust mochi that is so kind of you you do not need to give me 69 bucks if i win mochi you could get <laughs> you you being here is enough you can you can give me 69 minutes of your time or you could give me uh, 69 bits <laughs> which is just 69 cents <laughs> okay i'm not doing this well on this one so i'll i'll try again I'm gonna throw this one. Alright, we're gonna try this again. We're gonna try this again. Shoot, I missed it. Fuck. Alright, that one's bad. We... Okay, we definitely have to throw it every time we get hit because we cannot make these... We cannot make these back. God. Shit, fuck. Shit. Shit, fuck, I meant to jump that one. Thank you. Thank you everyone for your support. Oh fuck, I meant to jump. Shit. Shit, shit, shit. Oh, I don't think I'll have enough rings for this round. 
Oh god. How... Even if I finish the map, how am I gonna get... I'm always missing like 10. Oh, motherfucker. Shit, what? I didn't even move that time! Oh my god. See, like, how... Do I, like, really not have to be hit at all? Oh my god, my fingers are, like, feeling intense right now. with a capital A. Oh my lord, guys. They couldn't have just given me the one? Wait, is it possible to get the four horizontal rings at once? I don't think so. Because, like, you're, you're technically only doing WASD and you can only move left and right. I'm very late from the raid party behind Mango. No worries, too much, <laughs> too much, too much Gamma. I thought you were too much dog. What? Or did you change your username? That's okay. Welcome in, too much. <laughs> I'll call you too much for now. Oh god. All right, guys. Oh god. Oh my god. No, motherfucker! Oh my god. I was so close with that one. Are you kidding me? Oh, no, 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 I, meant, I didn't mean to hit that one. Oh, shit, I won't get 10 from this. Yeah, I can't... I got hit too many times. <laughs> you transformed. <laughs> at least, at lo as long as you add too much to your name, then I'll, I'll remember that it's you. Thank you, Gray. I'm trying. Insane. I'm drinking water. What the fuck? That was ridiculous. Oh god. Oh god, yippee! <laughs> yippee, we did it! Thank you everyone for cheering me on. <laughs> I'm supposed to have a relaxing 
Oh, I'm also eating candy, by the way. I was supposed to have a relaxing weekend. What the fuck happened? This game is not relaxing at all. I thought... I thought it was seriously just gonna be a mystery game. Oh, fuck. <laughs> oh. Oh, we're taking a short break. I'm eating. I'm eating candy. <laughs> God, that's insane. You thought murder was relaxing? I thought trying to find the mystery was relaxing. Cause I had a feeling Sonic wasn't really dead. It's a murder mystery party. But yeah, thank you everyone for your support. God. My fingers were just moving everywhere. They were moving and grooving. Oh god. Sonic's just sleeping really heavily. Heavily, yeah. <laughs> Bro is knocked the fuck out. <laughs> Alright. I'm gonna eat two more pieces of candy. And we'll continue this game. And then we gotta beat it. Because I gotta eat dinner. <laughs> Oh man, that was ridiculous. Candy, share? I would share it, Mochi, if I could throw it to you, if I could transfer it through the screen. Oh, oh god. Actually, while we're doing this little ad break, If anyone is interested in joining my Discord, here's the link. Um, my Discord is currently under construction, but feel free to come in. Um, it's mostly done. There's just some last tweaks I gotta deal with. No pressure, of course, you don't gotta join if you don't wanna, but... I, I will be uh, updating, you know, if you're interested in when I go live, or I will be posting, um, uh, try to do like some community, ni community nights when I have energy. And I'll be posting codes there for days I have community nights on stream. Big twist at the end is you gotta beat the mini game one more time. Gray. If I do, <laughs> if that's the case, I'd put I'm putting y'all on a BRB screen. I gotta eat dinner. It's late for me. I'm already pushing it. Oh. Alright, last bit of candy. Mmm, yummy candy for my reward. Mmm, delicioso. I'm gonna eat dinner late and my mom is gonna be like, what the fuck? <laughs> I hope I don't stay up too late though, but... I'll try my best not to. Oh, intense. All right, one more sippy of water. Mm. All right, guys, let's continue. <laughs> oh God, please no more mini games. Everyone saw the broken robot arm on the ground, right? Clearly a fight broke out here and one of those robot arms was a casualty. But what if one of the robot arms actually caught Sonic? Knuckles said there's a track the robot uh a track the robot arm uses that continues through the vent. A robot arm could have grabbed Sonic passed out from a blow dart and carried him to the dining car. Could that be true? Take a look, Sonic, he's clearly banged up. <laughs> Bro was knocked out and the arms fucking dragged him through the vent. <laughs> but where is the conductor through all this? Could the fight have been between Sonic and the robot arms? I can see that the arms, those arms do look powerful. Sonic doesn't fall easily, but if he's woozy from a blow dart, the, ar the arms could have gotten him. Interesting theory tales. But you'd have to admit, these are a lot of coincidences. I might not be able to think everything directly to, uh, link everything directly to Espio yet, but I have found one inconsistency. What kind of inconsistency? 
someone here received false information and I believe that informant came from SBO. Who received that information? Amy, because she had her source. Amy, you received a hot scoop, didn't you? I think it's time you told us where the scoop came from. Tails, you're, you're right. Espio lied to me. Espio told me Shadow was locking doors to trap Sonic. But we found out Shadow was trying to keep me from discovering my birthday present. The scoop came from you, Espio? Whole snaps. <sighs> oh no, of course not. Amy must have misheard me. Misheard you? Oh, <laughs> bro. <laughs> Is Espio gaslighting? <laughs> Yes, I said uh, Sonic's going to get trapped with all these locked doors. I was just looking out for my fellow passenger safety. I didn't blame Shadow. I don't know, Espio. What? The evidence might not be airtight, but there's a lot being thrown at you that makes sense. I have to agree. You want us to believe you were lazily reading the whole time while you were stationed in the room with a hiding pa uh, hidden passage? I agree. There's no way bro was just sitting around like reading. There's no way. Oh crap, my phone's falling. <laughs> Come on. And now you're lying to me on my birthday of all days? <laughs> Amy is definitely me on my birthday. I believe the murderer used the train's controls to move Sonic from the conductor car to the dining car. Oh, thank you for posture check, Mochi. I fixed my back. I fixed my back. And lied to Amy, casting further blame on Shadow for no other reason than to cause doubt and confusion. Gonna head out for the night, see you, Mango. No worries, Mo Mochi, thank you for hanging out. Have a good night. Thank you for uh, giving me motivation. <laughs> when examining everyone's alibis, one clearly stands out as the weakest. I believe it's clear to everyone that it only could have been one person. It was you, Espio. <laughs> you were the one who murdered Sonic the Hedgehog. Hey guys, Sonic, you're okay. Sonic and uh was just about to solve the mystery. Espio was the murderer, right? Damn. Espio jumped me in the con conductor car. Dang it, you got me. A blow dart, though. Really? It's non-lethal poison. You'll just sleep for a while. Great. I could use an app. No, wait. There's something important. Espio left me there. Something important. I needed everyone to listen. The train's a bad nick. Sonic, are you feeling alright? Do you need to lie back down? No, we all need to get off this train. We're not safe. What? When I arrived at the conductor car, the conductor was already here. He was so excited to tell me all about the features of the train. But he was he was telling me I had a bad feeling. I asked to see the power source. The conductor hadn't even seen it. When we took a look, we realized the train's powered by a Flicky. A Flicky, the tiny animal? There's only one person twisted enough to use a Flicky as a power source. Damn, this is like a... There's so many twists, but this is just like that, uh, the movie, like, Snowpiercer. <laughs> it's like... They're just using, like, child labor to run a train. They're using animal labor. Dr. Eggman. I told the conductor the train needed to be destroyed. He refused. The way the conductor was describing it, it was more than a simple batnik. It's the conductor's friend. The train is his co-conductor. You're not serious. They uh, certainly didn't tell me that in the interview. Right, as we say, the flicky, I felt a sting in my arm. It was the blow dart from Espio. It's okay, Espio. You didn't know it, that was happening. Espio left. The lights in the room started to glow red. Hey, stop what you're doing. Oh no, they captured him! I knew something was wrong and stood up. The arm came for me next. I spin dashed right through the robot's arm, sliced it off the rail, and uh, what is it? Oh, I, I clicked too fast. <laughs> I know, it's Dr. Robotnik! Wow, I'm amazed he was able to do any of this poisoned. But another robot arm managed to grab me and pin me to the wall. Ah! The conductor screamed as the arm approached him, but I was hit quite a bit before it all got to me. Sorry, Sonic, I blocked your entire monologue. Oh no. Everyone, I have something to admit. I murdered Sonic the Hedgehog. Yeah, we already know that. 
the situation has gone so serious, why would no one not, uh, why would you not just tell us? I thought that's how the murder game worked. You shoot someone with a blow dart, they die. Are you crazy? It's just a make-believe game. No one should get hit with a blow dart. I was just following the rules. Use this blow dart on Sonic stationed in the conductor car. It is laced with a non-lethal sleeping agent. Thank you again for choosing Mirage Express Staff. <laughs> what is that? It says, uh, use this blow dart on Sonic Station and the conductor car is laced with a non-lethal sleeping aid. Why would you just use a random dart that someone left around? Thank you again for choosing the Mirage Express staff. What is this? Instructions? I was given the blow dart along with that card. It's signed staff. Who gave this to you? Come to think of it. One of the robotic arms handed it to me. Weapons shouldn't be allowed on the train. What is the larger picture here? Who instructed these arms attack? Who or what? Mangosine, who do you think attacked Sonic's and it's SPO the dart, blow dart? The train itself! I believe something's been orchestrated things behind the scenes. Something wanted Sonic out of the picture and for a good while, so I think the train itself is plotting something. First we learned the train's a batnik and now it's out to get us. Once again, you keep saying the most ridiculous nonsense. You're seriously convinced the train has it out to get us? I don't know what the train's full intent is, but clearly it's been tampering into our murder mystery game. Train, come out and show yourself. Amy, it's my birthday and I don't need you messing with it. Amy's hitting the wall with her hammer. I'm with you, Amy. This train can have it. <laughs> oh, yeah, there gotta be another way to get this train's attention. What was that? Of course. Oh, so I was right. It was. It was Dr. Robotnik. What did you two do? Is that the conductor? Mm -mm. Hey, I can get him down. Don't touch him. Is the train talking? Of course I can talk, you fools. Too distracted playing your little game to figure it out. We were right, weren't we? What are you plotting? I'm taking all of you to Eggman's base, where you will rot Eggman. After I deliver your annoying party right to this egg fortress, annoying, the conductor and I will be free to laugh and play games, ride the open rails like we always planned. Oh damn, the train's <laughs> the train's the bad guy. What are you? Enough. The train's picking up speed. Everyone grab something. Everyone hold on. Which one of these buttons turns off the train? Whoa, Sonic. Ha 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 ha. Stay put until we arrive. Goodbye. I can't keep my footing. Ah! I fell. I got an owie. Oh, a bunch of evidence has fallen out of my pockets. Oh, my head. Tails. Amy. Ah. Is anyone here? Hello? Is there any animals here? Hello? No need to yell, bud. Sonic, I'm sorry, are you okay? Hang in there. It seems the train's arm threw us back into the dining car. Where is everyone? A great question. But now, are you alright? Sonic the Hedgehog asking about me? <laughs> I feel terrible. I'm doing amazing. I feel terrible. Yeah, things aren't looking the brightest. But when the situation's dark, it's up to us to shine the way forward. Oh, Sonic, just as cool as everyone says. Let our... Let's get our bearings and take a look around. Good idea, lead the way. Oh man, what, what's wrong? The windows are all covered up now. I, uh, now I never got to look at the pretty views. Amy was saying the train's sights could have, could be beat. I was excited. After all we bought through, been through, I'm sure the train company will offer you some kind of coupon for another visit. That'd be great, as I don't know where my wallet is. The conductor and I found Vector's uh, ticket in the napkin holder. What was his ticket doing here? Maybe he confused a napkin for his ticket? His ticket for a napkin? I uh, hope his ticket didn't have ketchup stain. That yellow glow is chilling. I miss it when it was showing us the weather. Oh no! Well, that's better than yellow glow, I guess. It's the Eggman! Anyone there? Why is no one responding to me? I missed the yellow glow already. You've got some nerve showing up, Eggman. 
Ho oh, ho, you spiky blue pest. Seem you finally taken passage on one of my passenger trains. Hmm. You created this train? Who the heck are you? Don't talk to me. Ah, ignore that. They certainly don't didn't talk about you in my interview. My involvement isn't well known, civilian. The infrastructure in your own town you just wasn't cutting it. If I were to build Eggman land, these problems would need sorting out. So I cur courageously got involved. I converted some cargo trains into passenger trains for the sake of the public. It's just more useful for future schemes. Let me guess, another death egg, Dr. Predictable. The people fear giant spheres, it's science. <laughs> Let's cut to the chase, where are our friends? Judging by our security cameras, your pathetic friends are all locked in the cars they were stationed in. Seems you managed to make the train quite upset. Did you not know this was happening? Heavens, no, I only know uh, now getting caught up. I'm far too busy noticing what a passenger train is up to. You see, the cap capability of a Batnik is normally very basic. Just kill Sonic the Hedgehog. But for a luxury train, I wanted to be sure things ran without my supervision and report to me if any of you happened to be aboard. This train's capability of intellectual thought is extraordinary, a feat only accomplished by my genius. So this confirms that the train really is sentient. Sufficient to say, your capture is inevitable. You're on a train that desires nothing more than to deliver you all to me. See, I got to think it. I need to manufacture motivation beyond programming. I like to make my batnik completely against one another from time to time. It's good for productivity. So I instructed a bounty upon my army of Batniks. First to capture you pathetic creatures uh, gets a generous reward. The train wants to deliver us to Eggman for a reward? Most of my robots ask for something simply like my autograph or whatever, but highly intelligent train. It may ask for something more interesting. As much as I like reward programs, are you done blabbering, Doc? You can never just win silently, can you? When you're dragged by my base, you'll regret the day you ever crossed me, hedgehog. I already do. Get lost. Eh, <laughs> ciao. He always knows how to get under my skin. This is tough. The train has the motivation and being made by and being made by Eggman is no doubt powerful. Not to mention we're all separated. What am I supposed to think? The train purposely had Sonic knocked out so I it could deliver us to Eggman. This whole time we were all in danger and I went along with it. Sonic was really hurt. The conductor's been captured. Should I have been more assertive earlier? Oh, This is so sad. We, we couldn't have known. Oh, uh, I guess we should, we should have done more. Am I at fault here? I knew Sonic was hurt all along. I couldn't keep anyone safe. I knew Sonic was hurt all along. Hey. I can tell the sister isn't getting to you. Oh, hey, sorry, I... I get it. The road's getting tough. It's easy to question the decisions that you got up here. But when negative thoughts hit, you let it pass and keep living. I need you to hire, here helping me think through this before I do something rash. See, I'm one of those sleep before you think kind of guys. Haha, <laughs> okay, you're right. Let's keep moving forward and make things right. Ah, uh, breathe, okay. We gotta get to the conductor's car before the train arrives at Eggman's base. The doors have been heavily fortified. How do we get through? Um... Believe in yourself. No matter the obstacle, I know you have what it takes to figure it out. The entire day, Tails and I have been asking ourselves, what would Sonic do? So what would you do? What would I do? Well, I'd speed through head-on, rescue our friends by any means necessary. Here, stand back! Oh. Oh! He did! Wow, this one's big wind-up. Sonic Spin Dash was fast enough to get the door open. And now that the road's clear, nothing can stop us. Better hold on to your pants. I don't think we'll be getting another break after this. Ready to go? Uh, actually, give me a second. I'm good. Uh, I get it. Let me know when you're ready. Is there anything else we can look at? Hey, one of those robotics arms are here too. Wow, it swiped uh, at me. Best to leave it alone. The train's definitely mad at us. Good call. We gotta get out of here before the arm sweeps at us again. Hi, Chizu. Thank you for lurking. 
I guess there's nothing else on this train. I'm ready. Let's go, Sonic. To the conductor car. To the end of this mystery. Oh, mega intense. Oh no, not another one. Oh no. All right, our friends are locked in the cars up ahead. In our last adventure, maxing out my rings count gave me an extra boost of speed. If I could grab enough rings, I should be fast enough to bust through the next door too. Ready? Let's do this. All right, I'm trying, Sonic. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh fuck. Oh god. Okay, at least it's 50. <laughs> I know, great. I'm in Spain. I'm in Spain. Oh shit. Uh, I should have jumped for that. Oh fuck! What the hell? How do I... How do I get those? How do I get the bigger ones? What the hell? Oh shit! I meant to jump. Oh, I have to jump at those locations. Okay. Oh shit, I missed it again. Oh, I definitely have to hit like one of those, but how the hell? What the heck? Oh shit, I missed it again. Oh fuck! How would I get that? How big is my jump? Oh, I don't know if I can get that. Oh, I should've- shit, I should've hit the other one. Okay. Oh god. All right, we got one. Oh, fucking hell! Are you kidding me? All right, that's good. All right, we got 50. We just have to survive. Ooh, okay. That was good. Just wait till I see Eggman. I'm gonna clobber him. We gotta deal with the train first. Come on, let's go. Mm. All right, now we gotta do 55. Oh shit. Okay, good. Alright. You all came for us. Of course, but let's move. The train wants to take us prisoner and earn a reward. Cause he wants to he wants to stay with uh the guy forever. <laughs> My reward is to get off the stupid train. Let's go. Oh shit. I already fucked up. Oh shit. Oh fuck, I should've got that one. Oh shit! Alright, that's my fault. This one doesn't even have shit throwing at me and I'm already fucking up. Oh fuck. Alright, we, we gotta do that one over. Oh lordy lord. What are you- are you kidding me? Oh, I should've went for the middle one. Shit. Are you kidding me? Okay, we gotta do that again. <laughs> God damn it. Okay. So I think we have to get the middle one first when we jump, and then we'll get the one that's on the right. What the hell? Oh my god, please. Mm. 
middle. All right. No, I meant to jump. Okay. All right. All right. Good. 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 We got it. Sonic. It's about time. I thought you were supposed to be fast, Sonic. We gotta move. You two ready? Always. Let's boogie. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh shit! Fuck! Shit! Motherfucker. Oh shit. No! Are you fucking kidding me? This game is fun, but please release me from this hell. Your girl's gotta eat dinner. Motherfucker, yeah. Okay. They locked Amy and Tails in the conductor car. Say no more, let's go! Oh shit, I should've got them. Oh fuck, I should've jumped again! Alright, I might do this all over just because there, there's a lot of jumping ones. Okay, we'll do this one over. God damn it. <clears throat> oh, fuck, I meant to jump. Oh, shit, shit. Off by one, oh, Lord. Come on, sheesh. At least it's back to 55. It's not trying to make me do 70. I think I'd cry. Oh, I messed up. Oh crap, we might have to do this one over. Yeah, we'll have to do this one over. Please, I need to beat this train. No, I meant to- Are you kidding me? Come on! Oh god, alright, I messed up this one. It's only 55, why is it so hard? I'll have to do this one over. Oh my god. Dindin is within reach. Yeah. I'm gonna be having Dindin at friggin' midnight. Shit, shit, shit. Okay, good, 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 good. Sonic! Sonic, you're here! Hee <laughs> hee, there's no way to, uh, this is no way to treat the birthday girl. You're right, I'm ready to stop this train. Right, time to finish this. Oh god, please, let it end. We already found who killed Sonic. Excellent work trapping these pests, now hurry to me. I must properly dispose of them to begin my plans for Eggman Land and probably another Death Egg. What is it? Freaking Google or Bing lied to me saying that this game was like two hours, three hours long. I started stream at six. <laughs> Don't teleport us to the future. Don't turn us into robots. Don't. Mm. Ho ho ho. Haven't done that in a while. 
Maybe I will turn you all into robots to give uh, Sage some new toys to play with. Shut it, Eggman! Don't disappoint me, Train. Hurry it up. I will not fail. My wish will be granted. Your wish or you mean the bounty. I don't care what you call it. Just bring me those overgrown mammals. Yeah, well, I hope my dinner will be well, well deserved. I will be eating well tonight. I must get my wish. I will not fail. This is everyone. Uh, this is it, everyone. Get, uh, get ready. We're taking this thing down. Please, please be the last level. I beg of you. Oh shit, jump! Ah! Motherfucker. Oh. Can I jump on this train? Oh no, I can't. Oh shit, get it! I jumped too soon. Crap. Oh shit, shit, shit! Fuck! Oh fuck! Oh my god. Come on, it's only 65 rings. Oh, good, good. None of you could possibly understand. We promised to be together our whole lives. How could he just leave like it was nothing? Who do you mean? The conductor? He's retiring. You just have to accept that. My wish will keep us together forever. That's being, uh, that's what being friends is all about. You can't force someone to be friends with you. Oh, I clicked too fast. Shut up. Just shut up. Oh, fuck. Oh, fucking... Ball sack. Oh god. Oh shit. Oh fuck! We re oh my god, come on. Shit! 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 Fuck! What the fuck? Oh, thank goodness. Eggman, Eggman, can you hear me? Hello, I Sonic. Uh, I Sonic dead yet? <laughs> Sonic is not dead anymore. I'm at the end. Hi, Lara. Welcome in. I hope you're having a good Friday. It's... Um, if you don't want to be spoiled by the ending, I would say feel free to lurk. My wish, my wish, my wish. Make the conductor never leave me. Let us be friends forever. I kind of the kind of friend who would never leave each other. Why would he betray me? Oh shit! Seventy rings. Are you fucking kidding me? Oh shit. Fucking heck! Oh my god. Why am- why is it only like three rings? Oh god. Shit! Oh no 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 please 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 please. Shit shit. No! Four short! That's okay, I don't mind. I'm also playing Persona 3 at the same time too. That's true. I just wasn't sure if you ever planned on playing this game or not. But I hope you're having a good time with uh Persona 3, Lyra. <laughs> it's already it's already been hard enough to get a hold of you, and now it'll be even harder with Persona 3. But as long as long as you're happy, I'm happy. Oh fuck! All three! Oh my god! Come on! This this level is not as hard as the one that I was stuck on. This one this one is gives you more rings for compared to the other one. Shit. Oh fuck! That was my fault. Shit. 
Oh my god, that was my fault. Please, please, shit. Yeah, I will be MIA for foreseeable future, unfortunately. Oh, I'll miss you, Lyra. I hope we, we could still hang out soon or maybe like play Fortnite the days that you happen to be maybe taking just a short break from Persona. But I also know Persona is, is notably a long game from what I've heard. But I, I understand. I, I Maybe we could hang out during stream or something. Then again, I don't even know if you'll be streaming as well with how occupied you'll be. Oh shit! Fuck! No! You got this, bestie. You are a true gamer. Thank you, bestie. You also got this with Persona 3. Uh, I'm suffering right now. I've... I've been told that this game was like two to three hours and I've been streaming since six and I haven't had dinner yet. Oh shit. Shit. Fuck, fuck, fuck. No, you fucking biatch. No! I God, I'm always so close. Oh shit. Oh fuck, that was my fault. Shit. God. Oh my god, I keep moving too soon. Shit. Shit. No, god, that one, yeah, that one was not good. Whew. Thank you everyone who's lurking, I appreciate it. <laughs> god, come on. Shit, shit, oh my god. I was so close before, what happened? Oh my god, come on. <laughs> Please, why is it always when it's 70? so bad I'm not trying to be like be negative or have this negative energy for this but I'm just like please <sighs> fuck I miss so much rings Oh, thank you! God, on the dot. Conductor! You promised me. You promised. Let him speak. Unhand him. <laughs> thank you. Let's go! Train, stop this. When I told you we'd be with each other forever, I, I was much a, a much younger man. I'm getting old. I'm tired. Excuse you. Excuses. How dare you abandon me? I'll be lonely. So lonely. Why must you insist loneliness upon me? No, stop. What are you doing? To me 
Please don't make me do this. <laughs> we have to rescue the conductor if we have, want to stop this train. Oh god, I'm fighting the fucking train? 75? Oh god. Oh fuck, okay, I gotta- I gotta redo that. Oh shit. Shit, fuck. Shit, shit. Fuck! Shit. Oh my god, the bars are insane. How does anyone- Oh my god. How does anyone see that? Like, my eyes are like going crazy trying to keep up with that. This is insane. I was four away. I would have been pissed. Oh, poor Flicky. Oh, Flicky, this is just the lore card when my ex-best friend left detective work to join Dr. Eggman. So this really is a bat, Nick. The stakes rise every second, huh? We gotta save him. On it. Man, this is, uh, like Snowpiercer. Let's show our full power. Yay, the power of friendship! Please help me, please help me, my friends. Oh shit. Fuck! Oh, hi, Mia! <laughs> hi, Mia, thank you for the raid! Hello, everyone, welcome in! My name is Mangosteen Sweetie, I am a variety streamer, I play. Uh, shooting, adventure, <laughs> puzzles, choices matter, games. We are currently trying to figure out who murdered Sonic the Hedgehog. Um, and I'm dying. I'm just, uh, I'm just dying. Uh, thank you for the follow, Dad. Oh, God. Uh, if anyone doesn't want to be spoiled for the game, uh, this is the end, so feel free to lurk or, you know, if you gotta go, I understand. But thank you again, Mia, for the raid. I hope you had a good stream. Oh, shit. Make sure to rest and lurk. Over five hours stream. Let's just say this game was, uh... This game was advertised to me that it would be two to three hours, and now we're here. Oh, thank you. <laughs> thank you, Twink, Twink Bexen, for the gifted subs. Thank you so much. That's so kind of you. Much appreciated. Um, but yeah, uh, I thought I wanted this weekend to be chill. And, uh, I found, I saw on Google that this game was only, like, two to three hours. And I've been streaming since 6 p.m. So, here I am. Oh, shit. And, uh, I didn't, I haven't eaten dinner yet, so I feel bad. I feel bad. I'm a bit cranky. I'm a bit, I'm a bit hangry right now. But even, I feel like even if I wasn't hangry, that, uh, I'd also be just as mad with, uh, this game. Oh my god. Alright, I gotta throw this one. I know, Mia. I'm trying. I'm trying. Every time the game is about to end, I swear, I'm like, oh, this is it. I'm just gonna speed through it. This is the last level. I'm gonna speed through it. And, uh, I just haven't got to that point yet. Oh, fuck. You should take a break. Go eat. Okay. 
I know everyone's telling me to eat. All right, let me let me try this level one more time. I, I gotta throw this one because I wasn't paying attention. <laughs> I gotta throw this one. I'm trying to wait till I die. All right, let's let's try one more time. <laughs> so don't mind me as I'm trying to fuck as I'm trying to concentrate. Fucking bitch. Oh no, why is it so hard? Oh my god, and then all the flashing red is oh my god. How does anyone do this? Shit. Fuck. Oh fuck. No way you're supposed to get 85 coins from all that. No, they should make it longer. That's insane. Oh my god! How does anyone enjoy a Sonic game? Oh. oh my god, I... I can only get up to half. Thank you, Nat, for posture check. Oh my god, that's insane. How, how can anyone do this level? Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> that's that's the thing. <laughs> we don't. Oh my god, what the fuck? Oh my god. Speaking as a Sonic fan, I don't know. Guys, this is insane. Oh my god, what? How do I jump from one part of the map to the other? Shit. Oh my god. Shit. Fuck. There is no way you get 85 out of that. Oh no. <laughs> I'm sorry to hear about the jump scare. Oh god. But I hope everyone had a good Friday. And I hope you had bunches of fun with Mia. Thank you for keeping my sister company. Are you fucking kidding me? No, are you shitting me? Oh my god. Oh my god, this is insane. Oh my god. No! God, I'm so close. What the fuck? Oh my god. Oh my god, I know it's so You you missed it earlier. Uh <laughs> would you prefer I call you Twink or Bexon? <laughs> but um there was a level. It was so hard. I did it like 20 times and like there was one point where I was literally one ring short. It was awful. Oh my god. Oh my god, this is insane. All right, guys, we're gonna try. We're gonna try for another five minutes, and then I will take a break to have dinner because it has been a while. Because I I am near the end, so I'd rather just beat this game versus trying to do a two-parter. Oh my god, are you kidding me? So if anyone uh, is still sticking around by then, I could put on. Uh, words on stream or some other game? Here, we could do a little vote. If anyone wants to vote in the poll for the game that will be played while I go eat dinner, 
Uh, I'm just gonna microwave uh, some uh, Japanese curry that I made the other day. And then I'll just eat that and hang in chat until uh, I finish eating. Oh my god. I don't know any of these options. Uh, it's okay. So, Words on Stream is kind of like a word search game, like Boggle, uh, if you're familiar with that. Um, emote, I think Emote Shirts is one of the options I have, where you're searching for emotes. Galactic Phone is kind of like Pictionary, where you guess uh, the drawing on screen. Oh god. Okay, so we'll do Words on Stream. No worries. No worries. All right, we're gonna we're gonna take a little break, you guys. Oh God. Uh, how do I pause this? Okay. Oh my Lord, that is insane. Insane, insane. All right, I will be back real quick. Uh, I also have to put in the credentials credentials for that game. So, thank you everyone for your patience. Thank you again, Mia, for the raid. I will be right back.
Hello guys. I'm back from eating dinner. What the hell is a dogfish? <laughs> oh my lord, what is a dogfish? I need to like look this up. Is there like there's like a fish? Is there a fish called dogfish? I have returned, sweeties. Hello, hello. I hope you I hope everyone enjoyed the game of words on stream. It is a kind of fish? I'm gonna look on my phone. Dogfish. I guess like similar to like a catfish. Oh hey, there is a dogfish. Ooh, they look cool. Yeah. I wonder if there's like a rabbit fish. <laughs> I wonder why they call it a catfish and um a dogfish. Well maybe the catfish because uh they have like long whiskers. But hello, hello everyone. Once again, welcome in Shadow. It's good to see you. Oh god. So for those that were are just I <laughs> am mango fish, for those that are just tuning in, um we're playing uh The Murder of Sonic the Hedgehog. We are near the end, so if you don't want any spoilers, feel free to lurk. I really appreciate it. Um I have I have been lied to that this game I I searched on Google cuz I was trying to find like some quick calm games to play for the weekend and I was told that this game was Two to three hours. I started stream at six and it's almost midnight. <laughs> it has not ended. I mean, I am someone who is a slow reader, but either way, I am still stuck here. Sonic the Hedgehog is grabbing me by my ankles and will not let me leave. Uh, I, I pushed off I pushed off eating dinner because I was like, oh, Oh, wait, I always d double the time to uh, I see on Google because I know myself. Thank you, Lyra, for that new advice now. <laughs> maybe, maybe for speedrunners. But I was just like, oh, like this will be a quick, fun game to play with stream. Yeah, ha ha ha. Uh, no. 
Not at all. I'm still here. I'm still here. And not in, like, the cool, like, you know, pla Treasure Planet song wick kind of way. I'm stuck here. Sonic the Hedgehog grabs me, has me by the ankles. I'm trapped. Das get there. Save me. <laughs> but anyways, I hope everyone, everyone had fun with words on stream. I really like games, like, uh, I like puzzles and board games. So those are some games that I'll be, uh, you know, I'll have around stream sometimes, like when I am running off to go eat dinner and stuff, uh, just to keep chat entertained, you know, um, why are we still here just to suffer? <laughs> yeah, exactly, Nat. Uh, I'm gonna go EP. No worries, Bexon. Yeah, see you next time. Thank you for lurking. Make sure to sleep well. Thank you again for the subs. The gifted subs. Alright, let's get it going. Let's get this started so I can hopefully end my suffering and sleep. <laughs> Not even sleep, just because I had a late dinner, but just to, just to kind of relax. I will, uh... I will graciously, um, give myself a piece of candy. So, I'm gonna be chewing on that. Let's consume. <laughs> consume. Let's resume. Motherfucker! Motherfucker, what the hell? How do I dodge everything? Like... Oh my god! Almost really close. Yeah, I, I hate I hate when I get close like uh, Getting close is like a pain like it's like such a tease like it, it breaks my soul Oh my god Oh my god, do I just have to not jump when those things come at me? Thank you, Shadow. Oh my lord. Crap. Shit. Shit, motherfuck. Okay, that, that wasn't a good run. Oh, yeah, this one's bad. All right, we gotta dip that one. Oh, God. Oh, fuck! Shit! My bad, I... <laughs> I was trying to reach out at that time. Are you kidding me? Oh my god. <laughs> Eminence and Shadow? It's a cool anime you should watch? Eminence and Shadow? What is it about? It may be a bit difficult just because, um, I do like anime, it's just, uh, I haven't watched anime in a long time. I'm a fake anime fan. <laughs> Motherfucker! I know, 
Lyra. I'm so sorry. We still need to watch the other... Because we're on episode 5, right, Lyra? We need to watch the other 5 or 6 episodes together. I mean, Lyra, we still need to... We still need to watch Marry My Husband together. You're still on episode... You need to watch episode 8. Me, Rian, Mia, we're waiting for you. We were waiting for you. Oh, shit. Fuck. I will stop Persona 3 even? Oh my god, Lyra. <laughs> I see I see that your love of Trigon is bigger than your love of Persona. <laughs> You're like, everyone needs to know my my girl, my baby girl. Motherfucker. Jump! Motherfucker! Jump, jump! Jump, jump. Yes! Let's go! Let's go, gamers! Let's go! <laughs> oh, fuck this fucking train! Bash is my ultimate favorite girl. Lyra, when are you- when are you gonna get caught up with Mary, my husband? <laughs> Praise the sun. Oh god, please- please release me from this hell that is Sonic the Hedgehog. Your happiness comes at the expense of others. Last I checked, that's called being selfish. Me? Selfish? How dare you? Oh fuck, a hundred? No, fucking hell. Are you shitting me? Oh my god! How is anyone gonna get a hundred? Oh god. Oh my god, I meant to try to jump that. Thank you, Shadow. <laughs> Thank you, everyone. Thank you, everyone, for your support. Fuck. Oh, yeah, yeah. I am gaming, sis. I'm gaming. I'm a gamer. Oh, fuck. All right, I need to redo that one. Shit. I know it won't end. How long before I finish this game? Oh fuck, I didn't mean to move that close. Oh my god, how do like iPad kids do that running game? Oh shit! With the power of friendship, anything is possible. <laughs> I hope so, Gray, I hope so. Your energy helped me with the other round, so let's see if it helps me with this one. short god if i didn't hit those i would have got it probably <laughs> put your hands up and they stay there and they stay there up down up down oh motherfucker shit fuck shit fucking heck Please leave me alone! I want to live! No, oh my god. You have the power of God and anime on your side. You can do it. Oh, god, please. God and anime, save me. Shit, I meant to jump. Kidding me? Oh my god. There is no way. What the fuck? Who green lighted this? Who green lit this level? Who green lit any of this game? 
What the fuck? Shit, I didn't mean to do that. Shit. Oh my god, I meant to jump! No, oh my god. It's always like 20 short. If I didn't get hit. Oh my god. Come on, please. Oh, I keep... Uh, I keep zigzagging and I don't mean to. Shit. Alright, that one was a bad run. I gotta toss it. I gotta toss it. Whew. Are you fucking kidding me, you stupid hand? Oh my god. Hush. How is... There is no, like, diff- <laughs> There's no difficulty setting on this, and like... How can I... How would someone who doesn't even play games as much as me be able to play this? Oh my lord. I feel bad for anyone who's played this game. Oh my god, really? Come on, come on. Shit. Shit, shit, shit. No! Oh my god. Oh my god. Please. End my suffering! <laughs> Context, I've only ever played like old school Sonic games. Uh, I played Sonic Adventure 2 Battle. I've played Sonic Heroes. Um, I played Sonic Riders, and now I've played this. <laughs> Thank you, Gray, for the confirmation. This is fucking hell. Alright, I gotta toss that one. I fucked it up. Some special stages, maybe? I getcha. Oh god. This was, this was, you know, this was a really good game with a nice story and had very cute characters and, you know, they were, they were all happy and they celebrating Amy's birthday, who's my favorite character. And now it's just, I'm just so, I'm so angry, I'm so angry. Oh my god. So I'm sorry everyone for being like negative and frustrated. I'm trying. I'm really trying. Are you kidding me? Shit. Shit. Motherfuck. Shit. No, I didn't mean to hit that. Oh my god. And it's always just falling short. <sighs> nah, you have every right, in my opinion. It looks difficult to keep track. <laughs> oh, thought. Oh, fucking heck. Thank you, Gray. Like, I, I know. <laughs> I know naturally I, I curse a lot. And typically, I don't get... I don't get so frustrated with games. But... Oh, God. I think it's also a mix of, like, you know, just being hangry you know, having this perception that this game was, like, chill and short, and then I'm just, you know, frustrating here. Uh... uh shit. You know, and I, I don't wanna- I don't wanna come off that way. 
when you know I've had people come and raid and I appreciate it you know I want I want everyone to have fun and see me get the W I don't want to I don't want them to like see me suffering oh my god but thank you everyone for lurking Anyone dodge that? That is insane. Thank you, Okami. <laughs> jump, jump, right, forward, right, sharp, left, jump, zigzag, jump, don't jump, bounce, stick, middle, <laughs> and stick there. Oh, thank you, Dad. Oh my god, I know. Oh. No! Take that, you stupid train! Take that, you motherfucker! Yeah! <laughs> that helped me with all this strat. <laughs> uh. Welcome back, Azul! Yay, we saved, we saved the bird from labor. Azul, we reached the end. Oh god. I can't tell which was harder, the level that was before this one or the one that I was stuck on for a while. Time to pay for ruining my birthday! Beat the shit out of Amy! God, this was suffering. But it was fun, but god. Jesus, crispy cripes. This game was so fun. It's fun and hard. I don't know how you did it, Azul. Oh, this is really cute. I love the final boss. I did not. I'm suffering. I did it. I did it, guys. I did it. Oh, I did it. Ah. Thank you for the clap. The train is slowing down. Great hit, Amy. Hehe, <laughs> it was pretty great, wasn't it? That's what you get when you mess with my special day. Honestly, same, Amy. I'd be the same. Okay, to be fair, I platinum games. Azul, you're crazy. <laughs> thank you, thank you, thank you, everyone. Thank you. <laughs> I love everyone's drip, though. Everyone's drip is very cute. Lyra, who are your favorite characters? Or anyone, who's your favorite Sonic characters? Mine are in order. I like Amy. I like Shadow. I like uh, Cream. I like Knuckles. And I like Rouge. And then Sonic's is thrown in there somewhere. Thank you for head pats. I needed it after such a long time. I... I just... Z couldn't bear to see you go. I'm sorry z for the trouble. Damn, the train's fucking dead. I think our work here is done. Now let's get off this thing. I think our- oh. Oh, thank you. Goodbye, my friend. I may be leaving the rails, but I assure you, I'll never forget our time together. Oh my god, so sad and insane. It's you dang train! It is a pretty train, though. We did it! Well, I say I've never been on a train like that before. This universe has a unique way of doing things. Watch your step, watch your step. Knuckles, then Sonic, then Amy, then Twin Tail. Nice, nice. It's over. The mystery of Sonic the Hedgehog's murder is officially over. Maybe next birthday we'll ask Vanilla to make dinner. Oh, you don't love parties where by the end someone tries to kill you? I think I'm actually gonna miss this group of un <laughs> uh, group's unhinged ways of thinking. Oh, honey, you're late. I've been waiting here for hours. Oh, such so cute. Ha 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 ha. Uh, you'd honestly never believe what happened, so I won't even try. Ha 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 ha. I'm just glad you're here. Quick, 
We leave for Spagno Spagonia in the morning and you need to pack. I'll pack faster than the wind. I need this vacation. Some, uh, so something terrible. And I need you home. Happy first of retirement day, uh, dear. Seems the conductor is more than ready to begin his retirement after his ordeal. So cute, so very cute. I'm happy for them both. Oh, who's this? Fa ha ha ha. An old friend, I think. Well, they're cutie, that's for sure. Cheep, cheep, cheep. Seems that Flicky found a friend. Great job saving the little guy, Espio. It was the least I could do, Sonic. Uh, everyone, I sincerely apologize for the trouble I caused. Don't be, you were just following what you thought was the game. The show Sonic Boom and Uganda Knuckles meme, do you know the way? Raise Knuckles to the top for me. I always wanted to try to watch Sonic Boom. I just like seeing the clips, they crack me up. But I don't know about that meme. <laughs> It's hard to know what I would have done in the same situation. I wouldn't have hit someone with a blow dart. Seriously, a dart? It would have been hard to get close to you, otherwise, Mr. Speed of Sound. Roll on the speed of sound. Don't you sound to talk around. Caught herself a situation. Stuck in a new location without any explanation. No time for relaxation. <laughs> go, 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 don't think, I don't blink. I just go, 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 go. <laughs> Knuckles is cool as hat because he has a hat and Lego sho shoes. Knuckles is cool because he has a hat and Lego shoes. And that he can, like, he does what, the pumpkin wrap or whatever? <laughs> no time for relaxation. Regardless, I'm sorry. We're cool now, and that we're all safe. It was fun. This group has a wild idea of fun. Boy, am I starving. Forget we never ate. With all the clatter, I completely forgot I was hungry. Me too. I was distracted, playing detective. If only you could have seen me, Sonic. I was finding clues, presenting evidence, poking holes in alibis. Sonic, wait, where'd he go? Everyone, guess what? The station has a bakery, and look what I bought. Oh, look at Amy's cake. It's so cute. That's adorable. I would love to, like, recreate that cake, like, in the future. Like, if I make a video or, like, a YouTube video, I would love to do that. Ah, birthday cake. Happy birthday, Amy. To the confident, unshakable, and radiant Amy Rose. To an adventure of a birthday, uh, of a birthday, darling. A memorable party every year. To a fun birthday. A ride from start to finish. May our friendship grow stronger each celebration. I admire your tenacity. May you never lose your vivacity. Happy birthday to Amy and her sparkling person personacity. <laughs> Happy birthday. I'm not sure enough to know if her personacity is a word. We love you, Amy. Happy birthday. Oh, this is adorable. Oh, you guys. It's an old video and a bit loud if anyone is interested in the meme. Oh, I'm sorry, Nat. I don't... <laughs> uh, I don't allow links in chat just for safety. But, um... If anyone is interested in joining the Discord... Here's a link if you'd like to share the meme to everyone in videos. <laughs> yeah, but feel free to join and share. Uh... Ah, you guys! We almost got murdered by a lonely train, but... But... I wouldn't trade these adventures for anything. Never in a million years. You guys won't ever leave me, right? Wouldn't dream of it. I like how the chow bodyguard in the middle with the stash is there. Now let's have some cake. Yes, please. Dig in, everyone. Yay! I hope it's chocolate. I do hope it's chocolate. Man, after this... I want some fucking cake. <laughs> oh my god! Who? <laughs> Look at them! It's metal! Yeah, great! I didn't think he was in this game! Look at them! Let's go, Dad! <laughs> it's your dude, Gray! It's your dude! It's your boy! Uh, that's adorable! 
That train's never making it here, is it? Orbot, prepare a bath. The happy rubber duck or the angry one? Angry! Sour choice, your evilness. Shut it! Oh my god, so cute. <laughs> and that's my story of when I met Sonic and his friends. Entangled in their lives for a fleeting moment and then back to things as they were. Cities realized Eggman was running the train system and fought back to seize control. Everything squeaky clean now. As for me, I... Hmm... Did I quit my job or stuck to the gig? I say stick to the gig. I think, you know, I think I did a good job. And then... I... Oh, if only one million's in the lottery. I, I wish. I'm clicking one million's in the lottery. Post it in the Discord meme room. I'll look at the rules now. Thank you, Dad. And after all that, I... Managed to fly to space, run a local supermarket? Uh, I'll run a local supermarket. Yeah, that's just been my life. Oh my god. Thank you. <laughs> the game is over. After so long. Thank you, thank you. Oh. Oh god. I know I'm finally free from the shackles of hell of Sonic the Hedgehog. <laughs> I was- thank you everyone, thank you. Oh god, that was- that was insane. But, you know, like I said, a fun ride. I, you know, as- as discouraged I got at certain times, I'm happy to, you know, persevere and work through it. And, you know, I've accomplished beating the game. Thank you, Dad! <laughs> Thank you, Nat, for the bits! Oh, that's so kind of you, Nat. Thank you! Mango, you're a pretty cool streamer. I think I'll follow you. Thank you for following, Gray. I, I hope you enjoyed your time here. Thank you for your, your support ever since you got here. <laughs> thank you for the follow. Oh, and thank you for subbing, Nat. So kind. Thank you, thank you. <laughs> All right, we we will go and uh, switch to just to talk. Just uh, why am I saying just to talking? What is English? <laughs> uh, where is it? Where is it? Oh, I met him in the corner. <laughs> I'll zoom in a bit. Uh, and we'll quit the game. Uh, I'm trying to scroll through the credits. Hello! Scrolling through the credits. Actually, let me switch back to the game real quick, just in case there's like an ending scene. Alright, I'm trying to scroll. Scroll, 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 scroll. Is- can I use the enter button? Or am I just clicking? Thank you everyone for your work. Please bring me to the main menu. Or if there's a secret deleted scene, please show me. I would really like to see um, Amy and Shadow at the, the the Hot Honey concert. Scroll, 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 scroll. Onegai shimas. <laughs> I guess while we're waiting for the credits, I'm just gonna nom on a piece of candy. But what's been what's everyone been up to today? Hmm. Oh, thank God. Okay, we're at the menu now, right? <laughs> we're good at just chatting. Sorry, I stuck a piece of candy in my mouth. Hmm. I've timestamped a video for my boss, and I was playing Persona 3 Reloaded. Oh! You're playing Persona 3 like Lyra is. It's morning right now. Oh, it's morning for you? What time is it for you, Nat, if you don't mind me asking? And, you know, stream. Did you also stream? <laughs> you know what I've been up to? Lyra has also been up to Persona 3. Grinding Reverse 1999. Oh, cool. I know Mia's playing that game. It looks really pretty when I saw the trailer for it on Instagram or the ad. 
I want to play, but typically games like that aren't my thing. But I, I appreciate the art. What a cute layout. Thank you, thank you. The overlay is from Etsy. And the background, I did myself. Uh, the, the, the one I'm in right now with the purple, pink, and green faded hearts. I do stream, but my streams are not the usual thing. I hope you had fun streaming, Azul. What did you stream? You like free, uh, free choice games, right? Um, is that like choice-based games? I like games like, uh, Life is Strange, The Quarry, um, yeah, like games where you get to make choices. I like those games. Sorry. <laughs> I'm still chewing on my candy. <laughs> I don't mean to talk with my mouthful. I'm trying to finish it fast. I have two game suggestions. I don't know if you played the Stanley Parabola. Ding Dong Dead. I'll write those down. Where's my pen? Stanley Parabola. Parable. And ding dong. Dead. I'll look those up. Thank you for the suggestion, Nat. Have you ever played Mass Effect? I've always, I've heard about Mass Effect. Uh, right now I'm streaming a blind run of like a dragon, infinite wealth, but I normally stream practice runs for my 100% walkthroughs. Oh, I get you, I get you. I know a lot of people are happy about the new Yakuza game, right? That's, that's the Yakuza game? The Stanley Par Parable is parable is a mass massive game and it's on steam 20 plus ending 20 plus endings that's insane mass effect one of my favorite game se series ever oh i'm glad everyone can bond over you know mass effect and over persona and stuff i imagine they're really good games <laughs> all right everyone without further ado thank you everyone who tuned in today Thank you, the, uh, Bijou, and thank you, Mia, for the raids. I, I have a feeling they're either lurking or they went off to bed, but because since it's pretty late, or they're just chilling, which is totally, totally fine. Uh, thank you, everyone that stopped by. Thank you, everyone that followed. Um, thank you again, um, Bexen, for the subs, gifted subs. Thank you, Nat, for the bits. Um, you know, when, well, if you came in from Bijou's raid or from, um, Mia's raid, I really appreciate it. I hope everyone has a good night, a good morning, oh, I'm freezing, and a good afternoon. Oh, Ace, were you lurking this whole time? Thank you, thank you, Ace, for lurking. Thank you, everyone. Yeah, thank you, everyone, for lurking and hanging out and uh, keeping me company through this uh, very inter interesting, rough stream. Um, Tomorrow will hopefully be better. I, I hope, I pray, it'll be, I think it'll be loads better. So... Tono tomorrow will be actually a later stream versus me streaming at 6, but tomorrow is Fortnite, Dead by Daylight, and maybe Texas Chainsaw Massacre? Um, I'm trying to decide if I'm gonna play with my friends or if I'm gonna make it like a followers only or like, um, a community kind of thing. But for now, you know, if you happen to have those games, I say, you know, download them just in case if I open the lobbies. <laughs> so if you want to join me for Fortnite, uh, Dead by Daylight, Texas Chainsaw Massacre in the future. And uh, that will be at 9 p.m. EST, 8 p.m. CST, uh, 6 p.m. PST. <laughs> and then uh, tomorrow, uh, Sunday, the same time, I will be streaming uh, Love is All Around, which is... Um, a dating sim game so hopefully more relaxing than today <laughs> uh, all right let's see let's see who we can raid have a good night everyone let's see let me see who i want to oh my sister so my sister rian is having her i think her three-year anniversary of streaming right now so let's go to her before she ends i hope she's not ending wait i gotta open her stream I hope she's not going to bed soon. She she usually stays up, so uh, hopefully she's not going to bed yet. Uh, she started 30 minutes ago. 
All right, good, good, good. All right. Uh, make sure everyone to tell my sister Rianne that I said hi. I will be a little tired, so just let her know the suffering I've been through. Um, I don't have yeah, Mr. Worldwide. I don't have a raid command, but feel free to you know say Mangle Raid for now or a Sweet Raid. I I'll make the raid command in the future. <laughs> but I hope everyone has a good night and see you then. Ta-ta, bye-bye. <laughs>